It couldn't be easier to watch Hobby Maker. You can join us on Sky, Freeview, on our website or on YouTube. So you can watch at home or on the go. When you purchase anything on Hobby Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee, meaning that you can shop with confidence. Happy shopping with Hobby Maker! Hobby Maker are proud to work alongside some of the biggest brands in the industry. Keep watching for these brands and many more here on Hobby Maker. Our call centre is based in the UK and available 24-7. Just call 0800 001 4433 or email help at hobbymaker.co.uk. Never miss a show by watching On The Go with our brand new Hobbymaker app. Head over to your app store now and search Hobby Maker and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favourite presenters and guests. Click on the Today's button to shop all of the products that are featured in today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's best sellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click the schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking here for our social media pages. So never miss a show by watching On The Go with our brand new Hobby Maker app. It is indeed hunky dory time, and we've not seen Becca for about three weeks. Welcome yeah, back, hello. Has, thank you. All right. It's been too long. It's been too long, but yeah. glad you're back today. Thanks. Um, Natalie was here yesterday. We had great she shows was. with Natalie. Now, Becca is bringing us something that I know you're going to be interested in. If many of you, I know, went for the circle and the rectangular, lace nesting dies. Now we did those about three, four weeks? Yeah, well, uh, no, in fact, it was longer than that. Was I want to say, yeah, it was May, May. May. I oh, know, blimey. time flies. Okay. <laughs> so months, months ago. So yeah, they were the only ones that were on uh, release at the time, the rectangular and the circle. They're in the show as well, but I know loads of you bought them then. We had a great deal on them. So maybe you've already ordered those in the past and you'd like to go for the next shape Yes. Availability. We've got the squares, which is always one of the most popular, and we've got the ovals as well. Brand new today. So if you went for the um, if you went for the rectangular and the circular earlier on, I'm sure you love the results you get mm. from those. Why not add the ovals and the squares to your collection Absolutely. today? Absolutely, they're so fancy and elegant, aren't they? They're gorgeous, aren't they? Look at if I show you the board here. Look at these. Yeah, absolutely. So they are nesting dies, as you can see. So yep. that just means obviously they nest. So they go from the largest one all the way down to the smallest one. Look how cute that little square is. Absolutely. I mean, and they you can make... use them as frames, obviously, like yeah. here. You can cut apertures with them. You, you can, can use them in all sorts of ways. A little easel card there, which yeah. is really lovely. Little books, memory books, maybe. Yeah, of course. Look how cute that is. They make, they make great picture frames. Great picture frames. Yeah, because they've got that like nice lacy edge. So you just make them a bit more exciting, a bit more fun. If you like that verse, by the way, that's in the show coming yes, up it soon is. as well. <laughs> so they are just gorgeous. I mean, this one is a bit of a... 
a twist. Oh, I love this one. Make your own pumpkins. How cute is that? How's that been done? The two ovals or something? Yeah, uh, so it's actually three. three yeah. Ovals. So you put one on the left and the right and then a centre one. Wow. So cute. And the frilly outline around them are, they're just gorgeous. They Absolutely. really, really are so graceful, so elegant. Oh, that. look at that. I think nesting dies is some of the most versatile dies you can buy. Easily, absolutely. And because they have got this lace edge, you know, it just it just adds to the overall feel of them and the look of them. Again, you know, you can cut squares and rectangles on your trimmer, but yeah. not ones with this fancy. No. Impossible. Ab absolutely impossible, yeah, you, of course. You definitely need a die to do this amount of intricacy. The, yeah. the detail in the edge is beautiful. Yeah, you've probably got straight-sided nesting dies, but have you got nesting dies that have got this amount of decoration? I know. They're so, so fancy. So, should be $39.98. Now, we are going to match the price that we did the rectangles and the circles back in May. You're looking at 17.49 per set, which for nesting dies of this intricacy yes. is unheard of value for money. It really is fantastic. So you get your very versatile squares, which funny enough become diamonds as well. Uh, yes, they do. Absolutely. Yep, of course. Quarter turn, you've got a diamond. So real, real value for money. And then the ovals. To try and cut an oval is it virtually impossible unless you've got a very, very accurate, precise die to do it for you. <laughs> no, most people don't have no. that. <laughs> but if you've got the ones already, the circulars and the rectangulars, add the ovals and the squares. It's the first time you've mm. seen them today. They're here and they're only £34.98. And, and the first two were so successful, were so, so busy. You get six dies in the squares and you've got one, two, three, four, five in the ovals. And you get a lot of metal for your money. I mean, look at the sides of them. Look at those. They are absolute showstoppers, aren't they? Yeah. I mean, the largest one is 14.2 centimetres square. The smallest one is three and a half centimetres mm. square. OK. The ovals, let's show you the ovals quickly. You can use them portrait. You can use them landscape. Yeah, cool. Largest one is 17.3 centimetres by 12.2. Yeah. And the smallest oval is eight centimetres by three Six. Absolutely. They are here today at a great launch price, $34.98, one PMP, $3.95 for the day. If you bought something in the last uh, Crafters Companion show, the rest of the day is PMP free. Um, it's free to order on the website as well, hobbymaker.co.uk, or use the app. Have you got the app yet? I have, yeah. It's, it? it's ace. I yeah. love it. Yeah. And as soon as you tap the app and go and look at Hobby Maker, the, the program comes up. It's just so, so cool. It's so easy. Brilliant. $34.98 for both of them. Uh, we have also got a brand new bundle for you, which is just below these, which are these new sentiments. Now, these are great. They're big. These yes. are centerpiece sentiments. They are. Statements, they, they? they really are statement pieces, absolutely. Look, Look at, these. at those. Well, I bet you haven't got these in your collection at the moment. Sending smiles, precious memories, and be your own kind of beautiful. That's so pretty whether they're in the front of the card, whether they're in a frame, whether yeah. they're in the middle of the card when you open it up, it's entirely up to you. Love the fonts. They're the typography, cheerful. the fonts is, stu I love it, absolutely love it. And you saw some of them on those yeah. cards I showed you a few of minutes course. ago. Be your own kind of beautiful. Yeah, that's so pretty. There we go. Precious memories, so a little memory book, a little photo book possibly, drop shadow going on there with the precious memories, love it. And then sending smiles on the inside. Yeah, that's it, exactly. Look how they've all been used. Every single one of those has been used in that little memory book. It's so cute. Terrific. Yeah. Okay. Well, those are the two highlights of the show so far then. Remember, if you go for all three of them, they should be $9.99 each. $29.97. But we do deals at uh, Hobby Maker, don't we? No messing. We're just getting those arrows on. We're going to get that price down. $22.47 for all three big major sentiments, Absolutely. 7 49 each. That is amazing, absolutely amazing. I mean, you just can't pay £7.49 for a die that size. No. Oh, <laughs> good luck what is to this? Find I know, <laughs> so much metal for your money in there. So you've got all three, separate packaging, Twenty two forty seven is the deal price today, and it is ITHD 84. ITHD 84 for all three, very different. You can snip into them as well if you want to kind of move the words around a little bit. They are snippable, but uh, I just think they're lovely. Okay, so lots of you coming in for the nesting dies, loads of you coming in for the sentiments as well. Brand new from Hunky 
enjoy this afternoon. Okay. Right. We're getting into the first demo. Over to you. Okay. So I'm going to sneak in a little bit of our papers that we had on yesterday with Nat. I yep. know they were really, really popular. And I know they are still available when I checked this morning. Um, so we've got the... Yeah, we've got these. We'll show them properly after the demo as well. Fair so enough. don't yeah, worry, you're not going to be missing out. So we're going with this amazing denim, denim print paper. Who knew? Isn't that just the coolest you thing ever? You need it in your life. You really do need it in your life. Absolutely. Just like your favourite pair of jeans. Yep. <laughs> um, so we're just going to cut some mats and layers out and then we're going to grab the leftover bits. I'm going to do some die cutting with these. I've done quite a lot ahead of time, but we will definitely show you a little bit of die cutting from start to finish. So we're going to grab our little squares and we're just going to just cut some, just some nice sizes. Let's just see how... So we're just going to get some low tack tape to just hold these in place, just very, very gently. Now, if you just want the squares on their own, you can buy them on their own. If you're not into the ovals, they're 19 99 But of course, the best saving is to go for the two together. That's what you're Oh, 100%. Well. And I think they're just such generic... I say generic. They're such basic shapes, but we've took basic shapes. With and the hunky-dory twist. The hunky-dory twist. We've yep. took them to another level. Yep. Absolutely. Yes, we have. Um, yeah, we, we love, love, love our Moonstone dies back at Hunky Dory. Let's just cut that down a little bit and then I can squeeze it all through, ideally in one pass of the die cutting machine. So we'll just snip that off and then again, I'll just put that to one side. So let's grab these now. So we've got our bottom plate there and we'll just pop our magnetic one just there. So I'm just going to pop these just on the cutting plate, just on the bottom there. I mean, I'm, I'm sure you probably know this anyway, but they will work in any die cutting machine. They will, yeah. Whether you've got yeah. the Gemporia one, whether you've got the Gemini 2, whether you've got any mate, it doesn't matter. They're going to work in all of Absolutely. Them. And I'm pretty sure that um, they'll work in like, obviously, the nesting dies. So it depends on which size you're using, but they'll work in your medium and your mini machines. Mm -hmm absolutely perfectly so we're just going to run that through now and obviously we are cutting paper so it's nice and delicate nice and nice and lightweight so it should be absolutely fine with just the one pass um, but obviously you can cut this from anything we've had so many examples used perfect so we can already see that that's cut absolutely beautiful look at the definition on this absolutely and you're checking out you're loving oh. new, new nesting New nesting shapes, 10% already not gone. I'm surprised. Oh, look how perfectly these have cut out. One pass of the machine. Oh, they've behaved beautifully. Okay, so let's get these made into a card. So much detail on, of, on these. Right, so let's grab our mats and layers here. Mm -hmm. And then I think I'm gonna go in with these ones. So let's just cut this down. Let me just see how big my white piece of cardstock is. And the Hunky Dory trimmer is in stock it on the uh, on the website. Also, the trimmer blades are in stock as well if you're running out of those or need some new ones. Absolutely. I'm just going to cut a quarter of an inch off my smaller mat and layer. So that's seven and three quarters at the moment. And then... Perfect. Okay, so let's get some tape on these mats and layers mm -hmm. and then we can bring all of our gorgeous lace squares back in. So... We'll just get three pieces of our tape on. Double-sided tape is perfect for this job, so. Oh my goodness. I, I love it, it's great, isn't it? You just peel, peel it away with your poker tool. And also, using paper, it's gonna cut down the cost of postage as well. Absolutely, it keeps it so nice and light, doesn't it? 100%. Loads of you coming in for the uh, nesting dies, the new ones, oh, adding them perfect. to the collection. Hi, John in Hampshire, Richard in Rugby, Judy in Lancashire, Wendy in Buckinghamshire, Dawn, Julie, Rosemary, Crafter in Hampshire, all coming through. Perfect. You, and you're going to love them. You are going to use them time and time again for any card, any occasion. And they're you know, different. They are different, absolutely. You know, and they've obviously got that lace detail they're perfect for absolutely any occasion, aren't they? Okay. Yeah, they're just so versatile, aren't they? Absolutely. So whether it's apertures that you're cutting out, yeah. frames that you're making. Absolutely. So mats. I'm just going to see where we're at with this. So... I think I'm going to layer... So these are some of the bigger layers that we've got. I've done these ahead of time. Okay. So let's just see if I can remember how we laid these out. I've got some more patterns. So I've got this polka dot and this stripey one. It's a little bit like patchwork. That, well, that's what I thought. That's mm. what it reminded me of. And I knew that we were launching this denim pattern. So I was like, oh, my goodness, this is going to look incredible. 
as like a sort of lay, laying out card. It's the fanciest patterns of, pat, uh, of denim ever. Let's do that. Let's do that. Okay. That's my layout. Good Done. So we need some foam pads. Oh, definitely. Double denim. Double denim. Is a thing. Double denim. Absolutely. It's a little bit of us. Um, okay, so let's get some foam pads onto these. So we'll just get lots and lots on. Nearly 30% of these dyes have gone in 15 minutes. Oh wow. my goodness. Get them in your basket. Absolutely. You we don't want to miss out We've still got stock, by the way, of the circles and the rectangles from the previous show in yeah. May. If you want those, they're on the website, I think, as well. Maybe yeah, all absolutely. of them. Yeah, absolutely. Maybe, you've, you know, didn't catch us back in May. Like, get them, get them now. Okay, so we need a foam pad strip all the way down there. So we'll just put that one on here. We kind of don't need loads on this because then it's going to raise it up too much. So we're going to put one on this corner as well here. And then that'll sort of bridge across there. So if we put that here, oh my goodness, there we go. Struggling to get everything in place there. And then again, we can put these ones on with some nice chunky foam pads. Mm -hmm. Just watching it build up, come to life. Obviously, if you've got anything that looks like, you know, fabric in your stash, maybe you've got some, you know, favorite colors or the leather pack would go great with that that we launched yesterday as well. Yep. I'll, go, I'll go through all those papers for you soon. The yeah, uh, course, essential paper packs, they're brilliant. And um, I know at the weekends, we have different viewers to people who watch us during the weekdays. So yeah, you absolutely. couldn't watch yesterday. Absolutely, yeah. And it's, you know, these deserve a second showing, don't oh, yeah. they? I mean, totally. they're just ace. So we're going to just stick those onto here with, again, just a bit of dimension, a little bit of added height on here. And then we're going to pop our sentiment on there as well. Okay. There's just something really satisfying about working with a, a denim look. I know. And yeah. just playing with these dies, building them up, just watching it kind of all come together. I don't need that one. Well, if you struggle to do cards for certain age groups of people in the family or, or you get asked to make cards yeah. for teenagers and stuff like that, there's very few options you've got. Denim, you can't go wrong with. Absolutely. This is it. And this could be so great for any age. Big 30 for a sort of 90s, like you say, double denim. Yeah. I know, yeah, I'm... Um, I'm turning 30 next year. Are you? Yeah. You're a baby. I'm very excited. Um. <laughs> I didn't like 30. Oh, really? No, I wasn't a fan of 30. Um, 50, yeah, I think it's going to be good. 40 I didn't mind, 50 I didn't mind. The only I'm thing... Going from 20 to 30. Mm. I'm not bothered about age, but I, I do wish that my birthday was in a better season than winter. I like winter, I appreciate winter, but... And then let's go in with this die. And shall we put it sort of here? Let's pop that on now. Be your own kind of beautiful. Be your own kind of beautiful. Again, just like your favourite pair of jeans. And by the way, the glue sticks are in stock still. Uh, are they? Yes, they are. Thank goodness. I was hoping 12. they would be. They weren't for ages. I was like, oh my goodness. Now. Twelve of them for I'm about have to seven switch. or eight pounds, I think. I'm glad you've said that. Like I say, I thought I couldn't use my favourite dye adhesive then. So for sentiments like this, I just love to just go on and dab this glue stick on. It gets in all those little nooks and crannies, mm -hmm. dries clear, and again, it just gives you that little bit of wiggle room as because well. it goes so on purple, you can see where you've missed. Yeah, of course, absolutely. So you can just drape it on there. Right, you've got just, the sentiments, there they are. ITHD84 for 22.47. With some of our favourite gemstones. We're going to go in with the gemstones on jeans. Nothing wrong with that. Oh, yeah. Okay. Well, let's just sort of scatter them round kind of randomly. So we'll just put sort of three by this sentiment here. I've not got a lot of room, actually. We never have in here. <laughs> um, okie dokie but never got enough room crafter's prerogative always add gemstones and then let's get two or three more um, oh stick into my fingers there we go and then we'll just pop thanks yeah you have got wicked nails. I do yeah I was having Halloween nails whether I liked it or not my uh, nail lady was like yep you've got telling <laughs> she tells week. you what you have yeah yeah she, okay. yeah she decides for me not the other way around um, 
How ace are those dies? I know. Aren't they lovely? The dies, remember, today are brand new. They work with the rectangular and the circular that we launched in May, all those months ago. They're square and oval today. If you want the other ones, the circles and the rectangles, they are in the show. You can get them as well, same price, same deal. I want to show you those papers, though, yes. that uh, Becca was using. These are amazing. Um, I'll just flick them here for you. Yeah. You get 24 in each pack, and you get six packs in total. So this is your denim. It's all, un this is uncoated paper as well, because a lot of them have got like a satin finish, but yeah. the denim and a couple of others are uncoated. So this is matte, so you can add distress. Completely on matte, yeah. You yeah. can ink your sentiments on if you're using stamps as well. Yeah, like you say, all of those. I mean, look at that polka dot one. I know, polka dot denim. It looks so real. I know, you just want it honestly. You can't believe it's paper. <laughs> so 24 sheets of denim, there you go. Now, this was one of my favourites yesterday. I yes. love anything vintage, probably because I am vintage. This is also matte as yeah, well. Yeah, it is. So you can add uh, extra effects to it if you want to. Absolutely. If you've got like vintage newspapers, old written letters. Remember the days when we used to write letters? I know, postcards, the adverts. The old-fashioned adverts, yeah. Yes. So you're going to get a few of each of these. Then you've got some um, old-fashioned newspaper type. Look at that, postcards, yes. vintage postcards. All in paper. So that's the second bundle. Yeah. 24 of them. You've then got your, this is your essential iridescent glass. Yeah. This is coated. So this has got like a, a shine to it, which you can probably see. But look at that. This You've got the effect so of light, light through textured glass or water on glass in some effects. And again, you could die cut this one and have all of those shiny layers. Absolutely. 24 of those. Then you've got the faux leather. Love this. Yeah. Again, another matte one for yep. you guys. That's the yeah. third matte one. So you've got dark, almost like a dark grey black leather. Look it at looks that so texture. Real. Journals, covering journals, journals. Notebooks, absolutely. Oh, wow. Look yeah. at that one. Really rich colours, really intense colourways. Yeah. And then a dark green Ooh. as well. Then opposite to that, you've got your rainbow skies. Oh, this is so pretty. This is a coated one. Think unicorns, think fairies. Yes. Yeah. Think myth and magic. Yeah, absolutely. Quite subtle. And a few of them are a little bit bolder as you go through. Aren't they gorgeous? There we go, that's a bit oh, bolder. that one's gorgeous. Very kind of Barbie. Yeah, it really is, <laughs> absolutely. It's the movie of the year, isn't absolutely. it? Absolutely. And then the last one in the set of six is this one, which is your Galaxy Dream. Awesome. Out of this world. Absolutely. Look at this. So you've got six sets of 24. Ooh which makes 144 sheets of top quality pre-printed paper mm. from Hunky Dory. Um, it's a good deal at 29.94, but that is not your price this afternoon. Look at that. Midnight Sky, love that. Isn't that lovely? Mm. It's 20p a sheet at the moment. Amazing. Which is good. Um, we're not done. That isn't the price you pay. In 30 seconds, you'll get the chance to get all 144 of these papers delivered for just 3.95 PMP unless you bought something already. Otherwise, it's delivered free. And we're going to take it. It's under 30 pound at the moment. We're going to take it to how much per sheet? We're going to take it to 13 pence per no. sheet. No. Designer papers, 13p a sheet, 130 GSM. Yes, they are. Yeah. Absolutely. Three of them are uncoated. The other three are coated. Yeah. Three, two, one. Let's match the price we did yesterday afternoon. Maybe you weren't watching yesterday afternoon. There are things to do on a Sunday. Couldn't watch. Nineteen <gasps> wow. ninety-four. Wow! Stop it! Oh my goodness! Stop it! No, don't keep going. No, I know. Yeah, but <laughs> Max, this is crazy. Maxine in Kent, uh, check it out. Hello, Crafter. Hello, Karen in Middlesbrough or Middlesex. Sorry, uh, Yvonne in Aberdeenshire coming in as well. All one hundred and forty-four wow. sheets. If you mat and layer with cardstock. Nothing wrong with that, but you'll find that the weight of the card increases quite dramatically. Absolutely, with this, yeah. the weight won't increase dramatically at no, all. No, no, absolutely not. And you can still add that dimension with your foam pads and in other ways, etc. Yeah. And there's a bit of everything in there. Uh, everybody is catered for with that. 100%. Denim, leather, vintage, um, Got myth galaxies, and magic, galaxy, yeah. glass, and it's all there. The absolutely. 1994. Uh, and that product code is IVHD36. IVHD36. Now, I did tell you that we've got the circles and the rectangles in stock. Shall I get them? Yeah. Let me grab them. Now, if you've loved the squares and the ovals, which are the brand new release today, these are the ones that we released in May this year. May. And they're exactly the same style as the ones we're doing today, just different shapes. Yeah, the, and the lace 
it pattern is identical. So yes. if you are mixing and matching, they're still gonna go. You know, they're still gonna go perfectly. And in the rectangle, you get a bonus. Bar, you do absolutely, down. and obviously you can cut that multiple times to tile it, uh, make your long borders or your lace edges. You, so you know. can make the rectangles longer and wider if you want to by using that. Yep. You can so. obviously put them on the edge of a card blank. Yep. Yeah. And then you're going to get all one, two, three, four, five dies in the circle. Largest ones being uh, 12 centimetres by, uh, and the smallest one is two centimetres. There you go. So circles and rectangles, 34.98. We've matched the price of the new release today. So if you wanted both of them together, so you've got them four sets in the same style, but just different shapes. Exactly. And you do need all of these shapes. Yeah. You know, it depends on what card blanks you're working with. And You know, you, you buy dies sometimes and you might use them once a month. You buy dies yeah. other times that you use every day. And yeah. I think these will probably, maybe not every day, but I mean, certainly you'll reach for these a lot. You're going to use them a lot. Over and over again, yeah, 100%. And this is it, dies are tool for life. So if they're, if they're versatile as well as being a tool for life, yeah. it's even better. And if I just quickly show you the board yeah. that you've done for us so you can see the detail in the edges. I mean... Aren't they gorgeous? Just look at them, even cut out in white, like little doilies, yeah. you know, so cute. And remember, it's the positive and the negative that you've yeah. got. You've got the aperture that it leaves behind. You can make frames out of them as well. Layer them up like this, like pyramid style. Mm. Very effective. Yeah. 34 pounds and 98 pence. Because you've got that straight bar in the rectangular one, that means that you can then make any of the straight sided, the rectangle or the square, if you've mm. gone for that today, you can make them bigger, longer, taller, smaller, shorter. Exactly. Yeah. So handy. Again, even more versatility, isn't it? Love it. Yeah. 34.98 for those. Now, We've also got the Heartfelt Sentiments collection as well. Now, you're going to get eight of those. I don't think I've got them here, actually. Oh, hang on. Oh. Nope. They were definitely Smaller ones. here. Were they here? Have we buried them? That's probably me. Oh, yeah, they're here. They're under my notes. <laughs> so they, are, they are very small. You said you haven't got enough room. I know. No. Oh, we never have. I know, ever. Okay, here they are. So, cheers to you. Oh, these are good, because they're not run on the mill every day, best wishes, happy birthday. No, no, no. And we do have those if you do want that. But yeah, these are just a little bit different. Um, you with love and best wishes. Good luck. Ones that you just might not see every day. Have a great day. From the heart. You're amazing. Love that. New baby. Okay, so you get two dice. You get basically the, the detail for the words and then you get the mat. Yes, you do. Like the, the yeah, mat. the mat. Yeah, mat and layer, yeah. Okay, now they're normally separately available, but we're gonna do a bundle today and give you a, a special price on them. So you've got two, four, six, you get seven dies in total. Oh, that cheers to you one, that's really lovely. Yeah, Those it's are eight. Great, One, it? two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yes, there are eight. Two stuck together. Okay, let's get the price in. VZHD48 for all of them. And they're all the same font as well, aren't they? They are, yes. So again, if you're mixing and matching, if you're putting cheers to you and uh, maybe thank you or you are amazing, the typography is going to match. 236 a yeah, die set. Yeah, of course. Absolutely amazing, isn't really it? Really good price. From the heart, have a great day. Have a great day, you're amazing. Good luck, you're amazing. With love and best wishes and cheers to you. £18.92 pence, and that's VZHD48. Right, Becca. Now, the okay. multi-buy of the brand new ones is the most popular. No surprise there, because a lot of you did go for the uh, circles and the uh, rectangles back in May. Yep. But you're adding these to your collection. Absolutely, I'm not surprised. So we're going to do, we're going to move on to our ovals now. And we're going to go on a bit different, a bit of a different journey. We're going to go a bit more glitz and glam with this one. Nothing wrong with that. It's absolutely not. Well, I saw this card here and I thought, I am going to kind of make that. This is obviously a lot more rustic and everything, but isn't it absolutely beautiful? I think our lovely cat made this. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna show you how to sort of make that because you can make shaped card blanks with all of your dies. Yes. So actually, yeah, that's a really good point. Shaped yeah. card blanks, mm -hmm. absolutely. You shaped easels, you shaped... Um, so not just for frames, not just for apertures. You no, absolutely well. not. So let me just get my bits and pieces out. I'll see if I've got a card blank, actually. Yeah, I do, here we go. I mean, this easel card, that's a card blank. Yeah, of course, absolutely. Yep. That's how you can make them. Isn't it such a good idea? So clever. Cut two elements out, stick them together. That's a card blank. Yeah, absolutely. So if you were going to make a card blank, I'll kind of show you how that you would do that. So let's kind of grab maybe our second largest for a card like this. Yeah. Mm, 
probably an even smaller. So if you were going to make it, I'd use probably a smaller card blank than this, maybe like a four by six. So you'd kind of open your card blank out and then have it like that. And then that would be a rocker card. If you were going to make it as just a normal card, you'd just pop your die just slightly over there and then do another one as a matte and layer. Right. Um, but we are going to make the sort of rocker card. So what we need to do is grab our largest one. I've got some black stamping card here. Mm -hmm. And then we're just going to um, just cut that out with our die cutting machine. So again, we're just going to pop some low tack tape on there. OK. And, and we have got another show with Becca as well at four o'clock. The we Pocket do. Pads are back by popular demand if you missed them yesterday. Yeah, I couldn't just do one show. Oh, no. Um, OK, so again, let's get that cut out now. So we'll pop our oval on there. Again, we've gone with some black stamping card. So that's black all the way through to the core. It's one of our essential items. And like I say, whenever you're making like card blanks or anything like that, where you'll see the inside, it's it's so good to use this one because it's got no white core or white inside. And don't forget, even if um, Becca or Natalie or Anne Marie's not on air with us on a date, yeah. they've always got the Hunky Dory brand shop on our website. So we do. all the brands that supply us have got brand shops. You can look at any time. If it's in stock, you can buy it. It doesn't have to be a day when the shows are on from that company. Yeah, so. exactly. Yeah, we, we are always available. Um, okay, so now that we've cut that, um, now you can do this on the scoreboard, but I'm just going to be really, really naughty and just fold this in half. Just because yes, I can. Just because I can, yeah, absolutely. So just a nice, neat, crisp burnish there. And then I am going to grab my score tool and just, again, give that another nice, crisp burnish. And that there is your sort of rocker card base there. So obviously we'll give that a little, a little rock there, and then that'll move, obviously, once it's been burnished a bit as well. Mm -hmm. um, okay, so let's get our other bits and pieces because again, we've cut all our mats and layers ahead of time. So I've got one either we could use the same size and have it nice and sort of tall and proud. Just have to kind of line that up there. I think I'm going to do that actually. I really like the way that looks. So let's go and put that on with some, we'll put some double sided tape and we'll put it on um, the sort of base of my card here. So let's pop that on there going off piece now. I wasn't going to use it, but I love how tall it looks. Okay, so. I like it when you make it up as you go along. Well, it's a little bit of creative license, isn't it? Home, isn't it? I know, that's how everybody, cra organic crafting, yeah. I call it. Yeah. Um, okay, so let's just peel that little bit off there. There we go. Just a bit of tape back in the stuck then. And then again, let's get this beautiful, and it gives it such a different look. I don't think you expect to kind of see lacing in black, you kind of expect it to be very sort of, almost kind of bridal-esque mm -hmm. in the white. And, you know, I just wanted to do something kind of a little bit different. So again, we've got our little card base there. And then this is one that we've done that's even bigger. So again, you could actually go bigger. This is the largest one and then this is the second. Um, but so let's pop our mats and layers on. So I think I am going to go with the bigger card base. Yeah, everything's, you know, equally distant. The sizes go down at equal Equal distances, yeah, so it's not going to look out of place or anything like that. Okay, let's we'll stick with this one, actually. Like, it would be bigger, but that is stuck on for dear life, so we'll leave that be. Like I say, organic crafting at its absolute finest. Let's stick this on with some foam pads so that we can have this as a bit of dimension. Okay. This is our Diamond Sparkles glitter card. It's our silver shimmer colour. It goes absolutely amazingly with that strong black. Um, and again, I just cut this with our Gemporia just, just before the show. Okay. And then again, but you could use any of your sort of core essentials. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to lay that up. And, then and all your hunky-dory tools and trimmers and blades and that sort of thing, all on the website. All on the website. Hobbymaker.co.uk. Yeah, of course. Um, yeah. All your foam pads, all your scissors, your pokey tool. Um, again, I've not even really had to weed these dies. They've been so good. So let's grab that onto there. Okay. And then and we're going to bring our centerpiece statement, uh, centerpiece sentiments back in. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to see how that looks. I think I want the black shadow one and then the glitter slightly off on there. Okay. So again, we're just going to pop. I do love a drop shadow. Uh, they're so nice, aren't they? It makes they? such a difference. Absolutely, and all you have to do is cut it twice. So we've got the one black layer, and then that's just going to bring in... Okay. And then we'll just pop that on top of there. 
and then we'll just to do that it's just to sort of lay it just slightly how would you describe it? like a sort of off kilter a little yeah, bit just a, a little bit towards side. to the right yeah. yeah absolutely and then again we can we can pop that on there so now that it's a little bit thicker again that gives us a little Actually, bit you can more see the drop shadow better you, on the back absolutely yeah. yeah on the white so it's just angling it in that sort of you know fashion if you will um so again that'll allow us to put a little bit of foam pads on because it's given us even more room here so i'm just going to snip these apart mm -hmm. and we're going to just pop that on there and again it's just going to be a really sweet little shape card blank that you can pop through the post so let's pop that on there yeah there we go I'm just going to peel the backing off my foam pads and then we'll get that stuck down. It's looking really classy. It's so classy, isn't it? Again, still nice and elegant, but just that bit more kind of glam. So, again, let's, let's pop that up now. Move my trimmer out the way. Mm -hmm. And then that should just sit as a really nice kind of shaped card blank there. So now the dies not only make wonderful frames, wonderful No, absolutely. That's your card actual blanks. card blank. So if you see there, you can see where the fold is. Just stuck that down there and then that'll just stand up really nicely there. Oh. Just again, you can just give it a little bit of a burnish. It might rock slightly like a, like a rocker always, card would do. You could always do. make the bottom of it flat as well if you want. You could do. Way. Absolutely. Yes. Yeah. So let's give it a bit of a burnish. There we go. So cute, aren't they? Beautiful. Okay, so that is, of course, our nesting die set with that lovely lace yeah, border so around the edge. Square and oval, brand new today. Loads of you have bought them. Uh, loads of you going for the ones that we had previously as well, the circle yeah, and um, what was it? Circle and rectangle. Now, we've also got this. Let me just put the card down. Oh, yeah, sorry. See, <laughs> right. Now, we had to get this in. Um, you used it in the demonstrations. Now, sometimes glitter cards can be a little bit of a nightmare, especially if it sheds. Mm -hmm. And also, if it's really textured, you can have a heck of a job to try and get it to stick to anything. Absolutely, when you've got yeah. glitter card like this, which is non-shed, and a lovely, it's not, I wouldn't say it's completely smooth, but it's got a very, very light texture. Yeah, absolutely. You've got, you've got 25 different colors in here. Isn't it? And look at that color palette as well. You get two of each colour and there's 50 sheets, 25 different colours. Look at that. That's kind of chartreuse, kind of lemony, greeny colour. Beautiful. You've got a bronze in there. You've got an orange, maybe a pumpkin orange, possibly. Blues. There's a silver that you were using in the demonstration. That's so nice, isn't it? Absolutely gorgeous. 25 times two. Yep, you get 50 sheets. Uh, oh, 24.99 so basically it is 50p a sheet at the moment mm. but i'll just show again I've, I've got a jacket on look absolutely nothing no glitter. No, no glitter. glitter nothing comes off nothing's going to be in your lap nothing's going to be falling into your lap when you take it out of the, the envelope at the other end it's completely non-shed it die cuts a dream you absolutely. can stick your foam pads onto it and everything sticks oh 100 percent, absolutely and to cut lacy dies like this out of glitter card because like you say it does have that kind of texture you can it you know it die cuts beautiful that sentiment as well with all that swirly writing it cuts beautifully as well yeah okay look at that 14.99 for 50 sheets 30p a sheet for non-shed glitter card that is wow. really really good really good grab it while we've got it today um if, if part of your pet hate with crafting is the clear up after it oh yeah <coughs> this is zero clear up no shed glitter um i know i've actually got a friend of mine who it physically makes her kind of squirm when she touches glitter card. She hates the texture of it, but this is fine. It's smooth. Yep. It's so smooth. Absolutely. It's not like sandpaper. No, no, no. It's completely encapsulated in the cardstock for possibly the smoothest glitter card mm -hmm. ever. It's amazing. Well, to get it at that deal today, yeah. £10 saved, one PMP every day of three ninety five. no matter how many things you buy from midnight to midnight. Stock up. I mean, I just I love being sat at home thinking, oh, I'll order that because that's a delivered price. Yeah, of course. And it is if you bought something. Definitely. Already. Fourteen ninety nine then for all fifty sheets, um, and well, buy a couple if you can afford it. Take advantage of it. A great deal. Yeah. Twenty five different colours, two of each, fifty sheets in total. That's XQHD sixty three for that one. Okay. Now our main deal 
This is the most popular item in the show. No surprises there because we brought you earlier on in the year in May, the circles and the rectangle nesting dies with the same decorative lacy edge to mm. it. So today we're launching the next phase of shapes. Yes. So you've got your ovals, you've got your squares, brand new today, and they complement the circles and the rectangles. And if I just show you again some finished cards to give you some ideas. The squares, I mean, that's similar to what you did with the denim earlier. Yeah, on. absolutely. Just layering up all those, you know, those sort of squares there for that kind of geometric feel. Again, we've got that beautiful memory book. There. And there's the square as a diamond, offset it. Yeah. And there they are used to great effect on inside the book as well. They make wonderful frames. Don't they? Look at those. Absolutely stunning. And then look at this one. Yep. Little you can rabbit use in the middle. All your paper craft stash, your little books, everything like that. Um, this one's been used as like a sort of frame. So that's an easel day. Yeah. So stuck down. There we go. Yeah, absolutely. And, and again, used half of the oval as a stopper. Yep. Isn't that great? Yeah. Uh, here, three ovals put together makes a pumpkin. Pumpkin. I don't ever thought of that. Sweet is that? It's really cute. But then when you're using your mirror card and that sort of thing to create wonderful layers and frames, beautiful, isn't it? I mean, yeah. it's delicate. And yeah. if you wanted to, you could actually kind of thread some very thin ribbons yeah. through the apertures there if you wanted Absolutely. to. Absolutely, yeah, why not? You know, just experiment, just have fun with them. That's and this so one great. looks really kind of vintage and almost Victorian, yeah. doesn't it? it? Definitely, yeah, and it really calls out for that with that delicate lacy edge. I mean, just look at it, you know, if you've got little book pages, it just makes them so good. Okay, in 40 minutes, nearly half of the stock of this has gone. Wow. Isn't that lovely? Look at that. That was the one we've actually used on the packaging. So if you want to copy that card, it's on your packaging, packaging. for a bit of yeah. So, oh, okay. You know, on the on the, oh, on the die actual, packaging. Right, gotcha. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So yeah, we always make on. a card model for you guys at home. Yeah. Um, so Rachel's actually made this one, and you can copy that again and again, or you could use your own colours perhaps. Sure. But yeah. That, that, that's like a kind of a rainbow card. Yeah. Isn't it? But a slightly different twist on it. Like that a lot. Um, and again, just to show you the boards as to the. The possibilities. Remember, you've got the positive and you've got the negative. So you've got the aperture and you've got the actual tile itself. You've then got the opportunity of cutting two together to create a frame. Mm. You've then got the possibility to make card blanks out of them as well. Uh, just by literally doing the technique that uh, Becca showed you a few minutes ago, overhang the die slightly off the edge of a folded card and you've then made a card blank, which yeah. is so easy. Yeah. 34.98 today. I've bent that one, sorry. 34 pounds and 98 pence. Now the sentiments that are in the show today as well. Brand new today, yeah. Also brand new today. I bury everything. I, <laughs> I, I know. Never, I, think I can never find anything. We, we are getting in a mess, aren't we? <laughs> there we go. So you get all these Cuddies. three. Sending smiles. Now, if you wanted to, to snip the, the word sending and put it in front or whatever, yeah. you can do that. Or just have the word smiles. You can snip them off if you want to. Precious memories. Great for... Uh, your journaling and your memory books, mm. all that sort of thing. And be your own kind of beautiful. I love that. I know. So uplifting. And I just love that they're just, I don't know, they're just a bit different, aren't they? Yeah. The new generic sentiments. And the fonts are great. The, the fonts are stunning. Yeah, they really are. So they are brand new today and they're 22.47 and they're a really good size, actually. They're a card filler, aren't they? They are. Absolutely. They are. That's why we called them centerpieces, because they are good enough to just put as a centerpiece mm. in your card. Or use it as a stopper on yeah, a easel card. That's absolutely. what someone's done there. That's beautiful, isn't it? Stunning. Uh, right. yeah. Now, if you want them on their own, <laughs> if you just want one that jumps out at you, maybe you've got one of the other ones or whatever, be your own kind of beautiful... Okay, be your own kind of beautiful if you want that one. Uh, they're individually just $9.99. If you've got a £10 budget for a gift or someone's giving you a tenner for your birthday or something like that, and you, yeah. you want to buy something, don't know what. Be your own kind of beautiful. That just on a card on its own is all you need. Absolutely. And then, yeah, as you can see, we've, we've again, got the, the packaging model for you if you want to take a bit of inspiration from that. I've got another one there as well for you. Yeah, it really does so feel quite a large pretty. card. That's yeah, a they DL do. Card. Absolutely, yeah, hundred percent. Whatever kind of cards you make, they are going to look the part. And that's the drop shadow again. Yeah. So just cut it out twice, offset it a little bit. The precious memories, if you want that one, that's the pumpkin one there okay. with precious memories. So again, that would be great for a photo album or a scrapbook. Yeah. I think we've got those ones over there as well, Dave. You see that travel one? Oh, this one. We've got the little like this is like a little album. Just look at this. Oh, hang on. This is right up my street. I, isn't oh, it wow. beautiful? 
Oh, that's amazing. And then, this is the vintage maps from yeah, the, um, the previous the collection. Yeah, your designs, absolutely. And then again, we've used those lacy bits. Look at it cut in half there to make the little pocket. Isn't oh, that clever? Weird. Didn't think of that. Yeah, half a square makes a pocket, of course. Again, you've got your photo frames in there. Just all working so well together. All these papers and pads you'll find on the website as well. Uh, if you go and have a little look at uh, hobbymaker.co.uk. Another one here, which I've not opened yet. Let's have a look at this. What's Again, inside here? Memory. If you keep, if you do memory keeping, you you need this die. I wish I'd done that in my earlier years. You know, diaries and books those. and yeah. things, travels and that sort of thing. It wasn't a thing when I was younger. Isn't that beautiful? Isn't it gorgeous? What a keepsake. I know. How special if someone gets presented that. Um, how special? That could be full of baby photos. It Absolutely, could be holiday yeah. Holiday photos. Magnetic strip holds it firm. Isn't that great? Amazing. I mean, it wouldn't cost you much to make. No. But what a special, very special Christmas gift. Yeah, 100%. Love so it. So good. Ooh, precious memories. Look, <laughs> there's the circles. Or you could use part of the oval to create your own rainbow. Mm. I think that's a different die. That is, yeah, that's our nested yeah. rainbow. But again, you could use it with the lace one, no problem. And then the other one we've got, Sending Smiles. Sending Smiles, here we are. $9.99 for all of these individually. If you just want one, that's fine. Isn't that great? Yeah. Sending Smiles for $9.99, and that one's XNHD51. Oh, we've got a message from Kathleen. Okay. Um, this is Kathleen oh. in Devon. Hi, Kathleen. Fabulous show as always. I placed my first first order today on Hobby Maker. Yay! First of many, I'm sure. Oh, you got confetti, Kathleen. That is ace. Yay. See, oh. I told you, lots of people are shopping with us for the very first time. Word is spreading. Great to have you aboard, Kathleen. Yeah, messaging as often yeah. as you like. Always loving to hear from everybody. Yeah, 100%. Right. We're going to get another demo in. Yeah, please. Perfect. Let's do it. Okay, so we are going to go back to our... Um, are lacy squares but we are going to use the sentiments as well of course okay. we're going to do that let me just put the lid on my glue and then it doesn't dry out okay so i'm just going to grab some bits and pieces out and going to make our beautiful beautiful card here so we've got a six by six card and we've got this one as well now i'm going to bring in our punch uh, again all the tools are available on the website if you need them i'm just going to round the corners of this because i think those lacy squares just really call for it so i'm just gonna there we go you've got to get your muscles in gear when going through this <laughs> two layers of cardstock there we go and then the last one on here so what we're going to do is we're just going to turn our card blank into one with rounded corners okay. so it makes gonna, a difference doesn't it doesn't it? it just makes it again like let's bit put softer. this a bit softer so once we get and then my card stock as well just need to do that so this is just our cream matte tastic just regular basic essentials here nothing fancy but yeah so now that i've done that that's perfect so we've got our rose gold mirror and we've got our cream matte tastic but i just thought these have like nice soft rounded mm. curved corners so if you can take that extra what minute 30 seconds just to round the corners off yeah it, would, it wouldn't look right having right angles very with square the exactly yeah. absolutely 100 percent. that's exactly what i thought so i thought yep yeah, let's get our punch in because it's a fabulous little tool and it takes like say seconds and um, so let's get our mat and layers done mm -hmm. um so again we're just going in with our favorite trusty double-sided tape here and just so you know coming up in the next show we've got some cross stitch um the lovely helen is back with us from mm. acorn creative and uh then bex is back at yes. four with me for pocket pads i'm so excited for those they are aren't they? i'm very excited yeah and then Hayley takes over at five. My good awesome. friend Hayley West is back. Okay, so now let's get this started to layer up. So not only have I got my cream matastic, I've then brought in this beautiful soft pink as well, just to go with Ooh, that. Those colours work. So well, don't they? And then we are going to bring in our little book of vintage journeys as well. I know that's fairly current. And again, it just gives it that nice vintage look. So I'm going to get some more foam pads. I'm going to bring those back in. Um, here we go. Okay, so let's start layering everything up, adding a little bit of dimension. Mm -hmm. Let us know if you're crafting along with us yes. this afternoon. Get in touch like uh, Kathleen did. It'd be lovely to hear from you. You can send messages easily from our new app or from the website where it says contact oh, let's the studio. Just put loads on. Let's just go crazy and put loads on. 
Yeah, go for it. Just don't want it to buckle at the edges. Um, okay, so what I'm just going to do is I'm just going to just use my three in one tool. There's just a couple of little bits that are still stuck in there. Yeah, of course. Just give it a nice, nice little polish, final polish before we stick it down. There we go. Can we give this card away in the four, uh, yeah, four o'clock show? Yeah, of course. We'll do a Davy B Lucky Dip, if that's all right with everyone, at four o'clock. Yeah, 100%. So if you email in, don't email in now, but email in between four and five on the next show and we'll give this card away. Um, oh. It could be you that wins it before five o'clock. The pressure now to make this card absolutely beautiful. <laughs> My goodness. No, I'm joking. It should be, it should be a nice card. Good. Okay. Who doesn't love a little bit of rose gold? Okay. And then... Just, just just mention those words and the phone lines get busy, rose gold. Okay, then let's just get some more foam pads. It just looks so good on card making though, it just looks so fancy. Um, so again, let's just put lots of, lots of foam pads on here just to give it that really nice bit of dimension Good and, and strong. coverage. Yeah, that's it, exactly. When you go all, I mean, you don't need to go all over, but I think with us giving this one away as well, let's make sure it's really sturdy, mm -hmm. everything's done properly. Okay, so then we're gonna go on with this one next. And then we're gonna flick and we're gonna, I love this little book. I know exactly which one I've, I'm picking, it's that okay. one there. So we've got all these gorgeous imagery. And again, I just thought this went so well with the sort of memory keeping. Mm -hmm. And we're going to go with Big Ben. Big Ben. Um, be done. I love, love, love this one. And I was in London a few weeks ago and the memories are still like, oh, it was so fab. So... Um, you can go up there, I've heard. Can you? I think so, yeah. You well, can. obviously, I to, when I was <laughs> there a few weeks ago, I mean, I've not been for quite a while. Um, but they've obviously been doing it up for the past yeah, few years. Oh my goodness, it's so shiny oh, and yeah, it looks beautiful amazing. and clean. It's fabulous. No more scaffolding. No, not at all. Right, let's just see what what size. So we're going to use our nice big one here. Obviously, we can't go right obviously over. We want that lacy detail to be really captured. So let's go in with that and. We'll pop that in and then we've got all this gorgeous texture around the side. You've got like the luggage labels and the vintage roses. Mm -hmm. um, but again, it makes absolutely beautiful um, partner to go with your little books. You know, it just makes your little books fancier. So that one is called the Vintage, um, vintage Journeys. Journeys. And again, yeah. all the little books, the rectangular ones, yeah, the square, square ones will be one. on the website as well. So maybe you're looking, maybe you've had little books for years and you're looking for a way to just step them up, make them a bit fancier, not just mat and layer them, do something a bit different. Bring the this is how dies you can in. bring your nesting mm -hmm. dies in. Absolutely. But it's still really simple. You know, if you're a beginner, you can still do this. Um, okay, so let's grab that through the die cutting machine. Oh, we've got the little book actually. I think we found it on I the I thought uh, we would website, have. So. I'm sure I checked. Have you not? It's amazing. Oh. Okay. Yeah, of You've course. You've got some um, places around the world. You've got the Titanic in there, the Colosseum. Yeah, Bifling, there's a Bifling. Paris one in there. Yeah. Um, we can have the, the quickest flick ever. Yeah, you've got the Coliseum, you've got the camper van, you've got London, you've got more fe uh, masculine ones in the there. Rooms, the clothes. globe, the wedding car, camera. Absolutely. Uh, there's the Tower of Pisa. Yeah. There we go. Fab. There's your Paris one and your train. Mm -hmm. There we go. But yeah, absolutely perfect for that kind of vintage theme. It's on the screen there. There you go. Okay. QXHD15. Oh, how cute does that look on there? I love that. Okay, let's again, let's pop some foam pads on there. So again, just again, just so perfect. Again, you could mix and match those for your memory keeping. You could make that little, you know, like the little travel journal. Mm -hmm. You could make that with this little book and these dies. Um, I think we can just squeeze one more on there. Well, we thought these would be popular. Uh, they're even we're even busier for them than we anticipated. Oh, to be honest, this with the squares amazing. and the ovals. So, in total, you've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There's eleven dies in different sizes. Um, six of them square, and five of them oval. And they are back, or they're here today, but uh, first time on air. But yeah. they complement the other ones, the circles and the rectangles from May. Uh, they do, year. they do, they absolutely do. 
Now, the bundle of the circles and the rectangles have gone. They've sold out, I'm afraid. Um, we have got them on their own, though. Okay. Amazing. If you want them individually, you can get the circles on their own, you can get the rectangles on their own, but the bundle of the two together has gone in this show. So uh, they're 19 99 each for either the circle or the rectangle. The rectangle's got the added benefit of having the other extender bar. Yes, it does, yeah. So you can make the rectangles wider, longer, and of course that will work with the square as well if you're going for that today. Yeah, that. absolutely, yeah. And again, it, it allows you, if you make an easels, you can use that as a stopper. Again, you can put it on the end of like a card blank. Okay, so I'm just gonna, again, just glue my sentiment in place. So we've gone with, obviously, like I say, precious memories. And then we've used all three on all three of our cards. We've got sending smiles, be your own kind of beautiful, and now precious memories. Okay, so let's put that right at the bottom there. Okay. Now, I'll, I'll tell you something. There's, um, we've just noticed that the rectangular one should be 19.99, but for some reason it's 14.99. So if you want the rectangle, get it quick get before it now. that gets corrected. It should be 19.99. The sheets say 19.99, but the computer's saying 14.99. So that's all you'd be charged for it. That's covering your PMP. If you just want the rectangles, grab it quick. Again, before let's the boss realizes. I know, <laughs> yeah. HD 15. Let's yeah. again. Let's finish off with some. Of, let's go back to our white pearls that we used on the first demo. Again, we'll just pop some on. Just a little, again, just a little scatter on here. Mm. Oh. Cute. Just, so cute. Yeah. And then we'll just, again, just hold that one down. And then there we go. I think that's okay. ready to give away, don't you? Okay, brilliant. Well, we'll give it away between four and five. If you want to get your emails in sooner, you can send them in now. You'll all go into the draw. Uh, studio at hobbymaker.co.uk. But between four and five, we'll officially open the lines uh, or the website uh, and the emails. So you could win that before five o'clock this afternoon. Okay. So what about deals today? We're going to be back, remember, with more of those fantastic little books a bit later on. Yeah, you're coming in really, really quickly for the, <laughs> for the rectangle now. Now you've realised there's been a mistake on it. Absolutely Oops. right. Five pounds lower than it should be. Fourteen ninety nine. Hang on a minute. My producer, Laura, just said in my ear, oops, someone's made a mistake with this. Oops. So the circles are 19.99. The rectangle should be 19.99. In the bundle, you'd have got a discount of a fiver off, but you can buy this one on its own with that five pound discount as well, which should not be the case, but busy, busy, busy for this. 14.99, one PMP every day for 3.95. It's going crazy for it. Grab it while we've got it. It's our mistake. Well, it's either our mistake or hunky dory is one or the other. I'm not sure which, but anyway, either way. <laughs> either way, it's in your favour, which is good. Um, Janice, Rita, Sue, Jane, Sheila, Carol, Jill. Yeah, grab it. Carol, Dawn, Vivian, Valerie, Nita, all coming in for the rectangles, and they've all got the same beautiful, fancy edge around it. Um, I haven't got any samples to show you. I haven't got any finished cards, but I have got the board. So ignore the circle, that's the rectangle that you're gonna get. But you do have the extender bar included with it as well, yeah. which isn't on that board. And that just gives you more versatility to make things wider, longer, yeah. shorter, whatever you want to do. And that would work, remember, with the squares if you bought those today as well. Yeah, this is absolutely going bonkers. It's our mistake or someone's mistake, but you know what? You're benefiting from it and we're happy for that until the boss sees it and says, put the price back up. $14.99, um, PNHD 15 is your price. It's going wild. Can't beat a good mistake now and again. I know, right? If, you, if you're lucky enough to get this deal. <laughs> I, I, when it, whenever, I, whenever I buy anything and I realize it shouldn't actually be as low as I'm paying for it, it's a really good, feel good feeling. Yeah. Um, so yeah, just fill your boots, enjoy it. $14.99, one, two, three, for five dies in that set. Yeah. And they were, remember, back on in May, and they worked together with the ovals. Now you're gonna get that discount on that. Think about putting that towards the squares yeah, and course. the ovals that are brand new today. Yeah. Why not? Of one course. PMP? Absolutely. And these, they are absolutely stunning dies that you are just gonna use so much. Okay, let's give you details then. If you want the square and the ovals today, brand new today, they've all got these wonderful, ornate frames around the edge. They're absolutely gorgeous. Um, and they're 34.98. There you go, for awesome. both. So you get a five pound discount for buying both together. 
or if you buy the rectangles, you get a five pound discount on that as well. Don't know what happened there, but anyway, get both of those today, brand new. They all work together beautifully, beautifully well. And you always get uh, a photograph uh, for inspiration on the front of the of packaging course, as yeah. well. If I just turn them around. I, I, I honestly, I've said this all the time, Becca, but I, I, I firmly believe that the, the nesting dies like this are some of the most versatile dies you'll ever have. Oh, easily, yeah. You will use them time and time again. I mean, just look at like this one for the autumn. You might get this thinking, like, you're not going to make any autumn cards with them, but then you can make that. Obviously, you can make, you know, the memory keeping. And think oh, of all your... little practice one. <laughs> think of all your amazing um, books that you've got from yeah. Hunky Dory over the years. Yeah. Use them to cut out those images in there as well. Yeah, absolutely. See you at four then. Yes, absolutely, four o'clock. Give away at four o'clock as well. Get your emails in. I'll see you with Helen after a short break. Are you having trouble finding the perfect gift? Then why not treat them to the new gift card from Hobbymaker at hobbymaker.co.uk. Simply scroll down to the bottom where it says gift cards, click and you'll be taken to the right place. Decide between posting the card or delivery by email and then decide how much you want to add. You choose the value. So what do you get the crafter that's got everything? Why not treat yourself or them to the Hobbymaker gift card? Here at Hobbymaker, we want your shopping experience to be as simple as possible. That's why you can buy as many items as you like all day and only pay one postage and packaging fee. It doesn't matter what weight, size or quantity of your order or how many times you check out that day, you still will only be charged one p and Shopping made simple with Hobbymaker. They call me Mr. Fantastic. Are you having trouble finding the perfect gift? Then why not treat them to the new gift card from Hobbymaker at hobbymaker.co.uk. Simply scroll down to the bottom where it says gift cards, click and you'll be taken to the right place. Decide between posting the card or delivery by email and then decide how much you want to add. You choose the value. So what do you get the crafter that's got everything? Why not treat yourself or them to the Hobbymaker gift card? Hobbymaker, we want your shopping experience to be as simple as possible. That's why you can buy as many items as you like all day and only pay one postage and packaging fee. It doesn't matter what weight, size or quantity of your order or how many times you check out that day, you still will only be charged one p and Shopping made simple with Hobbymaker.
couldn't be easier to watch Hobby Maker. You can join us on Sky, Freeview, on our website or on YouTube. So you can watch at home or on the go. Our call centre is based in the UK and available 24-7. Just call 0800 001 4433 or email help at hobbymaker.co.uk. Hi everyone, we're having a lovely afternoon at Hobby Maker. I hope you are as well. Great to have your company. I'm Dave, and let me introduce you to Helen, who's a regular guest with us. Good to see you back. Good to see you, you right? too. Yeah, thank you. Oakwood Archer, that's who Helen represents. And um, I mean, your, your background is uh, embroidery and needlework, isn't it? That's yes, what you do. yeah, solely do embroidery and needlework and designing for that, so yeah. <laughs> You've done some amazing pieces, and you're representing the company that allows us to be able to do it at home. And most of what we've got on the show for you today is cross-stitch. Now, I'm excited about the first one. Um, I'm excited about all of them, but I'm certainly excited about the first one because I can relate to this, and maybe you can, or you know someone that can, because, I don't know, just see what you think. Have a little look at it, because it's okay to be different. I love that. I think that is absolutely brilliant, a brilliant thing to, to kind of say and to, to make a statement about, but it's so cute, it's so, so cute. Now this is, a, this is quite a big project this, isn't it, Helen? Yeah, it is, but actually it's one of those projects that scale-wise it looks quite large, but once you're into it, it will go quite quickly. Right. So it's not going to be one of those things that feels like a lifetime, lifetime <laughs> achievement award, you know, it's yeah, one yeah. of those, an opus. It's not an investment in years no, of work. No, exactly. Like so I think you get a good amount of hours for the price of the kit, you know, but that's, that's all. It's not a five minute project, no. but um, you get something really nice at the end. Now, whether you're into imperial or, or metric, I'll give you the size when it's made up. It's 58 by 40 centimetres or 23 by 16 inches. And it's actually cross stitch on an even weave linen. Now you're gonna get all the threads you need. You're gonna get the linen itself, which is just gorgeous. Um, needles, instructions. So what about, maybe you've got someone in mind that you just think that's gonna be perfect. Or maybe you've got it in mind for yourself or for your family or whatever. But yeah, I love it. And the fact you've got that little kind of oddball in the middle, the one with the robin with the red breast and he's the odd one out or she's the old one out. Um, it's really a lovely message, isn't it? It's think? really sweet, yeah. It's really sweet. And if you're not that oddball, you know somebody who is. Yes. <laughs> so. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Now, that is um, ID 3508, if you would like it today. Um, are you a cross-stitcher, or have you never done it before? Do you fancy giving it a go? We're getting busy for it already. I thought we would be. Yeah. Free phone number to call the call centre. The call centre's upstairs in this building, so they're not in a far flung part of the world. Uh, they'll give you an account if you've never shopped with us before, uh, and you can order on the website as well, which is hobbymaker.co.uk. Mm. Now, is it easy to do if no one's cross stitched ever before yeah actually it's a really nice scale so the fabric being an even weave linen it's not a fine linen so it's got a lovely texture to it and a good scale so you don't need to have the eyesight of you know a hawk to be able to right. do it and the lovely thing is as well it's working in pearl threads so the pearl thread it's a twisted thread which you you're not having to split it you're using all of that in a needle right. so it's a really lovely scale of embroidery that will feel really pleasing when you're doing as I say, it's not micro stitching. It's all um, nice okay. scale to work with. Demo to come then with Helen in a second. I just want to get a couple of them um, under your belt, really. Oh, it's on split pays. Well, I didn't realise that. So it's on two split pays of twenty nine ninety nine. Uh, it's fifty nine ninety nine if you want to pay in one payment. But if you want to split it over two payments, you can do that. One payment today and one payment in four weeks time. But uh, I just think it's lovely. It just really ticks the box in so many ways. Um, and is it is the it's okay to be different also stitch? as well yes it is yeah, yeah. So the birds it's are stitched and the actual message um, one other though I want to show you bearing in mind we're coming into the season of um, hospitality and maybe having friends around or family around for dinner or whatever it might be this next project that's down here is beautiful as well you've got birds on this look at the flowers that's on this this is the table runner okay not the cushion this is the table runner um, and the table runner size, if I can just remind myself, it is 36 by 86 centimetres or 14 by 34 inches. And this is on an Ada. 
Yes, it is, yeah. But it's again, it's quite a big coarse aider. Right. So it's a really lovely scale to work on. Again, you'll feel like you're really kind of pounding your way through at, reason at reasonable speed. Yeah, you're not so. covering the whole fabric, so it's no. just elements of it. No, yeah. absolutely. And the texture of the fabric is really beautiful. So I think it'd be worth getting one of those out and showing you the texture as okay. well, so. well. We'll do that a bit later on. But yeah. certainly if you fancy that one, we'll get the details in for that one for you today. And a table run is a lovely thing. It really is. And the decorative detail is at each end. Um, so you've got like the bottom left hand side and the top right hand side. And of course, the rest of it in the middle is, is open. So you can Absolutely. put your bowls on it and things yeah, like that. Yeah, exactly. And it's such a good price because linen, the price of linen has gone right through the roof at yeah, the moment. So absolutely so actually this is an amazing price because you'd struggle to buy the linen for and what a great hobby to have this time of the year the oh, evenings absolutely. it's getting darker earlier yeah um, you're having the fire on maybe now um, sitting there doing cross stitch or oh, doing it's, embroidery. it's stitches weather i tell you get the soup on get the oh, yeah, get the fire on nice. yeah, get the soup. stitching nice. out it's so nice absolutely <laughs> Pays on that one then, $29.99 is your first payment and $29.99 in four weeks time. Now we have got lots of other new kits that are less money than this as well. So don't think everything's gonna be 60 pounds in the show. Um, some of them are like 19.99, some of them are, yeah, 19.99, most of them seem to be. Uh, we're gonna put those on the website for you. We've got one with a lovely lighthouse, one with sailing boats. We've got one with white flowers that look like Christmas roses. Uh, we've got the bowhin, oh, no, I've just gotta give you a heads up about this. The bowhin needles, these were, last time we worked together, they sold mm. out. Yeah, I mean, it's an amazing um, kind of set, actually, but the heritage of the company is incredible. So they were founded in 1833 in France, and they are kind of the foremost French kind of needle makers. They're founded in the place in France that needle making began in that country. And um, as I say, they just do everything to such a beautifully high standard, and mm. they don't diversify, they only do tools um, right. for fashion and textiles. Let's so. give you details so you get a fighting chance of getting these. They did sell out last time. They are, they're almost a collectible, aren't they? Well, they are. And the thing is, these are actually, so, this is a product they actually released originally and they had a set across the decades and they re-released these recently because uh, in the original packaging because the original packaging and the printing was very fashionable at the time they were released mm -hmm. and then they found people recently requesting that they re relaunch them because they'd found some in their kind of grandma grandpa's uh, sewing tool sets and they were so useful and so beautiful that they wanted their own so they've got a needle for everything there absolutely you have and um, what a fantastic gift to give to give someone that you know loves cross stitch or loves sewing uh, maybe you're a fan of our sister channel sewing street then yeah for just over a 10 pound note what can you get that's worth having that a sewer would absolutely appreciate and love and cherish then this is perhaps the answer 11 pound 49 pence remember they did sell out last time we've got them back for you today and uh, a needle with heritage and a story to tell that's a lovely thing mm. kj3563 just thought i'd give you the heads up that it is available it is in stock rather than just leave it to the end of the show um give you everyone a fighting chance of getting hold of them because i know they, they were very popular last time that's it Perfect stocking filler, I think. Yeah, I agree. Well, wouldn't you love to get one of those? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, I would. Be, be a good gift for me. <laughs> okay, brilliant. Nudge, nudge, wink, wink. Yep. Yeah, just to um, let you know. <laughs> let's go back to our, it's okay yes. to be different then. Yeah. Um, I just think the imagery of this, I, I hadn't seen the imagery until I came over to see you just before the show started, but I, I just like the whole message of, of the project, to be honest. That's it. Um, and there he is, the, the odd one out in the middle there, but you know what, that's okay. It's just a really charming little chap, isn't he, as well? It's just yeah. that they're all like sitting there on the perch, all kind of fluffed out for winter, and then he's just sitting there having a right lark, you know, he is, so <laughs> that. And I also think it'd be really uh, nice, the lettering you could also do in different colours, so you could do it's okay to be in one shade and then different, different in, in, in the different red, colour, for yeah. example, to match your but bird. I'm, I'm wondering, you so. know, if it's them saying that to him, yes. or whether he's saying that to them. Who knows? Who's saying could it? go in either direction, couldn't it? That's the thing. <laughs> question. So the needles, yeah. just to let you know, are going very quickly. Glenis is in, Sue in West Yorkshire, uh, Shirley in Kent, Christine in the West Midlands, Karen in Middlesex. <laughs> They're going the same way as last time. If you want the bowhin needles, please put them in your basket as quickly as you can and check out because it's been a while since we've had them, okay? Okay, back to the it's okay to be different. Um, yes. Now, if this is going to be someone's Christmas gift, you've mm. got uh, a couple of months to do it. Ten weeks today. Yeah, well, ten weeks today. Oh, wow. Um, Yes, actually. So it's the kind of thing that you just maybe sit down and do some 
at, you know, like 20 minutes, half an hour every day, or it could be the way you finish your day and relax after work, or the way you start your day, kind of a bit, bit of you time. Um, so yes, it would be achievable. Okay. Um, because the nice thing is when we get going with this, you'll see it actually builds reasonably rapidly. Now you've got two pieces of paper on the chart. So if I separate those out, right. and you'll Shall see I hold the them up arrows. To the yes, please. Let me show you. This is your, it's like painting by numbers, but with thread. It is. So there you go. There are your two charts. King is going to get right in there for us on camera too. There we go. So each symbol represents a different thread or stitch? A different colour. Different colour. Yeah. Okay. So, yeah. Is it all the same stitch or not really? It's all the same stitch. It's all cross stitch. Right. And what you do is you get given this little kind of sweetie selection of, of threads. So you can see it's a beautiful selection of threads that you get in there. Mm -hmm. and, um, and what you do is they're all on these cards already. And at the top of the first sheet, there's a chart um, key. And it okay. tells you that there's a symbol for each of the numbers right. of thread. So, for example, I like to actually draw mine on. So I know that symbol S is one. It's a bit like if you're so doing diamond dots. Exactly like the same. The same. Mm. So I've written them on here. And then that corresponds to the chart. So all you need to do is to look at the chart and find the symbol and then stitch those bits. But where do you know where to start on well, the linen? Well, this is the bit. So on the chart itself, it's got two arrows. So... You've got an arrow here and an arrow here, and you literally follow it down and find the point that they meet. And you can see I've, I've drawn a little cross on, on here. Yeah. And that shows me the exact central point of the fabric and the design. So what I've done is I've folded my fabric in half and half again. And can you see I've used a water erasable pen, which I know we've got on the show from Boan today. Mm -hmm. And that finds the centre of the fabric. So you know your design centre and you know your fabric centre. Just let so everyone that's... know, 10% of the stock of this has already gone. Oh. I knew you'd love this. <laughs> I just knew you would. Yeah, so you know where to start now. Now, some people like to actually count out the threads and mark that also on a grid with tack lines or with the water erasable pen, which can then be removed after with water because these threads are colour fast. Mm -hmm. And some people just like to go from the centre out. So if we're going from the centre out, from this point, I just find all of my little diamond shapes, for example, and I know that I'm then going to be putting a stitch everywhere I've got, across everywhere I've got one of those. Okay. And in this case, it's a single piece of the perle thread, and it's um, over two threads of the fabric. Now, to start off, because I'm using a single thread, I'm going to put a knot in the end, and I know all of this is going to be covered up with stitching, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to start with my um, thread on the top, mm -hmm. I'm going to come at least an inch away, get stitching, and once I've stitched over that on the back, I can snip that knot off and it's all held in securely. Okay. So I don't have to worry about trying to start and stop with knots on the back and bumps. The first thing I, I know about and notice about this, mm. and what I love about it, is that the actual spaces where the needle are gonna, is going to go is actually much larger than So normal. easy to see. Yeah. yeah, it's really clear. So, And it also is very helpful if you put a contrasting colour underneath. So if you're sitting with this over your lap, for example, this is a brownish colour. Wear something that's going to contrast with this underneath, so a light um, thing over your lap, or even a tea towel over your lap, and it will help you to see the holes even clearer. So I'm just going across you, two threads of the fabric. Could you yeah. put like, um, like a, what are those lights that you can buy, those kind of um, plates? Yes, you could. You could put, put a light underneath. box light underneath box, if light that's box, helpful. Yeah. yeah, so if you find that useful, certainly it's, it's one of those things that um, it's really kind of you, you work with your eyesight, so make sure you're in good lighting anyway. Yeah. But if you help to backlight it, yeah, if that shows the holes up easier for you. Because particularly with a neutral coloured fabric like this, it's not like we've got white. Normally if you've got white fabric, we say put something dark on your lap mm -hmm. and it shows the holes up with this. It's kind of the other way around, mm -hmm. so, um, but yeah, you can see the scale of it is so easy. Yeah, each stitch is quite big, isn't it? So, so. yeah, because you're going across two threads of the fabric, it builds up quite rapidly. Now you can do individual crosses, so make sure, if possible, that your first stitch is going in the same direction each time, so that you have an evenness of tension and um, 
direction. I would say though, if somebody's coming to your house and looking at your cross stitch that closely, send them away. <laughs> so they're not you? they're not your people. <laughs> Maybe you've just been different with your stitching. Who knows? Do you need but, an embroidery hoop like you've got, or can you do it without? Um, you can do it without. It is easier with though because it holds the tension of the fret fret fabric a little bit easier. You don't have to hold it. Um, so it does mean that it's easier for you to be able to count your way through without having to worry about, you know, juggling between your hands. Right. So the other thing is I can see on my chart, for example, I've got a run of, say, four crosses here. So yep. what you can do so that you can get that in without kind of, if you're anything like me, forgetting, then you can pop your half stitches in all in the same direction. Oh, and then go back and do the other half. Yeah, exactly. Okay. So you're then back to the other place. Does that speed up the process a bit? Yeah, or? it does, actually, because you're kind of like not having to look backwards and forwards to try and remember what you're up to. So, but you can see the thread is really stark against that fabric and it really kind of has a lovely texture. You're kind of covering twice as much surface area as normally with normal cross stitch, aren't Absolutely. you? Absolutely. It does. And I just think the scale of it is so pleasing. And as yeah. I say, it's the kind of thing you could quite happily hold a conversation as we're doing you can you can you know watch you know watch your favorite tv channel mm -hmm. hobby maker. Um, absolutely yeah. watch hobby maker you can listen to you know the radio or whatever you're doing you don't have to have you know an air of silence you know you don't have to be cloistered away no, no, not <laughs> so at all. and also it's a very user-friendly fabric to give someone as a gift if you are making this for someone it's not going to clash with any furniture or any other color combinations it's a, it's a kind of a rustic natural beige mm. color which go with anything it is and the other thing is the fabric and the threads in this case are really hard wearing and color fast so you know it is made for life yes. so you you use it you enjoy it you sit against it don't be precious about your no, exactly. embroidery in that sense so it's made for you to enjoy obviously the only thing that it doesn't come with is the stuffing the actual cushion to go inside it so you will have to get that yourself yeah um, but everything else is in is in here all the threads are in here the pattern obviously is in here the needles in here as well but it's the picture this is this is what you'll be making if you just switched on look at that I love the design of it I love the shape of it I love the image and more importantly I love what it says so it's okay to be different I mean here here so say all of us it is okay to be different but we don't see projects like this very often you know, is the robin saying it to the others? Is the other saying it to the robin? I don't know, but it doesn't really matter. It's a lovely, lovely message to get out there. And Joni Nair, she is just in. Carol's checked out. Christine in West Midlands has checked out. It's on two split pays as well. Can I let you know as well, the book of needles, the Boeing needles that sold out before 30% of the stock has gone. It's got that story. It's got that heritage. It is a collectible, but also they are practical as well. But whether you choose to maybe buy a set to use, and then have a set to collect because it it's, it's kind of sewing history isn't it really it is sewing history and i think it's that thing i mean they even developed their own type of stainless steel and I, they really go to the highest level of detail possible you can't speak highly enough about this product <laughs> you know everything they make they just do really well it's just a joy to use and you think with that heritage they'd actually charge more for them but uh... you absolutely would but because they're making them generally for um they, they make them a lot for the general public, yes, but they also use them for trade. So it's the, you know, everyone I know that actually works professionally um, in dressmaking, etc. Um, uses, uses Bowen. Yeah, well, there we go. 11.49, I know Maureen in Tiny Weir has gone for two. Um, with everyone checking out, if you all check out, two thirds of the stock will have gone. I mean, if this is going to be a gift, a treat for a sewing friend or someone, uh, maybe you missed out on them last time. Maybe you uh, didn't pick up the phone quickly enough. Um, lots of you going for three. Why not? Yeah, you can go for as many as you want. But 11.49, you've got every needle you could ever possibly wish for, for any type of... I just think purpose. it's just the nicest gift and it's just so practical, so beautiful. You know, it's that William Morris thing, isn't it? Mm. Don't have anything in your home you don't believe to be practical and beautiful. Mm -hmm. This is both. And I just think it's such a good price. And do a little bit of an a internet search on mm. Bowen. Put their name in, B-O-H-I-N, and you'll see the heritage, you'll see the history. But if you're a, a sewer anyway, you probably know the history. But it's there for you today. Um, and the stock is going very fast at £11.49p. Mm. Now, let me show you the other cushion. Now, the other cushion that we've got for you is this one up here. Now, I've noticed recently the massive popularity of motorhomes and camper vans. 
And this is a 16 by 16 cushion, which is a fairly conventional size, isn't it? Yes, it is, yeah. Or 40 by 40 centimetres. Let me just angle it forward for you so you can see it a bit better. There we go. So that could be any type of camper van, but imagine someone that goes to festivals, someone that goes to campsites. You can have this in your camper van. It'll be absolutely perfect, yeah, when you've got that kind of bench seating and that sort of thing. Or when you're not using the camper van, have it indoors at home. But again, we all know people that will relate to this. Uh, I've got friends who never used to be, but are certainly now very much into their mobile homes. I mean, they cost a fortune, some of these They things. do, and, and I love how much people personalise them, and I love the fact that you're looking at that one and you like, that's been personalised. Look at the bunting around yeah. the top, the little flower in the middle. So that's somebody's, you know, home from home. Yeah. And I love that. You can really tell the personality of these people when Absolutely. they're out in their campers and they pass you on the motorway or whatever, and you're like, oh. I mean, the new posh ones are very yeah. nice, but I love the old VW um, oh, they're, campers they're so that have charming. been repainted yeah. and all sorts. Oh, and... we used to go on holiday and there was a family, um, a friends of ours who had a camper. And every time we went anywhere, my parents would be like, are you going to go with us in the car? Are you going with... And they didn't even get to the, are you going with the Thompsons? Mm. And we'd be like, we were with the Thompsons in the camper van. It was the best. It was the mm. biggest, biggest adventure. Yeah. It was so lovely. Well, so, yeah, a, camper van A journalist and newsreader I used to work with on the radio years ago, he was renovating um, one on the Isle of Wight, and it took him years, but he loved yeah. it. Every last minute of days off he had, he was there ripping up floorboards. Oh, they never get to the end of it. No. They'll, they'll get to the end of it and they'll be something else they want to do again. And yeah. they'll be like, oh, I'll just do that differently once you've lived with it for a little while. So. Well, if you want this one then, if this is for you or for someone that you know would really appreciate their very own camper van cushion, 44.99 BY3562. And again, all of these are suitable for beginners, yeah? Absolutely. They're so straightforward. And there's other things like, you know, you can see I've got tape at the top here and I've written the little symbol and the number of the thread. And as I've finished with the red thread, I've parked it up by its symbol so that when I you know, need to come back to that, I don't have to start it again. Right. So it's in good condition. It's not getting tangled on the back. I can just bring it back in when I want. And when I'm finished with this one, I can park this one up and bring the red one back in. And that is the great thing about this. You can just pick it up and put it down. You know, you know? If you've got to put a t an hour or two hours aside to do something and you can't be disturbed in the middle of it, you probably never end up doing it because you, can't, you never know when the phone's going to ring, when the doorbell's going to go. Um, with this, just pick it up and put it down and you get five, ten minutes, doesn't matter. Uh, and 44 99 for the camper van, it's a bit quirky and a bit tongue-in-cheek and a bit fun. Um, so, you know, you think of cross-stitch as being all floral or whatever, but no, you can have some really lovely, different kind of quite, uh, quite way-out designs. But if that is going to relate to someone in your family and you're thinking, I want to get that today, I want to make that for them for Christmas, you've got time to do it. Um, is that a double count like this one is, or uh, do we know? Can you have the front and I'll be able to tell you? Oh, yeah. Look at the size of the Ada. Oh, look so at the nice. Ida. Look, 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 look. If you're worried about the Ada being really, really tight and really kind of no. small, look, look at the size of the holes in there. So good. So if your eyesight like mine is not like it used to be. Fun and funky. Fun and funky. Fun and funky, that one. Yeah, good brilliant. Good to go. Yeah, and you get a lot of coverage quite quickly as well. So that's what's inside the packet. We've put the, obviously, the actual uh, uh, packaging on the front there for you to see, but that's what is inside. Um, and it's one of the biggest ones I've seen, actually, for Good, the whole perspective. Yeah, and it's with that pearly thread again. So right. same type of thing you don't as you're doing here. Don't have to split it. It's good to go. Brilliant. OK. Um, now, we're getting questions from beginners. Mm. Uh, what's the difference between linen and Aida? OK, so linen fabric is a single strand of linen going this way and a single strand of linen going that way. And you'd count, in this case, two threads of those linens, and that's what your cross sits over. With Ada, the linen uh, threads are grouped, so they create like a block in the middle. Right. So you get um, one hole and you're going into the next hole diagonally to create the cross. Gotcha. And it creates a nice big cross because it's a grouping of linen threads gotcha. and it's nice and clear to see that. Does Thank that make sense? Questions. Yeah, it does. Absolutely. Thank you for the uh, answer. Uh, now, um, who's going for, is this one the, oh, it's the AOK to be different. Christie's checked out, Carol has as well. Crafter in Northumberland and Joan in Ayrshire. 20% now of the stock of this has gone. It's one of the bigger ones. It is measured when it's made 58 by 40 centimetres. So that's basically uh, just over half a metre by just under half a metre. And then 23 by 16 inches. So it may look like an ordinary kind of quite small cushion, but it's actually quite a big one. Mm. Um, and I dare say if you wanted to actually not make a cushion out of it, but you wanted to frame it as a picture, could you do Do you know what? You could frame it. You could 
Use it as a centre of a quilt if you're a quilter or a patchworker. Right. You could use it, or the front of a tote bag. Yeah. You could do all sorts of things with that. Tape, make a table centre out of it. It's, there's, all these things are so versatile. It's only made into a cushion yeah. because that was the original idea, but if you don't want to stuff it, you don't have to, and use it in whichever way you want. Yeah, you uh, do you. And with split pay on it as well, twenty nine ninety nine today. I just think it's a great, a great thing, a great verse to have, and it says a lot for an awful lot of people, I think. Um, right, now, the little sewing kit. Mm. Have you seen this? They're great. This is very, very sophisticated. This is from Bowen as well. Now, oh, I didn't realise that until just then. Okay, so you're loving the needles, you're loving the heritage, you're loving the quality. And they are Parisian, well, they are French, yeah. They're so French, you've yeah. got the beautiful lady on the front with the Eiffel Tower in the background. This is going to fly, I just know it is, because what you've got in here, not only is the case beautiful, look at what's inside it. Bowen, scissors... You've got a tape measure, all branded. You've got your needle threader. You've got a smaller pack of needles from Bowen. Now this, what is this? Aha, well, this is a thread for everything you might want to need. So if you, it's basically a, a safety kit, a mending kit. And this, you can just pull a single strand out of it. So when you're mending something, you just grab the colour that you want and just pull one out really? and then you can thread it up. Yeah, that stays intact. It's so that you don't have a whole mess in your bag. You've got, so, you know, if maybe your buttons come off, you need to mend something, you know, you need to add something. You know, this is the perfect thing. So you keep it in your bag. I keep one of these in my suitcase. It's the best thing. I've yeah. never seen anything like it before. I gifted myself this one. <laughs> <laughs> It's a, it's a beautiful idea. Yeah, I tell great, you what, aren't they? The French have got it, haven't they? Just style. The je ne sais quoi. Je ne sais quoi. They've got je that something, definitely. Okay, I know that's what in doing. there. And then you've also got some safety pins as well. But look at the quality of the case. Mm. This is lovely. It really is gorgeous. And it's fabric. Mm. Now, we only got single figure stock of this. Oh. I wish we'd got more of this because this would have probably sold hundreds and hundreds and hundreds. Um, it's got the Parisian scene on the back and on the front as well. But what a lovely thing. It's £23.99. Let me pop all the pressures back in there. There's the scissors. There's the needles. There's your bowing. You can kind of pose with that. Your bowing tape measure. Have that round your neck. There's your safety pins. Here is your needle threader. And the most incredible thing of all, that. Your plat of threads. Your plat of threads. I, I right. think is this one about that case. If you decided that you didn't need all of these things to take with you all the time, you could take that with your jewellery when you're travelling. Mm. Oh, it's yeah. It's just so lovely. Definitely. Good for your earrings and all sorts of things. But I just think they're so handy. Absolutely handy, definitely. So. It could even become your purse. Mm. Now, it's looking like these are going to sell out. Nearly half the stock's gone. Sue in West Yorkshire, you've checked out. Congratulations, Sue. This is on the way to you. Janice in Essex, Julie in Cheshire, Fiona in Ayrshire. It's so elegant and sophisticated. It really, again, really is. At a price like that, you'd get one for you and one for a friend for Christmas, wouldn't you? Like, love, again, it's lovely stocking filler. Just incredible. OK. Now, we have also got some tools in the show, again from Bowen. Mm. Uh, now, we've got two sets of embroidery scissors... Now, which is which? They both look the same. One is left and one isn't. The one with the little diamond shape is the normal right-handed, okay. So this is your left-handed, okay. These are your left-handed Bowen scissors. They come in a Bowen pouch too. I think we had some Bowen scissors last time and I think they sold yes. out, didn't they? Yeah. yeah. Really popular. Look at the precision and look at the quality of these, though. These are your left hand, okay? Left handed scissors, left handed silver embroidery scissors, nine centimeters in length, but it's all about the precision of the cut and the quality for £22.99. It's good that they're making them for left handed people, too. Well, it is because actually a lot of left people, left handed people kind of have to just put up and make do with using the right hand and they kind of, oh, it's fine, I can make do. Well, why, why should you have to? Mm. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> like, yeah. You don't have to. They've got beautiful scissors for left handers now, fabric and, you know, embroidery. Well, so. lots of you are appreciating that. Julie in Cheshire, Sue in West Yorkshire. Um, yeah, loads of you coming in. Twenty two ninety nine if you want those scissors, and they come in their protective pouch as well. And the good thing is the point to the 
pivot is small enough for you to be able to pop if you were traveling on an airplane or anything like that those ones have got a short blade okay so and these ones slightly longer blade but these mm -hmm. are your right-handed embroidery mm -hmm. scissors okay uh, and the different item number obviously hw3590 these are only 11.99 that's a very good deal i know bowing scissors. i know when you know how well they make everything and they're just sharp beautiful they come with a little uh, protective sheath to keep them nice and safe when you're not using them so yeah really really good value and 11.99 bargain price this afternoon for bowen really really good quality anyone um, who is familiar with sewing and embroidery and stuff will i'm sure already know the brand and want to stock up so it's hw3590 11.99 for those they are a bargain and they're for righties okay now some of the other kits that we've got available for you um, now these are a little bit smaller hard anger one first of all that's this one isn't it no that's cross stitch hard anger i think is on the front that one no on the front of the display oh, sorry big of them that's how, that's here there okay now when we've done shows before hard anger yeah a big surge of interest in it yeah, people kind of worry about hard anger because you've got to do the embroidery and then cut the bits away. But when people see it, they're like, oh, it's so beautiful. It looks very lacy. You can pop it on top of a contrasting fabric and it shows through the holes and decoration. And it's so straightforward. I know we've demonstrated it here before mm. and people are always astonished by how quickly and easily they can create the effect of it so the hard anger so, technique is basically where you snipped away the square yes yeah, so you embroider a block of satin stitch in four directions and then you can snip away the little bits of fabric in between and it creates this lacy effect now if you were paying for one of these actually made it would be so expensive right. they're so expensive to purchase but the work of it actually goes in quite rapidly it's very effective it's combined with cross stitch so it has to be hand done it can't be done by machine it, mm, they've got something close to it, but it doesn't create this effect right. and it's not, it's not as beautiful as this. Well, that's what you can make. Mm. Where you see the arrow on the packaging, that's what you're actually going to be making. So this is the table centerpiece, okay? Um, it's 28 by 28 centimetres and you could put a little pot plant or maybe a fruit bowl or something in the middle of that yeah. or a little bowl of flowers or something like that. We haven't got many of these available as well. We haven't got as many as we want. 19 99 but what would you pay if you were to buy that hand made i mean you're looking at you know 40 60 pounds really yeah, yeah absolutely because it takes you've got to it pay takes for the time, time to yeah. work so you at, at the very least that's well jill yeah. in essex is in crafter mm. in northumberland coming in as well and also it's not a massive project so not too daunting if it's the first time you've no done it. and it's i love the colorway and as i say, I love the combination with the cross stitch it just has that lovely thing where you're working onto the fabric with the embroidery and then cutting the fabric away as well you're kind of creating a couple of different planes and it's that heritage as well because you know this is a norwegian technique and um, from the norwegian fjords the hardanger region mm -hmm. hence the name and it's on their national costume they still wear it uh, a lot in Norway and very kind of very much take pride in their in their cultural um, heritage of the embroidery there but Terrific. it's just for everybody's home isn't it it's gorgeous it's great to know a bit a little bit about the history as mm. well and again if you want to internet search hard anger as well you can do of course and find out more about uh, the history of it now this is really up my street because when I got married a few years ago I got married on New Year's Eve and had Christmas flowers or Christmas roses as my buttonhole um, and that's what these are these are Christmas that's roses, so aren't they? lovely yeah so it's it there's such a lovely um design it's very Victorian looking and um again really lovely to work and have in your home but also so straightforward and it's onto the um even weave linen again a slightly finer one mm -hmm. but still over two counts of the thread so exactly the same technique we were just looking at being two strands of stranded okay so uh, yeah, if you don't want to have a project that's too big or it's going to be too much of an investment in time um, it, again have it framed like they've done on the packaging there that looks amazing and maybe these flowers are um, sentimental to you for the same reason as me maybe you have them uh, uh, maybe you've got a you know a Christmas a Christmas wedding Christmas civil Christmas civil partnership or whatever uh, well Christmas roses are, are special to you or they make a fantastic Christmas gift obviously 19.99 is a really good price on this you don't get the frame obviously but you do get the um, you've got the Aida you've got the threads there of course as well I mean I suppose if you wanted to could you make this into could it go on the front of a card 
Yeah, I mean, the size of the fabric is 20 by 20, but you can see the area of the embroidery that I've got here, I've marked it off on my chart. So if I show you my chart here, because yeah. I've marked it out with my yellow pen. So that could go on an eight by eight. It card. could certainly go on a card mm -hmm. front mm -hmm. or a box top. Mm -hmm. You could make a, a, a ring cushion if you are choosing to have a Christmas wedding. So hey, what about that? The ultimate mm. Christmas card. A card Beautiful. that normally you take down after two or three weeks after mm. Christmas, you keep up as an ornament all year round. Absolutely. Really beautiful. And, you know, what a gift as well. So, Okay, I love well, that. come and watch you doing that in a second. Mm. So that's the one that Helen's going to move on to. We've also got these, which are a little bit more kind of, um, kind of seaside y and a little bit more kind of um, light, lighter. Um, and if you love the seaside, love being by the sea, uh, I'm, I'm a south coast boy through and through bournemouth in that area so this is right up my street the sailboats in the distance and all the beautiful flowers just there as well look at how gorgeous they are the wildflowers in the foreground the sailboats in the background and this is a complete stitch picture isn't it from it bottom is, to top it is yeah it is and i just think actually this is for, for everybody really but it's also for people who may be feel a bit sad in winter i mm -hmm. just think i saw this earlier and i just thought oh that's so lovely it feels so fresh and yeah. sunny and you feel like you know you're approaching the beach and you know that first smell of fresh sea air yeah so it just has all that kind of um ideas and emotions that come to you all those happy memories yeah, maybe you've got so. a, a, a corner in a room that's a little bit dark and geez, it just needs lifting a little bit maybe you've got a, a conservatory or something like that and you want something bright and kind of airy maybe it's memories of, of holidays family holidays that sort of thing make it into a cushion front put it in your camper van with your other one absolutely like, good idea yeah it's all aspirational this is where we're going next in our camper van <laughs> <laughs> now this one is under 20 pounds only 19.99 and size wise you're looking at 13 by 18 centimeters which is five by seven so again that can be incorporated into a card if you wanted to do or put it into a frame on the wall so again not a daunting size to to you know, you know, undergo and enjoy. So that one's the sailboats. Then the other one, actually they'd look good both together, mm, I think, they these. Would. side by side. You've got your lighthouse. What coastline is that? Maybe. It could be, it could be in South Shields, according to Laura, my producer. I'm not oh. quite sure, I've not been there, but it could be near you, wherever you may be in the UK. But I think as a, a twosome, side by side on the wall, they're just, uh, they're just perfect together, aren't they? Mm. If you wanted both, one p and p of three ninety five. That's how we do things here at Hobby Maker. Nineteen ninety nine each, under forty pounds, and you could have two really stylish um, cross stitch pictures on your wall or on someone else's if you're doing them for someone else. And I always think it's so lovely when you're making things for other people. Um, a gift bought from the shop is lovely, but a gift that's been made for you and has taken you know hours to do. Giving that gift of time, yeah. isn't it? It's that time's the most precious thing we've got now. It's the most precious commodity we have. And I just think given the gift of time and thought, you find a design that you think conjures up that person and that they're going to really enjoy. And then you spent the time to make it for them. And then you're giving that beautiful gift, yeah. for all of those things. And it just shows so much um, how important that person is to you, well, how much you think about them. You'd never ever want to be parted from it. No, exactly. You'll always have it. You'll always have it on the wall or whatever you choose to do with it. But we're going to go back though to our Christmas roses because this is proving very popular. Um, we've already established that it could go on an eight by eight card blank if you mm. wanted to use it in that way. Probably you, you more likely want to put it in a frame and put it on the wall. But there they are, look, instantly recognizable as Christmas roses. So this could be uh, a decoration that stays up all year round or comes out with a Christmas tree every year for, you know, four or five weeks. That's it. I also think it's the kind of thing, you know, you know some, I know some people who like to make Christmas stockings. Mm -hmm. So you could make that into the centre bit of a, a stocking band as well for your Christmas presents. Just so nice. Oh, yeah, so nice. And so <laughs> elegant as well. Yeah. So is this Aida? Um, no, so this is linen, okay. and because um, they're not grouped, the threads aren't grouped in the fabric. You've got individual threads going this way and this way, so okay. in the warp and wet. But Aida is being used in the lighthouse and yes, boat. yes, they are. Yeah. So yeah, so the Christmas roses is, is the is the linen, and you're going to use two strands of the stranded, and again you've got the cards that tell you exactly what everything's going to be, and you just number them up exactly the same way. Now again, I like to mark up my chart so I know exactly where I am you know life is busy you kind of think oh I can grab 10 minutes here and do a bit here and a bit there mm -hmm. so 
if you've cropped, like, marked up your chart, you know exactly what you're doing and what you can come back to it without any worry. I mean, it could be that you work in a place where when you have your lunch break, there's nothing really to do. Maybe it's an industrial estate like here or... And, and you end up just kind of sitting reading the newspaper or whatever it may be. Take it to work with you. Yeah. Do it in your breaks. I know... Um, I know a couple of nurses who actually take cross stitch with them in their handbag everywhere they go. Wow. And they don't get a lot of downtime. I, no, I bet. But it's very, very stressful. So I know one in particular that if she has the chance to scoff down a quick lunch, she'll take five minutes of that lunch. She'll super speed eat and she'll take five minutes of her lunch to just do some cross stitch. And it just, just settles her down. Her down. Like yeah. you can yeah. imagine, it's a very stressful job, isn't it? So, but that's the beauty of, of hand embroidery and, mm. and things like this. You're creating something beautiful, you're engaging with something beautiful, but it also, it does give you a, a, a space away as well, a mental space. And you can be as sociable as you like, chatting away, or it can just be your space. And the sense of achievement, seeing something develop yes. from nothing. Exactly. Um, now you've done a grid on there. Tell us about that. What have you? I have. Now, what, what you can do, again, if you are worried that you're going to you know, lose your place or that you're not going to be too sure, or if you're the kind of person who doesn't like to work continuously out from a particular point from the centre, if you want to be able to jump around and, you know, well, well I want to do the bird's face or I want to be able to do the bird's belly or I want to do a particular thing, then, um, you know, well, I want to do all the leaves. You can chart it up like this, so you can tack it out, or you can use a water erasable pen. So I know we've got these on the program. Now the water erasable pen mm -hmm. is on the screen now for you, five pounds, and it's yeah. okay to wash the embroidered piece when you finished it. Yeah, it? absolutely. These are all colour fast, right. so it just comes out with water. So what you do is you take it out of your hoop at the end, and you just immerse it in nice clean water, cold water and it will just disperse, it will just disappear. So uh, if, once you've done it, you think, oh, I'm still seeing a tiny little bit of blue once it's dry, just mm. dunk it again, right. just leave it to dry, and it will all be gone. I bet it's quite a sad moment when you've finished one, and you think, oh, that's it, done. Yeah. I was enjoying that. <laughs> it is, but there's every stitch has got a thousand projects they want to stitch. Yeah. So we're always like... Lots on the go. Yeah, well, you, some people commit themselves, to, again, it's the stitcher's mind, some people commit themselves to one thing at a time a lot. I'm not doing anything else until I finish this one, but it, believe me, they've got a queue of things waiting yeah, yeah, yeah. For, to, be, to be stitched. <laughs> or some people like to juggle a lot, and it depends on their mood. Right. So it's, there's a lot of space for personality and embroidery, and you just kind of find the way that suits you. Um, and again, everyone's different, aren't mm -hmm. they? So, but it's, yeah, it's one of these things that I think it's a really easy way of kind of finding yourself. And again, you can just count out the threads, 10 threads, and then you mark with the pen. It's really easy. Mm -hmm. And I say, it just disappears completely with water. And of course, the water erasable pen, you can use that in any type of um, sewing, not just cross stitch and that yes. sort of thing. So it's handy yeah. for all sorts. Exactly so. I mean, as I say, it's just such a foolproof system. And as I say, I'm just you know, marking off as I go. And the good thing is if you use a, um, you know, yellow highlighter, it, if you make a mistake or you're not too sure, you can photocopy that on a black and white photocopier and the yellow highlighter doesn't show up anyway. Okay. So... Good idea. Yeah, so you can kind of start again with it if you're worried. Now, have we got any of those sewing kits left, Laura? Laura's our producer today. There are four left. Ooh. The next four of you... Uh, I don't know how many of you have got them in your basket, but the sewing kit from Bohin is, there are four in baskets. So if you want it, you've got to be quick to check your basket out. $23.99 for that sewing kit. Uh, and have we got many of the needles left? Half the stock has checked out already with loads of you putting them in your basket. This is, uh, again, like a needle library. It's got the history of Bohin running through each and every one. We're in single figure stock now with everybody when they check out. So remember, some people do put things in their basket and forget to check out or get distracted. But if everyone does check out, we're single figure stock at £11.49. Grab them, check out. We'll get them to you as quickly as possible. Go for both, actually. Do you know, I think they're so useful. As I say, you've got a needle for every occasion and they are such good quality. You look after them, they'll look after you kind mm -hmm. of thing. And then again, this, as I travel with mine, because you never know what's going to, you know, life. Life happens, buttons fall off. You know, it's one of those things. So um, it just covers you for all eventualities. And we have actually got different size needles available. If there's a particular size of needle you're after, they're going to be on the website. You know what you're looking for, they're there. Uh, are they Bohin as well? Yeah. Mm. 
all of them are Boeing in the show. So uh, yeah, if there's one in particular that you're looking for, have a little look at hobbymaker.co.uk and you can see them there. That's it. So I finished with that dark green, so I'm just going to bring that out the way. And and I'm just can I just bring remind the everybody at home, when you're doing anything like this, please take a picture and send it to us. Yeah. Um, not just card making, that's not all we do here at Hobby Maker, it's a hobby channel, so it's anything that you're making. Picture, picture it with your phone, email it to studio at hobbymaker.co.uk. Uh, do that automatically after you've made anything and you stand a chance of winning a hundred pound account credit. We do that every oh. last Saturday of the month. So just share your makes with us. That and makers like to see other people's mm. makes. You oh, know, totally. it's one of those things. It's so lovely to see things finished and see, see people's finished pieces. But also, if you've gone off piste, you know, you've maybe bought it as a cushion, but you've made it into something else. Mm. Like, be great to see those. So, yeah, really nice. Now, we did sell out of the needle threaders. I know you're going to get one needle threader in the very lovely sewing kit there, but if you want the needle threaders on their own, they sold out last time that Helen was here with us. Mm. Um, it's a pack of two, and it's provided by Bowen as well, so they're manufacturing the needle threader. If you have and do struggle with getting whatever ever thread through the eye of a needle, you need a pack of these. Um, I think that, are they here? Mm. Can't see them. Basically, you're going to get two There's of one these. In the pack. Yeah. yeah, just show you. You know what they look like anyway, but yeah, you get basically a pack of two of those, which is a lot easier to thread a needle with that than it is to try and do it. Well, anymore. I always say threading the needle's not your hobby, embroidering with the thread is. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> so true. don't make it hard for yourself, use the needle threader. Exactly. A couple of them for just £2.99. But um, yeah, the last few of those sewing kits are going. And good luck if you want them. I bet our Hayley West will be on the phone for these. <laughs> massively into her sewing and so on. So, Wow, they're just so stylish, them, aren't they? And yep. as I say, you can use that, that box again as well, the case. So, so good. But you can see this develops quite quickly. I only started this when I turned up at the studio mm -hmm. earlier. And drew my grid, got everything out, had a look at it. a massive investment in time, is it? No, I've been chattering away. I've been doing making cups of tea. How many biscuits. colours do you recommend having on the go at once, then? Do you know what? It doesn't matter if you've got a system. You can have as many as you like, because always bring your thread to the top if you're not using it, right. because otherwise you'll, you will, with the best will in the world, get a nest on the back, because right. you can't see it, you can't control it. Bring it up, keep it nice and taut and the tension out of the way. I've parked it up with my tape, with my little symbols or my number of threads, so I know what they are, so I can bring them back in saves you some thread faffing around later on mm -hmm. and then as I say you can have as many as you like you know if you run out of space on your tape here put another piece there you know you're not you're not making it difficult for yourself to work so yeah it keeps it all nice and neat and controlled just to show you if you just switched on what uh, Helen's actually working on at the moment it's this one um, made up it will be does it give me a size yeah 20 by 20 is the picture size 20 by 20 centimetres, really beautiful. But again, how you mount it, how you frame it, or what you do with it is entirely up to you. If you're incorporating it into a quilt, if you're incorporating it into a cushion cover, or just doing similar to what uh, they've done on the packaging, it's entirely up to you. But Christmas roses, 19.99 if you want that one. Uh, and that is on linen. Um, all the instructions, all the pre-coded and carded yarn is there for you. Uh, if you do want the Aida, if that's what your fabric of choice is, um, if I just show you on these two kits, these are the only, I think these are the only two that have got Aida, aren't they? Is that right? Uh, the large yellow with the birds has got ah. a large scale Aida. Ah, okay, the table runner, that's Aida. But here you can see this is Aida, so pretty easy to see where the actual holes are in the fabric. And these are the two, the uh, lighthouse and the sailboats, 19.99 each and they are 13 by 18 centimetres, okay? Now, if we go back to the very beginning of the show, I well, know that not all of you are watching at three o'clock. If you weren't, you may not know we've got this in the show. There's still loads and loads and loads of you put, putting this in your basket. Please check out your baskets. As soon as I saw the theme on this, I just thought, you know what? I love that, and I think everyone watching is gonna love it as well. It's okay to be different. And how many times have we all said that in our lives? Um, everyone's unique, you know, but sadly not everybody else thinks that way sometimes. So this, I just think, is saying a lovely message. And you can just see the little Robin Redbreast there, thinks he's the odd one out. But the big question from me was, is it those white birds saying it to him, giving him reassurance, or is it the red one saying it to the others going, I don't care? <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> or to them, like encouraging them over to his side. Yeah, yeah. It's exactly. like, it's okay to be different. Yeah. Don't, you don't have to try and fit in, it's fine. Yeah. <laughs> now, this is linen, okay? It's a linen, a, quite a large thread count yes, as well. Yes, it is, yeah. And it's a, a big project. I say big project. It's a big cushion. It's 58 by 40 centimetres, so over half a metre long by 40 centimetres high, which is 23 by 16 inches. So it's, you know, it's a, a big, big well, cushion. Well, if I pop that out of the, fat of the frame, you can see how big the fabric oh, is. Oh, brilliant. Thanks. So that'd be nice and straightforward for you. So ignore the hanging there threads. Go. There it is. Look. That's big, isn't it? But equally, you may not want to make a cushion out of it. You may want to do something else. That's entirely up to you. But that's the sort of size we're talking about here. Obviously, it doesn't come with the cushion pad. You've got to find a way of kind of filling that. Do they make cushion pads that yeah, size? Yeah, you can get cushion pads in all sorts of sizes. Okay. Yeah, cool. absolutely. So it's a, it's a big project, but you are covering quite a large surface area. Mm. It's a double count, isn't it? So each yes, stitch goes yeah. twice as far So as each stitch is over two threads of the fabric. Right. So it's really nice. You can see it just, it's just going to build up really nicely. Um, so as I say, it's not something you're going to spend. It's a big piece of fabric, but it's not going to be one of those things that you spend a lifetime. No, you know, seven years and still stitching. No, 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 no. So <laughs> I mean, it's been, I'm not surprised. I knew it would be popular. Um, it just kind of strikes a chord with all of us, doesn't it, really? Two split pays of $29.99. It's OK to be different. Um, T ID, sorry, ID 3508. Now we've got the mechanical chalk pencil uh, in white available, which I think is this. Yes. This one. Now this sold really well last time. So you've actually got lots of refillable elements to the chalk pencil. So, um, I mean, this is a must, isn't it? For anyone that works with fabric really. Yeah, so mine's open, have a look at that. Cool. You get the sharpener with it as well. Okay. And, um, and it's just a really handy kind of scale. So quite often they're quite, um, Piddly. They're just yeah, a tiny I'm little, sure. very breakable. Yeah, I always think yeah. it's like triangles. Yeah, so they they crumble. And actually, this one has the rubber on the end if you've made any mistakes or you want to kind of erase it. It's quite good for embroidery onto dark fabrics, but also good for dressmaking and quilting. So very versatile. Got 16 spare yeah. chalk sticks as well. Absolutely, yeah. That's cool, really cool. Okay, so didn't know that existed actually. I've never seen that <laughs> before. I've seen them in triangles and so on. Uh, $16.99 if you want your chalk, and that's uh, JY3575. That's your item number if you want that today. That did sell very, very well last time Helen was here, so it's back today. Again, it's manufactured by Bowen, so you know that everything is manufactured the highest possible standards. Um, the nice thing about that one as well is it's quite a quite a nice scale to the um, shaft of it so you don't if you've got rheumatism or arthritis you're not gripping something tiny right so it right. works for everybody next three people to check out the sewing kit from Bowen are going to be lucky uh, that's all we have left three left now remember it's got in it it's got the the thread well, I think it's a fantastic idea. it's great isn't yeah. it the scissors the needles the safety pins and also you've got the Bowen tape measure as well or in a rather attractive box which could also be a little kind of trinket case mm. maybe for jewelry if you get on a holiday or bedside cabinet or something like that but very very je ne sais quoi absolutely thank you helen great to see you oh, thank you brilliant demos as ever um it goes so quick we'll see i know it does doesn't i it? know i know we'll see you again very soon <laughs> thank you uh, i'm up next we've got uh, we've got more from hunky dory on the way don't go anywhere becca's here with those fantastic little books don't go anywhere <laughs> Did you know that digital downloads are now available on the Hobbymaker website? Just pop over to hobbymaker.co.uk, go to downloadable content, choose the collection you would like to buy and click purchase. This will be an instant payment and once purchased you will receive an email. Click on the link and it will take you here. Click download and once downloaded the file will appear in your downloads folder. Right click on the folder and click on extract all. Once extracted, open the folder, click auto run and you're ready to craft. For more information, help and support, go to the further details section of the purchase page. Digital crafting with Hobbymaker. Here at Hobbymaker, we want your shopping experience to be as simple as possible. That's why you can buy as many items as you like all day and only pay one postage and packaging fee. It doesn't matter what weight, 
size or quantity of your order or how many times you check out that day, you still will only be charged one p and p Shopping made simple with Hobby Maker. When you purchase anything on Hobby Maker, you have a 30-day money-back guarantee, meaning that you can shop with confidence. Happy shopping with Hobby Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobby Maker. If you've recently missed your favourite show on Hobbymaker, it's really easy to catch up on our website. Simply visit hobbymaker.co.uk and click TV Guide. Here you'll be able to choose any show broadcast in the last seven days, which you can watch, pause and rewind at your convenience. And to make shopping even easier, any items featured in the show will appear underneath. With Hobbymaker's Catch Up, there's never a reason to miss out, no matter what time of day. Are you having trouble finding the perfect gift? Then why not treat them to the new gift card from Hobbymaker at hobbymaker.co.uk. Simply scroll down to the bottom where it says gift cards, click and you'll be taken to the right place. Decide between posting the card or delivery by email and then decide how much you want to add. You choose the value. So what do you get the crafter that's got everything? Why not treat yourself or them to the Hobbymaker gift card? Hey everyone, good afternoon. Welcome back to Hobby Maker. It's uh, great to have you company. Beck is back for part two. We are, yes. You Second right? show. Absolutely. Can I just let you know, um, in case you weren't with us at two oh, o'clock, yeah. or you may have forgotten, like, like we did, um, we've got the card to give away in Davy B's Lucky Dip. Yes. All you've got to do is, Beck, I made that in the two o'clock show. You can watch that show back a bit later if you want to. Uh, email in your name, address, and customer number. That is all we need, and we'll announce the winner of that card at the end of the show just before five o'clock okay so studio at hobbymaker.co.uk send your emails in to that address good luck one person will be selected at random to receive that card just before five fab now it's all about the pocket pads oh i love know them. i love 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 these these are so cute they're so cute they're fabulous aren't they they're hot off the press they are yeah brand new only a few days ago basically yep. and the pocket pads basically are slightly smaller than the little books aren't they they they're are a6. absolutely these are a6 yeah okay yeah a6 in size but the themes are amazing you've got your mystic moments perfect pets music to my ears beautiful botanics and garden visitors yeah let me show you the boards oh they're amazing aren't they so you've got 48 is it 48 sheets? Four, uh, 64. Oh, no, 64. 64, 64, 64 yeah. in each book. 64. Sorry, the A7 as well, yeah. A7, beg yeah, your yeah, pardon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, now look at this. I know. Perfect pets. You've got little hamster, puppies, black cat, cockatoo, field mouse. Oh, well, I used to have ears like that. Oh. Uh, little budgie, <laughs> chameleon, goldfish, horse, 
hair. Look at his face. He's, the chocolate lab. He is just... He's enjoying life, chasing yeah. those butterflies. Guinea pig. It's like my Maisie. Oh. Cockerel. And then Finding Nemo. Yeah, there you absolutely. Go. The angel. Is it angelfish, butterfly fish? Clownfish. Clownfish. That's yeah. it. Clownfish, yeah. So you get all of those, but many times over, 67 sheets, 64, sorry, 64 sheets in total, 16 designs, four of each. I know, yeah. So you can uh, pyramage them, decoupage, lay them up, put multiples on one. This is the great thing, because they're so small. I say they're so small, because they're pocket size. Mm. They, they're so great. If you want to squeeze two or three on a card, yep. they really, really do suit it as well. Okay, now, if you want the garden visitors, yeah. you've got the bee, you've got the wasp, you've got the beetle, you've got the dragonfly. Let's pop it down there. It's easier for oh, you to see. Oh, perfect. There we go. There we go. Look Have a little look. Look at those. Look at them. Look at the colours. Look at the artwork. Amazing. So vibrant, aren't they? Then your butterflies. There's the beetle, there's the butterfly. I think this is it. Grasshopper. I know, and you might not think to, you know, it's quite niche, but because these are so good and they're so small, we can jam pack loads of artwork Absolutely. into here. Yeah. Get some things that are a bit more niche. And I think we've all kind of become very aware of like how important like pollinators are to us these days. Yeah. And, and it's just so, look at the caterpillar. <laughs> now you are getting five books if you go for the set, okay? Yeah. Uh, music to my ears. This is brilliant. Mm. They're at the moment, five pound each. So you've got every type of instrument you can think of. So whether someone's into classical, jazz, pop, whatever, yeah. there'll be an appropriate topper. Look, again, I love that saxophone. Yeah, me too. And again, some really niche instruments in here. You know, if you know someone that plays one of these instruments, how special are you going to feel when you receive a card with that? I don't know anyone that plays the bagpipes. Uh, well, you know, you might. <laughs> <laughs> or a harpist. Or yeah, yeah. <laughs> So that's, I love it, I love it. And then this one, if you love the um, kind of myth and magic. Yeah. If you absolutely. love your, 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 uh, your favourite film characters and all that sort of thing, this is going to be right up your street. If you love, um, you know, your, your superb, uh, I'm trying to think of the uh, like Harry Potter sort Harry of Potter, style. Yeah, you've got Twilight, Sabrina. And again, you've got some more sort of fairies and mystical ones steampunk ish steampunk well. yeah, yeah definitely and again like look at that fairy toad stool the oh, look at the toad one. look at the toad in his suit toad. all dressed up there we go that is kind of disney-ish isn't yeah, it possibly a bit, with a that bit. lots of themes in there and then everyone loves a botanical so this is the fantastic uh, paper book with the uh, botanicals inside Sunflowers, uh, I'm not very well up on all my names of flowers, I must admit. I've got a hydrangea there, I can see that. Yep, you've got your hydrangea. Uh, those orange ones are your chrysanthemums. Maybe make them into calendars. Yeah, do like yeah, a, a flower calendar using course. these. Especially with how many seasons. I mean, daffodils in March, you mm -hmm. know, chrysanthemums in the autumn. You've got the daisies in April. Yeah, they're perfect. So we are doing a deal with you right now. You're going to get all five packs. You're going to get two for nothing. If you buy them as a set of five, you're only paying for three. I reckon you're going to get the Mystic Moments and the Perfect Pets for free. £14.95, £10 off, one P&P for the whole day of £3.95. And if there's 64 sheets in each book, uh, that's 364 times five, 620. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Is that right? I'll no, go 60, with that. no, 64 <laughs> times five, 320. Yeah, 320. I said 620. 320, there we go, 320 sheets, 320 cards, 320 yeah. projects. Absolutely, yeah. And work at 320 cards and you're going to be paying 14.95. Add a little bit on for your stash and your time. Exactly. Yeah, but of course, you may not make that many because you may want to cut into them, decoupage yeah. them, do whatever you want with them. But they are just brilliantly fun. They really, really are. Fourteen ninety five gets you all five of them. We have got the Miri mats in the show for these as well, which we're going to come on to uh, in a minute. So we'll show you those soon. We've also got these. Now, these are our Say It With Style pads. Now, we've put together a pick and mix including the new ones that we've just shown you, you can choose any three of the Say It With Styles. Now, the Say It With Styles, basically, are black and white. Yeah. And they're different themes. So you can literally colour them in if you want to. They've all got different themes. I and mean, this one is your uh, Say It With Style pocket pad. This one's called... Um, 
Oh, it's, yeah, that's, it's just here next to the barcode. Oh, fantastic florals. There we are. You so can see how it down good the are these going to go as sentiments with your images, with the botanicals? Yes, exactly. Or inserts, maybe? I mean, this one is your fabulous friends. So all different themes. There we are, look. Yeah. You get some of the same, a few of the same. There's a sloth, so you can colour these in if you want to, leave them black and white if you want to. Coffee and friends make the perfect blend. How about yes. that? Brilliant. So that one is fabulous friends. Then we go on to inspiration and wisdom. So you know what theme you're after. They're yeah, around and we reach for the stars as they all burst into song, Becky. Uh, there are so many reasons to be happy. Good things, as good things are coming. Enjoy the little things. They're great, aren't they? So yeah, colour them in. Back. You can use your pens, you can use your pencils, you can use watercolour, whatever you want. But of course, these are available as a pick and mix. And so are the five that we showed you earlier on. Um, so if you want these, which one yeah. do you want to look at? Just for laughs. Just so for laughs. Got, let's have a look. We've got occasions. There's so many. We've got in the snow. We've got the Christmas spirit. Uh, I've got just for laughs. got a full Christmas range. Oh, you found it. Found it, just for laughs. Okay, so these are the kind of tongue-in-cheek puns. Yeah, and that they're sort of very thing. funny, these. <laughs> there we go, look. Every family has one weird relative. If you don't know who it is, that's because it's probably you. Yep, always. The four seasons are all different. Some are warmer than others. Oh, <laughs> but, uh, life without music would be flat. Absolutely. That would go so well with the instruments. Yeah, it would, wouldn't it? Never make the same mistake twice. Make it five or six times just to be sure. Yeah. <laughs> What's that say? When life shuts a door, open it again. It's a door. That's how they work. That's how they work. <laughs> <laughs> Love it. Chocolate doesn't ask silly questions. Chocolate understands. They're so fun, aren't they? So that's um, the little book of laughs, or just for laughs. So you've actually got two, there's three. How many did you choose from? I think there's 20? about 20 in total. Yeah. So you've got the, the Say It With Star ones are the black and white sentiments and images that you can yeah. colour in. But remember, these books, these are included in the pick and mix as well, the yes. pocket pads. So you might want to go maybe for the pet pocket pad yeah. and a couple of the Say It With Styles. Yeah. So you might want to go for a couple of the pocket pads and one Say It With Style. You can mix them. Any three for $9.99. Yeah. If you want to go for the set of five pocket pads, that's a different item number, and that's $14.95 for the whole lot. Amazing. But if you want to pick and mix any three of the Say It With Styles and the pocket pads, just have a little look on the website or call the call centre. Um, they're brilliant in the call centre. They will read out all the ones, and you just tell them which ones you'd like. 0800 001 4433. Or on the website, you can see all of the options. It's scrolling down on the screen at the moment, and you can see you've got fantastic florals, you've got fabulous friends, You've got occasions just for laughs. Select three, put it in your basket. You'd be charged nine ninety nine. There we are. Look, it makes oh, them three twenty nine each. They are a bargain, aren't they? That's what Absolute your web. That's bargain. what your website basket will look like when you put three in and then go to check out. Right, demo time. Demo then. time. Yep. Okay, so we are going to go with the absolutely amazing, beautiful botanicals one here. It's perfect, isn't it? Now, I've got some of my favourite sheets out of this. Now, we have um, been a little bit bougie because, I'm sorry, they work that's out at three pounds. a lot of favourites. Like, yeah. <laughs> You're allowed. How can you pick a favourite flower, though? So, I picked six, you know, just a reasonable six. You get 16 designs, so we've still got plenty left. And we're going to make our sort of... You know that French style decoupage, collage style background? Mm -hmm. We're going to do that. Okay, so we are armed with our trusty glue stick and a piece of ink me that measures, we're measuring seven by seven at the minute, but I think we will cut it down. Okay. So we're just going to absolutely just glue these on, just like you do with your sort of, like I said, your French style decoupage. Um, so traditionally french style decoupage uses white pva glue but i'm just going to use my glue stick because it dries a little bit quicker okay for demoing goes on purple clean goes uh, on purple. dries clear absolutely because they're nice and lightweight as well now if you want any of the hunky dory essentials like the glue the tools all that stuff check, yeah, the, website check the website out at uh, our website hobbymaker.co.uk yeah absolutely obviously you get that little bit of time to wiggle your design around with your glue stick especially if you put plenty on and then we're just going to sort of layer these, layer these on. And then let's have a look. Well, loads are coming in, wanted to win your card back. Oh, up. thanks, guys. That's so kind. Um, okay, then we're just going to, what we're going to do is we're just going to start angling these as well. And then let's start here with the daffodil. 
So just a nice, I need to wind my glue stick back up. There we go, perfect. And then... Well, the glue sticks are perfect for this technique, aren't they? Aren't they? They absolutely are. And then going next with our sunflower on the left. And then as well, this is making our own pattern paper. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Um, you know, and you can obviously do this over and over again with different designs, the diff all the different pads. You know, you could do it's, this. It's technique. making me think about like um, old fashioned kitchen diaries. Yeah. Remember the old. Apps like the, Ed the diary of the Edwardian lady yes, and yes. all that kind of thing. Yeah, 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 100%. So, so like cool, isn't it? And really rustic. Okay, so let's just again, just wiggle wiggle this around so we're going to turn it over and like I say because that glue's drying pretty fast we should be fine to just cut off this overhang and our scissors should be you know not too sticky and also they shouldn't move so just well, lots of you are going for the pocket pads um, more than one actually I know not Carol surprised. in South Yorkshire's gone for two so you're going to get ten pocket pad yeah I would get yourself two sets Eric's gone for two as well for under 30 pounds, you're going to get 10 pads, and that'll be 640 sheets, potentially 640 well, cards. As well, and, you, and that sounds like obviously, and it is a lot, it's a great deal, isn't it? But they take up so little room, yeah. Yeah. so you can find a little space. That's what they're called pocket pads. Pocket you pads. Literally put Honestly, them in your pocket. They fit in, and my handbag is the tiniest handbag in the world, and they fit in fine. Um, I've travelled so lightly. I know Nat said, Is that all you're taking? Just that, that bag? And I said, <laughs> Yep. Um, yeah, okay, they turn up with a lorry so, and a big, uh, a big yeah, truck. Yeah, I know. But you just ne you do never know what you might need as a crafter. Do you know what? Last time I went on holiday, I went without a suitcase. What? It was so liberating. I just oh. had a carry-on luggage. Yeah. It was great. Straight that out is, the airport. Love that is it. a good feeling. Yeah. So now that we've cut it all nice and neat, that is our finished. Is I love that. It's so vibrant, isn't it? So we're going to mat that on to a little mirror mat now. So we've cut that down to six and three quarters and then we're going to just mat and layer that on so let's grab some double-sided tape now okay i'll so show you the mirror mats in a minute for yes, the little pocket absolutely. pads absolutely i have actually got one for my sentiment um so i'll bring that in as well but yeah we're gonna we're gonna show them properly okay so straight onto our piece of gold mirror and then And then that just brings in that really nice bit of shine. And then we're going to bring in some of our parchment. And I'm just going to, I'm just going to rip this. I'm not even looking. You rebel. I know. There we go. There we go. Okay. So let's see how, because I don't want to cover up that beautiful design when my sentiment goes on. Right. So what we're going to do is we're just going to fold that round parchment. It makes it look so expensive, doesn't it? Oh, yeah. Um, so we're going to layer that there. Let's stick that down so it doesn't move. Um, I'll tell you what, our pick and mix is absolutely flying. Remember, I don't think amazing. we've done it before where we've actually mixed the Say It With Style with the actual pocket pads, but we've done it this time. So you can choose one pocket pad, two Say It With Styles, two pocket pads, one Say It With Style. If you just want three pocket pads, yeah, that's fine. definitely. Three Say It With Styles, fine. So I've got my mirror mat here. And these are actually perfect to put your dies on. So this die is the one that we had on in the earlier show. It's the Sending Smiles mm -hmm. die. And they fit so perfectly. I don't want to waste a big sheet nope. of Miri. These Miri mats, obviously they're designed to mat and layer your pocket pad images on, but they're also perfect. For, I mean, that just fits on perfectly. So I'm going to pop that through the die cutting machine. You've made a really good point there, actually. Miri mats are great for sentiment dies. Yeah, absolutely. Because how many times do we cut into an A4 yeah, and just waste to do a tiny it to do a tiny thing? Yeah. I mean, these, these are the Miri mats that are designed to go with the pocket pad. Yes. Look, so you get a perfect, perfect border. You're going to get all three colours. You're going to get rainbow, silver, and gold. How many do you get of each? 96 of each. 288 in total. So that's a lot of mirror mats. There's the gold one, look. And this is one of the sheets out of the Mystic Moments. But you just get a perfect shiny edge, top, bottom, left and right. Yeah, that's it, absolutely. I'll and they're such the a cheap, well. you know, they're, they're so cheap to use for your die cutting as well, if you do decide to use them this way. That's the rainbow mirror. There you go. 
and the other one's silver. So $14.97, you get all three varieties. There's a lot of merry for your money. We sold out of them last week. We were able to get more stock in, oh, okay? Oh, that's so good. I'm sure the guys on the guillotines and the cutting machines have been so busy getting these back in stock. Oh, yeah. They do all the hard work for us. They do, nice. they do. Nice They're awesome. One. But, the, you know, to give you an idea, that's the wadge that you're getting. Three of them. That's a big wadge. It's the I don't know if the rainbow's in stock on its own at the moment. It's only available, I think, in the set of three. But oh, for wow. $14.97, 4 dollars each block, grab them while they're back in stock. Absolutely. So I'm just going in with my construction glue for this sentiment, um, just to give me that really nice kind of hold on my parchment so that it just gives you that, doesn't it look great on there? Mm -hmm. Again, because these dies are our centerpiece state, uh, stop it, you'll massage my ego. Not Honestly, anybody can do this, anybody can make this card. Um, I'm just going to pop that on there and then hide my glue on That's there. That's a good way of hiding the glue. Just Isn't follow it perfect? The, just, the letter. I know, I've worked out, you know, okay. So let's pop this on now with some double-sided tape. Okay. What was the most popular say it was style, Laura? Laura's our producer today. Age, Age to, to perfection. perfection. Let me see if I can find that. I'll give you oh, a little look at that good. in a minute. I mean, there's so many to show, but... Um, oh, there we are. Age to perfection. I'll show you that after the demo, so... Okay, okay. I think I'm being insulted. I, I think didn't hear. So. It's just selective hearing. <laughs> okay, so let's get some um, gemstones. And here we go. I've got my gold ones right at the bottom of my box. And then again, we're just going to. That's so fresh. It is, so isn't lovely, it? Yeah. yeah. So I don't want to put, again, I don't want to over embellish it. But you can always send a smile, can't you? Mm -hmm. Any occasion. And then, like I say, we've not even used them in the traditional way of matting and layering no. them. I wouldn't, I, wouldn't have thought, I wouldn't have thought of using those, um, those sheets from the pads in that way, but that is a great way of doing it. So it's like the French technique of decoupage. Yes. Uh, now, remember, if you want any of the pick and mixes, you can choose any three for $9.99. Obviously, if you choose six, that'll be $19.98. And you can mix and match now with the little pocket pads and also the Say It With Style pads as well. Any three for $9.99. This is the one that's really quite low in stock now, aged to perfection. You're not getting old. You're becoming a classic. <laughs> I'm just waiting for all the abuse. Uh, young at heart, slightly older in other places. <laughs> yes. Um, it's not so bad getting older. It just means you get to make the rules. Oh, well, that's, that's true. That is true. Um, old enough to know better, young enough to do it anyway. They're all quite a laugh, aren't yeah. they? Yeah. Age is simply the number of years the world has been enjoying you. Oh, I love that one. It's really nice. Uh, you don't look a day over fabulous or a minute over amazing. There we go. Um, before I turn another year older, I need to see some terms and conditions. <laughs> Brilliant. Yeah. So that one is very, very low in stock, age to perfection. You've got loads to choose from here. Choose any three. Loads of you are buying multiples of three. Carol's got six. Well done, Carol, in Preston. Sheila in Lanarkshire's got nine. Um, Florence and Lincoln has got three. Pamela and Essex has gone for three. Yeah, you choose the numbers that you want. I mean, obviously, if you buy two, you're not going to get the deal. If you buy three, you get all three for $9.99 and mix it between the pocket pads and the Say It With Style. Fill your boots, enjoy. Um, and don't forget, if you want those Miri mats, that's a pack of the rainbow. You're also going to get a pack of, just so you get an idea of quantity, that's the pack of the gold and that's the pack of the silver. 288 Miri mats cut to perfection. Yeah. So they just give you a, a little bit of a, a frame around the actual pocket pad sheet. Now I've got some finished cards here, which I've got to show you. These are from, this is from the Mystic Moments one. Yeah, it is. is. Look at that. And of course, they, they decoupage beautifully. You've got multiple uh, sheets of the same image, so you can cut them out and fussy cut them if you want to. Oh. There's, there's the clock rule, strutting his stuff. Uh, again, this is from the Mystic Moments with the lotions and potions bottle into oh, the easel so card. Oh, that's so cool. That's cool, isn't it? Yeah. The Clownfish. Oh, I love that. These are just so much fun, aren't yeah. they? 
you know, you can mix and match them with all your favourite pattern papers, or you could do this technique like what we showed, you know, and then look at that. Isn't that great with the acetate? And by the way, these so frames good. that are the perfect size to go with these pocket they paper are. sheets, they're in the show as well, because oh, they are perfect. That's another one of our Moonstone die frames. There's the bean. Now, that's something you wouldn't expect to see on a I gift know. card or a greetings card, a snail. Maybe someone's a little bit slow. It's, it's snail mail if you're sending it out in the post. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, 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 yeah. But yeah, if someone's always up late or a little <laughs> bit dragging their feet a little bit, that could be a tongue-in-cheek card. I love this. To rock and roll. Oh, yeah. 50s Very and 60s. Cool. Very cool. Someone sits there strumming a guitar or something like that. There's something for everybody. I mean, if you make cards for people on demand, you know, yeah. you, you take commissions, which I know a lot of you do do, then these pads are going to be a godsend because you've got everybody catered for, every type of sense of humour catered for in the Say It With Styles as well. You can colour those in or leave them black and white. It's entirely up to you. But each pocket pad Say It With Style is a different theme. So you've got Just For Laughs, Age to Perfection. Want to look at one of the Christmas ones? Okay. Inspirational Wisdom. Um, fabulous Friends. Where's the Winter? Winter Warmers? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Winter Warmers. This one's cute. Now, this could be coloured in by the kids. Yeah. This could be a dad card or a mum card or a gran and granddad card. <laughs> Love that. Naughty. Nice. I tried most days. That's everyone, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, nothing says Mary more than mum. Whipping out the bin bags for the torn up wrapping paper on Christmas Day. And always. <laughs> yeah. Season's greetings. Oh, I'll see what they did there. Very good. Am I the only gift you need? Oh, I am the only gift you need, not am I. Uh, my favorite part of opening presents is the look of surprise on Dad's face when he finds out what Mum and Dad have got me. Always, always. To the season to feast like a king. Fabulous. Easy to color these in. Um, pencils, pens, watercolor. Dear Santa, it was all my husband's fault. <laughs> Love that. Good news, you're still on my Christmas card list. There you go. So a blank canvas, basically. That's one of the Christmas ones. Uh, I think there are, are there more Christmas ones. Yeah, we've got uh, five different ones. Let's have a look. Oh, they're over here. Uh, yeah. Family Christmas, cute Christmas, Christmas spirit, in the snow. Oh, yeah, there are loads. Occasions. So all these Christmas ones. I'll do another Chris Christmas one for you quickly. This one is uh, family Christmas. Yes, this is one's got all your relatives in here. From our family to yours, Merry Christmas. So these aren't kind of whimsical, these are more kind of serious. Sending you smiles across the miles for a wonderful Christmas. Uh, thanks for all the years you've made Christmas magical, Mum and Dad. Oh, wow, how sweet is that? Yeah, so good. You, Jim, you Jingle Bell Rock, brother. Love that. <laughs> Can't imagine a better gift than you for a mum. Oh. oh, it's so cute. The magic of Christmas never ends. Its greatest gifts are family and friends. Love it. Okay, now the dies, I've got those. Yes. Um, now, the Diamond Delights and the Di Delightful Dotty Frame. So, basically, uh, they're these. So that's those ones up there, Dave. Um, top left. Oh, those? Yeah. Sorry. I can only see the backs. <laughs> okay, so both of those, as you can see... Oh, well, these are the same, aren't they? Are they not? No, no, no they are different. Uh, the, the board is just there, there. under those ah, cards. Yeah, it. there we go. Okay, <laughs> so have a little look. These are the frames, and as you can see, if I just get the, my single sheet from the pad uh. it is the perfect fit perfect fit see yeah how sweet so if you want these dies we're doing them as a double um, you're also going to get the extension dies as well so obviously with this one here uh, these are going to allow you to extend the length and the width as yeah. well if you want to of that particular frame. You also get some lovely verses, wishing you all the happiness you can imagine. Uh, you brighten my day and love and laughter. But yeah, the aperture in the middle is the perfect size for your pocket pad sheets. There we go. £24.98. pence. I love that Aztec design. It's nice. That diamond. It? I, I do again, like that. You know, you can colour that, you can ink it if you want to. Mm. It depends what you cut it out. I like out. that one too. Yeah, they're both really good, aren't they? So both together, twenty four ninety eight, perfect for your pocket pictures. And actually, to be honest with you, if you've got that in a picture frame, you could actually change the picture. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, yeah, one each day. yeah, yeah. You can put photographs behind that. It's totally up to you. Okay. Yeah. And that one that I showed you, this one here, that one there, they should be fourteen ninety nine each. You get a fiver off. That one there that we all loved, Claire Alcox made this. Yeah, it's beautiful. But that it? frame is also in the show. Yeah. So this is the one that we launched with the original Say It With Style pads here. 
So this one is your fantastic floral frame yeah. and your delightfully dotty frame. Yeah, and look how much extras you get with those. You get all those florals, you get that bow with the delight for the banner. You know, you get loads of extra bits and pieces with that one. And the acetate and the gold mirror, how cool is that? So nice. Have we sold out of this, have we? Oh, we've got them individually. We've only got them individually. As a duo, they sold out the other day. But if you want them on their own, I mean, that one's more kind of angular and more kind of masculine and dramatic. Uh, that one's a little bit more fancy. Fantastic floral, then. If you want that one on its own, with all the additional extra embellishment dies as well, uh, that one is $14.99 on its own, ZPHD56, OK? And it works both ways, portrait and landscape, yeah, obviously. Yeah, of course. But I, love, I do love that on the acetate. So elegant, isn't it? Really lovely, yeah. OK, so that's that one. And then if you want this one, which is your delightfully dotty frames, again, you can put a colour behind it, like red and white, black and white, white, uh, you know, whatever colour you want. Any really. colour, yeah, that's it, the dyes. You can personalise them for your own projects. Absolutely. And again, they're exactly the right size. So when you put your sheet in the middle of it, there you go, perfect fit. Absolutely perfect. There you go. 14 99 for that one. And that's uh, OZHD16, if you want that particular frame as well. Sorry that the, um, the duo did sell out. Now, we've got the two Christmas ones as well. Now, these are available individually too. It might be that you want to put your own pictures inside them or you want yeah. to put uh, your... These are for the... Are they for these? Yeah, 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 absolutely, okay. yeah. So you've got the festive foliage or the fabulous Christmas. This one is the festive foliage. So I've just put the, uh, the picture from the pad in there to show you it's a perfect fit. So it could be a picture of your kids, it could be a picture of your pets, or it could be any of the images from the yeah. pocket pads. That's really nice, isn't it? And yeah. it's got all the detail, all the foliage, the poinsettia, your berries as well. Um, and again, it could be uh, cards, or indeed you could put them in picture frames if you wanted to. So that's available on its own. There's the board for it. So you've got a lovely poinsettia corner. You've got a gorgeous bow, the star. We're quite limited on the Christmas one, so we don't have as many of these as we would like. And then the other one is a fabulous Christmas lights frame, yeah. which, to be honest, doesn't have to be Christmas. That could be just any party or any celebration. Yeah, Obviously, cool. you've, got your, you've got your candy cane, your gingerbread man, and your present and your stocking there. But the lamps, I mean, they could be come to our barbecue. Yeah, of course. Couldn't Why not? Yeah. Absolutely. And again, the sheets fit perfectly inside. So cute. I'm just saying, you know, it could be a, 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 a garden party round. all year yeah. round. It's not just Christmas. Absolutely. Oh. There you go. Fourteen ninety nine. That's your price if you would like that one as well. And that's uh, FTHD ninety one. FTHD ninety one. Right then. Back to you, Becca. Okay, we're going to get another demo in. Cool. Okay. Right. Let's see. Right. So let's see what we've got here. I think we're going in with our Mystic Moments one here. It's okay. everyone's favourite. If you love anything like this, you're going to be in absolute heaven. Dragons, wolves. Dragons, but like, it's just so good, isn't it? There's a real, it's mythical, but a real mix across all our artwork. And the artwork's amazing. Yeah, the artwork is amazing, absolutely. So we're going to make this into a, like a little stepper card, I think. We've got some black mirror. -y. We've got, I'll bring this in as well. This is the perfect partner if you're getting this for your background. Uh, Duo Design Paper Pad, Magical Landscape, Stunning <coughs> Swirls, because how mystical oh, and mythical wow. is that? They're going to look so great as backgrounds. And then you also get this fabulous kind of magical you swirly pattern. You don't normally have scenes in your duo design pads, do you? Not, mm, not always, no. Um, I'm trying to think. There's not that many that I can think of that has this kind of style. But again, you've got your really nice plain, <coughs> plain pattern on there. Okay. So we are going in with our black mirror. And then we're actually going to pair that with some lilac adorable scoreable, which you think... You think I'd be going a bit grungy with a mystical card, but we're not. We're gonna we're gonna like just brighten it up a little bit. And then the images that we've got, I've got this wonderful sort of like potion scene there with the skull. Trouble and then, bubble, toil and trouble. Oh yeah, yeah. absolutely. <coughs> and then the other ones I've got, I've started fussy cutting already, but I'll show you which pages they are. There's the one with the candles. Um we love him, the little toad. Um <laughs> There we go, we've got the potion bottle there, and that's yep. just been fussy cut out. And then, where are the candles? I might have used them all, to be fair. I just love them so much. 
Um, yeah, and then there, there is a page with these candles on, but like I say, I have used them all because, like I say, I absolutely love them. So we're going to make this into a stepper card. So we're going to do all our mats and layers first, get that out of the way, and then move on to the fun part of embellishing. And you do get six of each design, don't you? You do, yeah, 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 yeah absolutely. If you do three layers, you can get two cards out of the six sheets. So. Oh, for sure, absolutely. You can be really, really fancy or really frugal. It's totally up to you. Um, so again, like I say, I think this lilac just softens everything down and even in this kind of quite spooky scene, it does match all these colours so, so well. Mm -hmm. um, and then next up we're going in, we've gone in quarter of an inch smaller with our duo design paper pad. I know I'm covering up that beautiful scene, but we don't want to distract from the pocket pad image. That's what they're there for. They're double sided for a reason. Um, you can always treat yourself to two if there's a side you can't bear using. Mm -hmm. um, to be fair, in the pick and mix, remember you can also order the same pad twice. If you want yeah, you you know, three of the same, it's entirely up to you. You don't have to have three, three different Yeah, of course. So if there's, you know, if you love the mystical, you're probably not maybe going to be as into the flowers, for example. Mm. They might not just be your cup of tea as much. Um, so yeah, you can absolutely double or triple up on your favourites. Um, it, the, the best part is choosing which ones to have, I think. Yeah, absolutely. I definitely have the Perfect Pets. That's yeah. a definite. Perfect Pets is an absolute definite, isn't Music it? Music to my ears, definitely. Um, Just all of one? them. Yeah, <laughs> Just that's it. That's the thing. <laughs> uh, and at least sort of prices, maybe you can afford to go for all of them. Yeah, why not? Yeah. Okay, so we're going to make our little, we're going to make a stepper piece for this card, actually. So I'm going to bring the scoreboard in now. Okay. Oh, our very fine hobby maker oh, scoreboard. Very fine hobby maker scoreboard. It's beautiful. Have we still got stock of this, the teal? I think it is available. So it's the only place you can buy it, by the way, here. Hobby we've maker. got a three and a half by five, and we're going to score that at three and then one and a half. Oh, we've got it. It's in stock. I thought we would. Check have. the website, hobbymaker.co.uk, if you want the tool. Perfect. And it just means that you can make really little, easy stepper panels like so. Okay, so again, we're going to mat and layer that and get it all looking pretty. Probably going to cover quite a lot of this up, but it's still worth doing. So again, Black Miri, adorable, scoreable. Oopsie. Oh my goodness, I've just dropped it on the floor. There we go. <laughs> um, perfect. And then again, just a little, a little strip of that. Again, we are going to cover a lot of it up, but... You might be able to see it and I'll feel so much better if we've got everything done. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So again, just going to stick that onto our step and that's going to just sit on the front of our card. And then that allows us to put all of this detail on without kind of distracting from the front of our card. So that's going to be the front there. We're going to put the perfect that on. background paper for Isn't, that, isn't it, it just? Yeah. It really, really is. So we're going to get these sort of candles on just like so. We're going to kind of layer this up. And I know these are going to be a little bit, a bit long. So let's get some construction glue on here mm -hmm. and then we can put our... Um, potion bottle on with some um, foam pads. By the way, the um, the actual frame dies that match the pocket pages are flying. We've got the duos, but we've also got the individual ones. The fantastic floral one is going very, very fast, actually. Uh, fantastic floral. That's one of the acetate, wasn't it? Which was yeah, this I one did, here. I that did one. have it for this, actually, but I couldn't find it. So I've just used it on a mat and layer for this one. But That one. Absolutely flying at the moment, if you want it. Yeah, I'm not surprised. It's so good. I think it's probably that seeing that card. Yeah, absolutely. That card's so beautiful, isn't it? Isn't it great? Perfect uh, size for the pocket Claire pad. Claire made that card. Claire Rollcock. Claire on the design team. Yeah, they're all absolutely ace. Um, okay, so let's put that at the bottom. Oh my goodness, I'm loving how this is looking already. It's looking great. And again, let's get this on some foam pads. We don't want to raise it too much, um, but we do want a little bit of height and a little bit of depth for this one. I feel like this is perfect for like an October or November birthday as well. It's mm -hmm. sort of, I know it's not Halloween-y or anything, like spooky season-esque, isn't it, this one? Well, it's, it's you know, for fans of well-known Wizards and that sort of thing, isn't it? It's perfect for them. Mm. Too. Absolutely. But yeah, just anything 
Like I say, spooky is, is now, a, it's an official season, isn't it? Yep. Yeah, of course, steampunk lovers as well. I think you could definitely get away with it. Right, we're just gonna put some red tape on my step. So I'm gonna bring in our ultra high tack tape and we're just gonna put a really nice thin strip on there. It's got the most amazing grab, so that'll be plenty on there. Okay. And that'll be on the website as well. Lots of our great suppliers here at Hobby Maker do the red liner tape, so check that out. Yeah, of course. We love, love, love it. It's so great for jobs like this. So that step is now on the top there, so that's just perfect. Okay, and then we just need to go in with this. that just on there perfect <coughs> yeah it's looking good isn't it we've got a little bit more decoupage to go on here see when you've got those sheets and just fussy cut the elements out the sky's the limit oh you absolutely do with it. so i've just done one layer and it is just those rounded you know i've not gone it was super fussy with it i've just cut out the the sort of skull with that crystal ball and the, those stack of books there so I'm gonna just shape that a little bit, lay that on top, and then we just need to finish off with a sentiment. And I think we're gonna go with, you are amazing. Now those sentiments we had in the earlier show, didn't we? We did, In the yeah. two o'clock. So they'll be on the website for you as well, if you want. Yeah, them. absolutely. We've got absolutely loads. We've got cheers to you, love and best wishes, good luck, new baby, thank you from the heart and have a great day. And we're gonna go with this, you are Amazing. So mm -hmm. I'm just going to see if I've got some cardstock to cut that from. So um, remember to make a call or make an order. All you got to do is give us a call on the free phone number 0800 001 4433 or go to the website hobbymaker.co.uk or tap the app. It's free. It's new. Okay. So download it from yeah. your app provider. Just going to cut that out from oh. Again, maybe. Maybe our rainbow mirror mats would look good. Have we okay. got one? Yeah, yeah. Can I, I go finish on. Yeah. this one? There you go. I think that's going to look awesome. Oh, um, yes. 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 It Let's do it. Good. Let's yeah. do it. Okay. Um, I've no coloured cardstock left. It, it was an absolute unanimous vote. Okay. Absolutely. And look how many of those verses or sentiments you could get out of one of the Out of one of those. You could get three, four, if not five. Yeah, I think so. For sure. Um, so let's just run that through now. I mean, to be fair, they're, they're one of the best sizes to buy because not only do they match and frame the, po the pocket pads perfectly, they're so handy. How many times have you wasted bigger sheets of yeah. cardstock doing something relatively quite small and just use these instead? They're Absolutely. so affordable. Absolutely. Now you are going to get all three colorways. You're going to get the rainbow mirror. That's the silver, that's the gold. And the rainbow mirror as well is this one here. You get, you get this three times, 288 sheets of pre-cut, precision cut, Miri with the rainbow, gold, and the silver. This is what you get. It's a, it's a wudge. It's an absolute whopper, isn't it? It's a huge amount. And you don't have to trim them down. No getting them wonky. They're all done for you. Perfect. Yeah, exactly. Um, okay, okay, so grab that little bit so just cut the writing out not the shadow and again we'll go in with our trusty trusty glue stick for this so just a little a little dab on there mm -hmm. and then again we can just put those let's put it on here you oh. So many of you are going through the pick and mix process at the moment, which is... Picking which is your favourite. Are you on the web? Are you on the app? Are you on the phone? Bit of everything, I think, really. Everything. I know Kay's on the app. Terence is on the app. Uh, Karen's on the website. Janet's on the app. Joanne, Linda on the website. Telephone for Marjorie in Thailand Weir. So, yeah, all three ways are just as good as each other. Yeah, of course, definitely. And then... To go with our rainbow mirror, we have these Aurora Borealis gemstones. Again, just adds to that kind of mythical, mythical feel. And then I think we're gonna have to make some room to show this card off. Enough to what? 
make some room so that I can show this card off. Yeah. Here we go. We have, we've kind well, of taken over a bit. We do, we? don't we? Yeah, yeah absolutely. Here don't we forget, go. we're going to give away the card. So you've got about five minutes to get your email in and then we'll announce the winner about five to five or thereabouts. Okay. If you want that card from the earlier show. Um, Here we go. There we go. This one though. Let's move this out. There we go. That was amazing. I love it. It's so great. That image is just perfect. Everything just works so harmoniously, doesn't it? Love it. Absolutely love it. And the rainbow sentiment, yeah, good call on that one. Yeah, I think so. Even though it's really quite fine, it's the, the rainbow is very obvious. Mm, 60 absolutely. of you at yeah. this moment going through the ordering process, are you going to go for a couple of the pocket pads and one of the Say It With Styles? Are you going to go with one of those, two of those? For the first time, I think, have we done it before? I don't think we have. Oh, we did it last week. Okay, but before that, it's always been Say It With Style on its own yes. as a... Um, pick and mix but now we've done and we've been able to work the system so that we can actually give you the choice of choosing the pocket pads or the say it with styles there are so oh many of you with it in your baskets right now you can choose any three mix between the say it with style and the pocket pads you only pay 9.99 so if you want six that's fine you'll pay 19.98 if you want 12 that's fine it's up to you but there are literally let me have another look at which ones haven't i done for the men i've not done for the men yet I've not done for the ladies either. Let's do the men and ladies. Yeah, these are fab. Yeah, so if you struggle with cards for guys, here are some of them. Um, to an uncle who is truly one of a kind. Uncle cards. Where do yeah. you get the chance to make those? Little dude with attitude. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like that. Come high tide or low tide, I'll always be by your side. Love Dad, that. the man, the myth, the legend. Birthday king. Fabulous. A cold one for the old one. Yes. <laughs> There's no substitute for you. Granddad of the year again. Um, who needs superheroes when you have a brother? Oh. Oh, that's really sweet. Happy birthday, handsome. <laughs> Great, isn't it? Oh, hang on, what's that one say? To the world, you are a father, but to our family, you are the world. Oh, what's that? Oh. So that's the men's. And then the other one for the ladies is this one here. Well, this one's got uh, Nan. Oh, Nan cards, great. Nan is your name, spoiling, uh, uh, spoiling is your game. You bake the world a better place. Aww. Sisters are different flowers from the same garden. <laughs> Make today your special day. I'm just going at random here. Uh, birthday queen, always my sister, forever my friend. Oh, there is no love greater than a mother's love for her daughter. You leave a little sparkle wherever you go. There you go. So that's the one for the ladies. I think I've gone through most of them, but you've got a choice. There's actually two, four, five, uh, six, uh, seven, nine, ten. There's about, including the, um, the pocket pads, you've got about 15 to choose between. Choose any three. Maybe you don't want to say it with stars, you just want the pocket pads, yeah, that's fine. Of if you go for the set of five pocket pads, 14.95. Has the, the set of five been popular, Laura? For fourteen ninety five, yeah. So if you just want all of the pocket pads, that's an option. Um, fourteen ninety, was it fourteen ninety five for all? For, was it fourteen ninety five for all five? Yeah, fourteen ninety five for all five pocket pads. Yeah. There's sixty four sheets in each pad. Absolutely, and these are brand brand new. We've never done these before. They are full colour satin finish. You know, A seven size. Uh, they, they they are like our little books, but pocket size. A lot um, of you are getting confused. I did as well. Um, that you get five books. It's collection four. It's the fourth collection in the series. Yes. Yeah, okay. So it's not four books. It's five. That's yeah, what I yeah. thought when I saw yeah. it as well. Now you get all five of them. Let's just run through which ones you get again, if we can. You get the perfect, uh, perfect pets, music to my ears. You get beautiful botanicals, garden visitors, and you're also going to get the mystic moments. So those, if you just want all five of them, you haven't got to choose, just go for that item number on the screen. That's AGHD14, you'll automatically get all five. With 64 sheets in each one, and you get uh, six of each design. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, you do, yeah. Yeah, six of each design. So if you like three layers of decoupage, that's two cards out of the six sheets. It's entirely up to you. But, and again, if you want my advice for what it's worth, Go for the Miri mats because to have the perfect mat yeah. and the perfect frame, I mean, this one here, because it's brown tones, would probably look suit the, the gold. Looks. But look at that. It gives rigidity to the, to the topper as yeah. well, doesn't it? Absolutely, yeah. It just makes it look more luxurious. Yeah, of course. Stunning. So, 
because I know what I'd be like. If I tried to cut these out, I'd measure, I'd go wonky, I'd get a, I'd get a, a, a scissor mark or a... Yeah. Wouldn't False. be perfectly no. even on one side. These have all been guillotined to perfection yeah, for you. Yeah, absolutely. Also, A7, it's not a regular, regular size. You know, it's no. not round. So it's perfect to have these. And if you go for the mirror, you're going to get all three. Yeah. Uh, there's the silver. Probably wouldn't look as good. Well, maybe. Yeah. I think probably gold suits it better. Yeah. Look at the colours that are in the topper and then decide which... Uh, which frame would look best. Yeah, use definitely. use some um, glue, repositionable glue, and you can then just kind of get it, or a glue that doesn't stick straight away. Don't use your red liner tape. Get a, a wet glue that allows you to kind of position it a little bit. And then the other one, remember, is the rainbow, which I've lost now. Rainbow. Oh, well, I pinched it. Oh, you did, didn't you? Yeah, but I think we've got it. I've got, got another one there. here. <laughs> got another one here. Here we go. So there's the rainbow mirror. Okay, a bit jazzy maybe for a violin, but just to give you an idea. Why not? Look at that. Everyone loves okay. rainbow mirror as well. Perfect frame. Can we get in one more demo I in the next think five so. or six minutes? Yeah. Great. Yeah, should we try and get it done now? Okay. Yeah, yeah, let's do it. Right, let's do it. Okay, so we've got some adorable scoreable here. Let's just try and quickly pop this together. Um, right. So we've got, let's make ourselves a little stepper. So I'm going to just have a quick look and see if I can find my scoreboard. Here we go. So I need it on You can find the, it. It's not, it's big you enough. You know what it? I mean. <laughs> okay. You can't lose it, really. so, No, you can't, you can't <laughs> lose it. The very inconspicuous colour. Absolutely yeah. right. So let me see if I can remember these measurements. I uh, want two and a half, uh, five, and then the other one, I will just double check because I've written it down. Two and a half, five, and then 16 and a half here. Okay, and then same on the other side. And then, sorry, I'm just going to just do it like this. Okay. Just because you don't want to go in the centre. I'm only scoring sort of a couple of inches up there, I'm not scoring like all the way through. Okay. So five and then 16 and a half. So again, if you want to do that, you can just lift your card stock out the way and score up. Okay. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to pop this in the trimmer now at two and a half. Emails closed now for the card giveaway. Thank you for your entries. We'll announce oh, the yeah, winner before do. five o'clock. So. so cut from your first to your last score line. Same again with this one. And then if you've missed anywhere on your scoring, that's fine. And then we can pop our centre scoring as well. So I'm just going to put this back in, check that I've gone through everywhere. Five. Yeah, it's just these little ones. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to put in my centre at 14, but just through the middle. Right. So this will make my sort of stepper here. And then, there we go. Perfect. That's what you get with the adorable scoreboard. Absolutely, and adorable scoreboard, of course. Yeah, Indian of course, technology. absolutely. Yeah, 100%. I just think I'm just gonna have to come in a little bit further with my cut here. There we go. Okay, perfect. So I'll just grab that on there. And then we'll just matte and layer that now with our pattern paper so we've gone for this delightful dots one and then we're just going to pop that on there so let's just pop that on with some construction glue all your tools remember boards yeah. glues all on the website hobbymaker.co.uk just search for the brand shop hunky dory and you'll be away okay perfect and then i'm just going to grab my image i'm just going to see if i've got any spare cardstock so that we can die cut that frame. I think I've got some here. Is that the right one? Yeah. Okay. Oh yeah. Let's uh, let's do a frame let's and put do one, a of the, frame. one of the sheets from the pads in the frame. I think I'm going to use the scalloped one actually. By the way, those frames are going absolutely frantically at I'm the moment. Surprised. They're going very, very quick. Because they're the perfect match. Yeah, they really, really are, aren't they? I mean, so this one in particular, the fancy florals, look. This one's the new one. Isn't that great? The brand brand Made new one. It is the um, doily edge frame. Doily edge frame, that's this one. Yeah, that one. It is available on its own as well, Absolutely. but you get the best value if you buy both. Yeah, of course. Okay. 
And again, let's do our sentiment. Let's go with, you brighten my day. And obviously, you can actually just put that in, in there as well. Um, okay, so pop that on there. And then let's get that through the dye cutting machine. run it through and then I think we'll just need to mat and layer my sides after that. Okie dokie. Do you know when you're back with us next? I, yeah, I Two can't, weeks. yeah, definitely November. Good. Um, it is only two weeks mm -hmm. away, I know. Um, yes, 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 the, the, my next date is in the diary for sure. Okay. So let's pop this on there. We'll move my scoreboard so that we've got a little room. And then that frame has cut out absolutely beautifully for me. I love that. I love that colour card as well. It's great, isn't it? Mm. Um, okay. And then I'm just going to grab this little bit of tape. It's just, just come with it. So we're just going to move that. And then once we get these weeds out, the rest of it should just, there we go. Okay. Now you can just obviously just pop that onto there. So again, we're going to use construction. If I had a bit more time, I'd be using tape. Mm -hmm. um, but just in the interest of speed, we're going to use glue. So we're going to pop our gorgeous horse image on there. Um, Okay, so I'm going to pop that there. Yes, okay, so we just need now to get our last little layers on. Um, so we're just going to use our duo design paper again that we've got here. So if I cut that to sort of two centimetres, that should make a nice matte layer for my edges. And then Perfect. I think I want it around the 11, hoping that's right. Yeah, that's fine. So again, we'll just glue that on. Have we got the name of the winner? Oh. Yes. Okay. Oh. Oh dear. If you, uh, emailed, in if you emailed in, should we give the name now? Let's do it now, okay. Let's this do is it now. Lady B's lucky dip winner for today is Kathleen Bonehill. Oh, Kathleen, congratulations, my love. That will be in the post in the next few days. Yes. Your precious memories of Big Ben. I will back. We'll leave it for you to write and I'll sign the back for you. Fabulous. Okay, so we're going to pop our horse on there. And then we've just got our sentiment. Okay. 70 of you now. Wow. Uh, say it with style in your baskets. And also, of course, loads of you putting in the uh, pocket pads as well. This could be, with everyone checking out their baskets, it could be the most we've ever, ever seen oh, the wow. star and the pocket pads. It's very, very busy indeed. It's nice that you've got the choice. You choose what you want. We're yeah, not, we're build not your own to bundles. You. Build your own bundles. Yeah. yeah. So, speed crafting at its finest. Probably wouldn't have chosen a stepper card in, in hindsight to, <laughs> to do last thing. Okay, I'm just going to grab that tiny bit of tape. Oh, we've got loads of time. Loads of time. Yeah. Loads of time. <laughs> Loads of time. So chill. No, it's fine. I'm like um, like a swan, you know, calm on the yeah, surface. Doing that underneath. Yeah, that's me. <laughs> well, lovely Haley is in the wings, waiting to take you through she this is. evening. I've got a few days off. We'll be back on Friday. Thank you for your company over the weekend. It's been lovely. Okay, so we're just going to put that in the corner just there, just kind of overlapping our image to give it that little bit of extra kind of texture. And again, I'm going to see if I've got two minutes to squeeze some pearls on. Not even that, 10 seconds maybe. Oh so, my goodness. You ain't got two minutes. No, we have not. Okay, but I can't, it's not a me card without some gems on. No, it's, it's the Becca Law. Oh yeah, it's the law. 
There we go. There we go. There we go. Beautiful. Beautiful. Enjoy your pocket pads. Enjoy your frames. Enjoy your say it with style there pads as well. Any three for nine ninety nine, <laughs> or if you want all five pocket pads covering all those genres, they're fourteen ninety five for all five of them. But they're, I, I mean, if you're looking they're to incredible. make decent money for charity and stuff like that, this has got to be the way to do it because yeah. they're costing you pennies per card to make, uh, and you can charge, you know, pounds. Simple as that. Uh, I had a lovely afternoon. Thank you, Becca. Yeah, it's been fabulous. Safe journey home. Yes, You're going north, you. I'm going south. Perfect. All right, and I'll okay. see you soon. See you soon. Haley's on the way then right after this, and I'll see you on Friday. Are you having trouble finding the perfect gift? Then why not treat them to the new gift card from Hobbymaker at hobbymaker.co.uk. Simply scroll down to the bottom where it says gift cards, click and you'll be taken to the right place. Decide between posting the card or delivery by email and then decide how much you want to add. You choose the value. So what do you get the crafter that's got everything? Why not treat yourself or them to the Hobbymaker gift card? Our call centre is based in the UK and available 24-7. Just call 0800 001 4433 or email help at hobbymaker.co.uk. If you've recently missed your favourite show on Hobbymaker, it's really easy to catch up on our website. Simply visit hobbymaker.co.uk and click TV Guide. Here you'll be able to choose any show broadcast in the last seven days, which you can watch, pause and rewind at your convenience. And to make shopping even easier, any items featured in the show will appear underneath. With Hobby Makers Catch Up, there's never a reason to miss out, no matter what time of day. Hello there. How Hello. are you doing? Welcome, welcome back. How are you doing? Um, I am very pleased to be spending next hour with this lovely lady behind me, behind me, beside me. <laughs> Did you know, Hayley? What? It's our 18th birthday. It is. Look at all this. <laughs> I love it. I love it. And we've got some celebrations that we're going to be sharing with yes. you. Yes. In fact, continuing, because we've had some amazing shows, some amazing deals. Oh, the deals have been absolutely incredible. In fact, I feel like because it's our birthday, we like to treat you. I feel like it's us giving you a gift back for all, everything you do for 
us during the year, which is amazing. Well, so this is it, because without these guys out there, the crafters, there wouldn't be 18 years, would there? Absolutely. So, to always yes. remember that. So, uh, yeah, now the details are up on your screen. As you can see, we're running that birthday event right the way through where you are saving money, not only during the shows, but you've got additional savings to be had just by using those fabulous details that are on your screen. But we've got some amazing deals during this hour and some kind of special reveals as we go. Yes, absolutely. Mm. Mm. So you need to stay tuned, so don't go anywhere and all will be revealed. Is that the second or third time I've said the word reveal? Mm. Are we revealing something? Mm. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, we'd love to hear your stories. How did you get involved with Crafters Companion? What sort of things do you love crafting with? And have you gone for that fabulous deal that we've seen with the Gemini too? Because I know lots of you have been going mm. for it. And this is the perfect hour if you have gone for that yep. to kind of get your kind of die collection going. Absolutely. I mean, that deal is incredible and I, th I believe it's only going to last till Wednesday. Oh, really? It's only like a, yes, the actual, well, it's the 10%. So the deal might be here, but the extra 10% on top for birthday that week. Is a big uh, absolutely. It's mm -hmm. another £50 on top. It was never meant to be the extra 10% on the machine. Oh, okay. Um, yes, but it never got. It never got corrected, so Sarah just thought, well, Somebody forgot to uncheck to. that box. Yeah, absolutely. So, and it is an incredible deal to go for. So, if you haven't seen the Gemini 2 bundle, go, have a look for it because it's absolutely, amazing. Hopefully, definitely. we'll get to it before the end of the hour. And then it's kind of you start collecting your dies, dies for different purposes. And one of the most popular die sets to go for are nesting dies. And you'll hear us talking about these time and time again. Now, with regards to these, I think, are you actually getting four sets within this set? Yeah, I've pinched a set oh, here, Hayley. Oh. I have, yes, I've been pinching one, so I just wanted a, a die out to of there. Keep so your I'll eye let, on, I'll you let you have do. that one. <laughs> so these are always popular. Why do we love our nesting dies? So these aren't just nesting dies, these okay. are multimedia nesting okay. dies. Okay. Yes. yes. Absolutely. So up to eight layers and possibly more of um, wow. fabric, so cotton fabric, uh, cut through three layers of felt, um, and felt is really fibrous, but you can cut through three layers of felt in one pass through your Gemini. Wow. Uh, you can cut through items like mount board. We have some um, jigsaw dies that are on the show as well. Uh, attach your photos to mount board or to your magnet sheets. Ooh, okay. You can make photo magnets then out of them. These dies will cut those, uh, which is incredible. So um, yeah, so much you can do with uh, a set I of nesting it. dies because you can cut through so many different mediums. Absolutely. I've got multiple dies in each one of the sets. So it could be seven, could be nine in there. But you can see they're going from the smallest element right the way through to the largest meaning that you've actually got 34 dies in total now the price on your screen is a brilliant price when you consider the quantity of dies that you're getting and also the uh, the kind of um, varied use you can use with these because we've yep. spoken about all the different things like your fabrics I mean straight away my yeah. ears pricked up I know absolutely. I'm thinking a plea came oh, yeah. at, um bunting maybe yes, with the triangles absolutely yeah. uh, bunting nice is a great yeah. idea with the yeah. uh, triangles yeah uh, circles so many are so tricky to cut out I mean sometimes mm -hmm. when we working with our fabric straight lines we might use with a quilt ruler yep. and they're, they're pretty mm -hmm. easy but start talking about circles they can be incredibly absolutely. tricky absolutely and there's and what i love about them as well there's a I, I mean you'll know this but i know in patchwork you do different there's different um patterns and circles within a circle there's a certain patchwork pattern oh, there's, isn't there there's loads so there's you loads could make that yeah. with those by nesting in one of them and creating hoops with them and you can also do things like reverse applique if you're into your, your sewing because it's kind of the the bit that's left behind so say if you were to use a square and then cut out a circle you're almost creating mm. a frame aren't you with those absolutely it's not just about the so, for, oh look at that Hayley wow <laughs> my goodness <laughs> wow so oh, how much goodness. would we usually be paying per well it's got to be 25, 25 pounds, pounds isn't it? yeah and now, for four pounds extra, if you were buying that one, wow. for four pound extra, you're going to get all of those as well. Yeah, that's amazing. That is incredible. Uh, what I also love about them is if you are, I mean, we're talking about if you sew or if you mm -hmm. um, do a plique or if you make quilts. Uh, but actually, when you think about if you batch make things, you can cut through multiple um, cardstock in one go. So your 300 GSM, you can perhaps three times that, maybe four so times like that. So like your grey board, if you're into... Yes. 
kind of your mixed media Absolutely. and creating your, yep. your own kind of bases, yep. then these are going to be ideal. Absolutely, your funky foam, your cork, your denims, anything like that. Faux leather, real leather, anything to make your key mm, rings. Yes, yeah, idea. anything that you want mixed media wise. Um, sandpaper, I know that's a really weird thing, but a lot of people have started using sandpaper because it's a texturized medium to cut through. And then you can start painting it and put it into your backgrounds of all those sort of mixed medias. Nice uh, so much you can do for them. Uh, and I have got just a few layers of cardstock here, so I okay. thought we'd just cut one out. Oh, now go I've got a, um, a glitter cardstock, so that's a glitter which Gorgeous. is coated. This blue, this is the ice blue, you can uh, get that. It comes with mm. your um, bundle that. for the Gemini. Oh, I knew I'd seen it somewhere. So <laughs> this, this cardstock, if you've gone for the bundle, it will be on its way to you. Don't worry, during the course of the hour, we will tell you about the bundle if you're wondering what we're talking about. And you're going to be able to save an extra £50 just by using that discount that we've got on the screen. Yeah, absolutely. Now, I've put them up the top because uh, why I've got the Gemini, I thought I would show you it. Um, and as you're putting your uh, boards through your Gemini machine, literally offer it into the mouth of the machine. Stand it takes it for you. You haven't got to do anything at all. You can hear that crunch. That's a good noise. Now, if you wanted to, you could pause it and then I can reverse it. Now, I don't think I need to reverse it, Hayley, so I'm going to let that carry on. Sometimes you might want to reverse it if you're working with your fabrics and just want to make sure Absolutely. That it, it gives through. it a double cut and yeah. it's quick as well but I'm pretty sure that will probably have cut through or oh, you can see oh, all those that. layers so I think I could have got hold oh what's I think that's slipped that off oh. but it always oh, put it the wrong way Hayley. Do you know what though down. I like that friend quite nice and that. That. with the dye and actually create an outer Absolutely. frame yeah. yeah I like the fact that you planned that Debbie I can tell love that I meant to do that I meant to obviously. do that so obviously. yeah absolutely although I did want one of those dyes so let's just pop that back on uh, in fact, I'm going to just use, we'll just use those two, take that one there and um, just place Now, them those dies are proving to be very, very popular. Don't forget, you're getting 34 of those. Your hearts, your circles, your triangles, as well done as it again, squares. nearly done it again, Hayley. Good job <laughs> I checked it. That's us <laughs> chatting, isn't it? Um, so, if you want to take advantage of those, you can do. Now, if you're using that code, of course, that's where you're saving that extra 10%. So, it's worth considering that. And is that a code we can use on anything, then, Debbie? As we, yeah, we anything, Crafters Companion, oh, yeah, which is okay. amazing, isn't it? It's just that extra added little bonus that you can have because it's our birthday event. So that'll mean that you're actually saving almost an extra three pounds off the price that's on your screen just for using that code. So uh, there you go. Yeah, late absolutely. to the party, but um, I'm glad I turned up because that's a good saving to be had. Absolutely. Right, so I wanted to cut those out. You can see those three. So in one, I know we did it twice, uh, but you could have done that in one pass yes. through the machine. And it just means you can then start to mat and layer these. So if you are speed craft, in and you want to do some different variations one oh, part nice. one pass through the machine yeah. and you've got that imagine the triangle one creating that bunting yes, adding those yeah. extras on all those different layers that you can do so i absolutely love it i these. love it it's brilliant ideas so many different ways you can use them so if you are a soft crafter and you're delving into the um, kind of realms of paper crafting brilliant or potentially the other way around it might be that you just double a little bit in sewing but yeah. your main craft is your, your card making or your mixed media then this is is something that's definitely worth considering and the fact that you've got so many different sizes I mean the circles go from one inch right the way through um, to five inches mm. similar with the triangles and the same with the squares and the hearts yep. as well so perfect for your card making all your small elements yep. right the way through things like your shrink plastic as well sometimes. oh so Take much the yep. density of that absolutely quite tricky. yeah tin cans I mean that's wow. something we throw away or we can recycle but actually your tin cans are brilliant cut with these because it bevels the edges as well Love so uh, yeah uh, and then you can emboss them you can put them on charms on things so brilliant uh, yeah. idea so there you go. £29.99, pence. you are getting all of those sets. Normally, your 29.99 will get you one set because you're paying 24.99. But for that extra five, you are getting them all included in there. So taking it right the way up to those 34 dies. And it's lovely to see so many of you checking your baskets out with regard to It's another 2.99 off of that. Well, it's just by using that code. Yeah, it? it's amazing. So if you use the code, you're going to save an extra 10% um, off, which means when I said you're paying an extra five, you're not you're actually going to be paying an extra couple of quid really aren't you I know so good you got that? Uh, I've got a free pen honey have you seen our no, new free pen? 
us. I mean, it's rather posh, isn't it? Okay. I mean, and we are giving this oh, away with every um, every time you purchase something. How amazing is that? Oh, I love that. So yeah. one per order. So if you've already got your order on the way to you, then it's going to be included within your bundle. But if you are yet to place your order, nice little surprise. So you uh, like and that. it's exclusive to Hobby Maker. It's your colour. Ah, yes. of course, oh, that yes. gorgeous teal. <laughs> I love it. So there you go. If you fancy getting hold of those, as many of you have been, then please do so. And go for it. Check your baskets out. Do not miss out on those deals. Lots of you taking advantage of those. But we're moving on to something that I've not seen before. And this is, um, yeah, it's going to be an interesting product to look at. It's it's something you use and you kind of scratch to reveal. <laughs> it That's is. That's all I know about it. That's all you know. Yes. So, Hayley, we haven't got the packs uh, in, but I know what the price of these are. So okay. I, want, I want to give you a little shot, but also want to show you what these do. So the actual kits themselves, you're getting a birthday one and you're getting a baby one. Now, the only thing that's themed of those is the stamps. Okay. It means that you're also then getting, and I'm pretty sure you get 57. Wow. I know. How amazing is that? In gold, silver, and um, the rose gold. I love that rose the, gold. Where's the, I've got a silver one here. Let me show you the silver. <laughs> So cool. that's silver, the rose gold, and your... Um, uh, like an antique gold. Yeah, it's amazing, yeah. isn't it? So you're getting all... And they're all different. So if I just uh, show you some of the others. So you've got sort of stars oh, yeah. on there, smaller ones. You've got the speech bubbles, look, on there. Uh, so lots of ones. Now... So these are self-adhesive? So they're self-adhesive. So let me take... In fact, let me let me do something, Hayley. You can't look, though. Okay. You can't look. So, so go with this. you can write your own message. Okay. So I was told before the show look, how yeah, much were these going to be. In a, yeah, you can look, and I'm just going to show you what I'm going to do. So I've peeled off one of these stickers. So okay. literally peeled it off. The back piece of that sticker has like a, a protective layer. So when you place this, I'm just going to okay, move I'm this away up again. here. Yeah, so we're going to pop that over there. So I've cut out that heart, so you can see we've then got that sticker over our heart. Right. Um, and then it means, I haven't bought a coin with me, but you could probably scratch it oh. off with your um, nails. Oh, let's give it a oh, go with me Yeah, now. no, I haven't got anything with me. Okay. They scratch so. off quite easy. So literally, whether it's a photograph, whether you put a, um, uh, you, you put a, a message under there, uh, you might do a baby reveal and put like, it's a boy or it's a girl. Um, or but, it's both. Or it's both. <laughs> Yeah, twins. in your case, you're getting <laughs> twins. Oh, yes. okay. Oh, what's happening here? What we can oh, see okay. is, that is the price, Hayley. Seven ninety nine. That you are paying for both packs of these, which is amazing. I love that. And that you can't brilliant. see that protective. So if you want to put a photo behind there, it's you not might want. Away no, like it what doesn't you've scratch on away. There, yeah? You might want to put like your baby scan picture and send it to people. Oh, I'm thinking of little forfeits. What about Christmas crackers? Oh, hey, oh, I love that. Whoever, everybody's scratching off to see yes. who's going to do the washing up. <laughs> I love that. That is a brilliant idea. Or little forfeits. I love that so idea. So that is brilliant. So yes, make your own Christmas crackers, put those bits in there. Um, yeah, I love that. I that might even brilliant. do that with these. And you're getting 57. So regardless of the stamp sets that you're getting in these, I'm sure we might be able to show you on the... I um, think we have got a Yeah, picture, but yes. regardless of those, having all these, you're getting two packs of those 57, which is incredible. So 114 stickers in total. Wow. That you can put on anything. So grab those because that price is amazing. You buy, love buy one, get one free. That is one of those products that's got a full of fun factor, isn't it, that one? Because you're going to have loads of fun with that. Obviously, the bonus is you're going to get those additional stamps in there. So the different themes that you've got with this one is your birthday treats, which we all love to create for, don't we? And then on those occasions when you have got a little baby arriving or maybe you're making your baby makes, then, of course, you have got those fabulous baby uh, ideas there as well. You might want to propose. Someone might want to propose. could be it, couldn't it? Mm. Yeah. Yeah, there yep. could be all sorts of messages going on. And lots of just gift ideas, because we put lots of um, gift cards into, into cards. You could put something and say, this is your gift, and it could be a meal out, it could be oh, a holiday. Nice. Or, yeah, that's oh. it. So you could write anything on there, and I love that you've got all these stickers. Honestly, you'll be using them loads. And if you don't use them, the kids definitely will. Can you imagine the fun that they would be having with them, Absolutely. using them and everything? So, yeah, grab them. What a, what a bargain. Absolute bargain. You don't forget you're getting both packs 
with regards to those. So um, you then get the two packs. So you're going to get two lots of the 57 stickers that we spoke of. Um, you're also going to get two lots of stamps as well. One birthday related, one baby related. And if it's the first order that you've placed during the birthday celebration, you're going to get that bonus pen as well. Yes. It's only while stocks last with those pens. So if you do find that you are getting involved towards the end of the celebrations, you're less likely to get that pen because of all the people that have got in the queue before you. So I, I think, Hayley, that pen's got to be worth more than 7 99 <laughs> So it's like Stylish. buying your pen and more and getting those well, that's for a nothing. good point because you couldn't go out and buy that pen anyway, no, could not you? At all. The only not way you can get it is by placing an order. So if you fancy getting hold of that, then please do. So the details on your screen for those fabulous scratch reveal stickers, which I think are brilliant idea. <laughs> now, talk I about do love your cracker idea. idea. I'm going to do that. Done, isn't it? It's got to be done. And it could be like, do you want to risk it going on to the next oh, sticker? Are you going to get a better yes. get a gift or are you going to lose your gift that you got? Oh, then you could do treasure hunts with them. Loads of fun. Loads of fun. Scratch them off. We've got to talk about other things for the end. Oh, yeah, sorry. We're getting <laughs> carried away with a scratch and reveal. <laughs> so do you fancy getting hold of those? They're already in your baskets. You need to check your baskets out. But we're talking now about quick, quick and easy yes. cards using fabulous dies that kind of got a concept all built in. Yep, absolutely. They're just those ones these there, Hayley. There's a few samples oh, there as well. Over to you. Yeah, these are fabulous. If there was ever a time that you wanted to do a really quick card, and I mean quick, Quick because these are super quick but they're also very um, creative as well so if I show you the designs that you're getting so I turn them round you can see you're getting all of these toppers on here which are loads I mean this is a you're not going to even use these all on one card but you will get all your toppers and then you get your base card to make them okay. now what I love about them is you don't have to just use this as your Constantina card you could cut out these panels and make a little box and just use them That's as panels nice, on the front nice of your box idea. Um, you could use one and use it as the card and then make a box to go with it. So you could use two of the sheets and then you've got them. So these are going to just go for a long, long time throughout the year. And that's just one of the designs in this kit. Now, these are all die cuts. I'm guessing you don't They're need all... a die cutting machine. So no, you, you don't. Start just literally pop out. And I'm going to show you how to put one of these Constantina cards together. And it is super quick uh, and so easy. And oh, you get pretty. full instructions. That's beautiful, isn't it? Absolutely gorgeous. Uh, so you're getting the lavender one there. Lovely. Uh, then you're getting your birthday birthday one love this one really fun great if the kids suddenly say to you mum I need a birthday card you can literally put that together um, within about 10 minutes by the time you've put all your little toppers on there but you they don't are need all to do any measuring out. you don't no, have to do any not scoring. at all it's amazing okay, absolutely right. amazing I love this one this is your sort of tropical one Aww. how beautiful is that you're getting those two sentiments on there you're getting your main so this one these are decoupage so you literally decoupage then the um, flamingo on top okay. but but if you don't, you've got two toppers there. Oh, there is. Yeah. I it's love amazing. that. And uh, if you pull them in and out, you'll see that's oh, the Constantina I shape. I see. So that base card mm -hmm. is going to make those bases. Then you kind of embellish yes. them with all the different bits of them. Yeah, absolutely. It? And they may look complicated, but I promise you that you're, they're not. And then we've got this one. Our last one is this one here. Um, so you, we all know someone that's really girly and really classy and fabulous. So um, this is for you. Look, you're in the pink today, <laughs> maybe. Well, I'm going to throw that compliment straight back at you because I've got... <laughs> them stay classy and um, fabulous on the cards that I've got here and I think it's just a brilliant idea the bases are all die cut they've pre-scored all you need to do is go along and do that construction so whether it's your pretty and pink that you're going for or maybe you're going to be a little bit more subtle with your lavender than you could do have you got multiple sentiments in these Debbie so yes so you've, got, you've got two different sentiments in each one on okay. each sheet nice uh, so idea. you've got loads so whether you use them on there or you don't they're amazing beautiful I love it. Now, $24.99 is the price that you would usually be paying for these. And how many cards are we making in total? 24, I think, and aren't you? And the say, yes. saying that because of the bases, I suppose. So it's what you get, yeah, and you've got your envelopes as well in here as well. Right. So, okay. uh, yeah, you've got loads in here and full instructions on how to do it as well. So that's why we're saying 24. But yep. you know, and I know, and Debbie knows that you will be making your own card bases with the leftover elements that you've got. Um, adding in your own cards, start making them go way beyond those 24. 24 cards to start so with. So 20 complete cards and okay. you're getting five different designs and two sheets per design. That's a lot. Mm, is 24.99, brilliant value for me. Yep, absolutely. And if I just show you why all oh, the price is coming down, Ooh, okay. I'm going right. to show you how then to put one together. <gasps> wow. Whoa, that's amazing. £12.50. Yeah. 
for that's all of very those. Good. Yeah, for nice. all of those that you could be making to all sorts of things. And literally, all you do is mountain and valley fold. That's all you so need to do. So is it already do. printed on there? Already oh, printed, so yeah, already there, done, yeah. already cut, so you haven't got to do anything. So okay. everything's done for you. And literally, always, I always start with my uh, mountain fold. So literally, mountain, mountain, mountain. And then you're going to valley fold the others. So, so valley fold. Up, up is and down is. Yep, absolutely. Lovely. And then this one as well. So. See, I'm thinking if you've got any um, kind of workshops that you're wanting to do, maybe it's one of those workshops where um, people might not want to do the, the matting and the layering and the sticking down or might not be able to, de um, dexterity issues, but they want to create something that looks as if they've created something fabulous. Maybe they're wanting to make a card for somebody. Well, there you go. How Thanks. amazing is that? That is brilliant. Now, it's not limited to one per customer. So if you fancy making multiples of these, fundraisers, quick and easy cards. Yep, absolutely. You're not going to need things like your mirror mm -hmm. card because you've got the foiling on there. You're not going to need all your different types of cards for your mats and layering. Um, you're not going to need your embellishments because they're all included in there as well. Very economical way Absolutely. of making Absolutely. And then your toppers then for uh, to go directly on them, which are amazing. And that's how easy they are. Literally that mountain and valley fold card. Uh, and then you've got all those different elements to to put on top of them absolutely amazing so saying 20 cards because 20 of the bases cards, and the yes, envelope absolutely then you've got lots of bits and pieces left yes, over as yes, well yes which is incredible isn't it love it there you go so if you fancy getting hold of yours 12 pounds and 50 pence lots of you getting involved eileen lynn elaine you've got yours seeing them all um, pop through some of you have got basket dwellers so i know some of you have got these in your baskets and you yet to check your baskets out yeah but please be as quick as you can because we don't have a huge quantities of anything to yeah absolutely grab those ones because you they're the, they're the sort of things how you don't think you need and then when you've got them mm. they're so simple to go to and be able to just then let go and make and them. also as well because we've got people shopping for multiples that stock is going down quicker and quicker rather than just people dropping for one some people are going for twos and threes of those so yeah quite easy getting through Amazing. that stock love it mm -hmm. what else should we chat about uh, so these ones here Hayley yeah. oh just as I grab these 10% of the stock of that last set have gone incidentally so uh, yeah you need to be quick what we got here this is a fabulous set so this was funny enough last year's birthday launch okay. so this year was our uh, wild at heart uh, last year was our say it with flowers uh, and as you know with any Sara signature collection it dwindles down so if you yes. don't get it all at once because it's a limited run uh, produce uh, this is the one what we've got left of here but actually some really good happy birthday uh, embellishments here and Beautiful range in this yeah like really that. lovely yeah. piece Oh, here. they're pretty. That's gorgeous, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely amazing. Gorgeous. And I mean, you can well, see that good price. Size die. It's a really good size die. And it's an edgeable oh. die. I mean, you can paper piece that, colour behind Beautiful. it. That's we had nice. some new ink pads on earlier. You could use that to colour them. The frames in here this are stunning. Beautiful. Yeah, absolutely stunning. Nice, easy subject to work with as yeah. well. I mean, flowers we use for so many different occasions, absolutely. don't we? Yeah. And this particular one here, I mean, look at the size of that die as well. I know. They're amazing. Beautiful. Absolutely amazing. Lots there's a few uh, samples just in Ooh. that pile there. Oh, there's Hayley. that frame, I think. Oh, no, it's not quite that frame, but... Um, no, that frame is in there. That's this frame. That's that one that I was just looking at there. And um, that's the other frame that you've got yeah, in there as well. Yeah, which is that one there. Beautiful. Look at that. That's that one. It's got that gorgeous lacy yeah, detail with beautiful. it. Yeah, it's beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. Look at that. How amazing is yeah, that? Yeah, it's really pretty, isn't it? Beautiful. You're getting a lot of metal in this uh, collection. Absolutely. There's lots of uh, dyes which are incredibly we love, pretty. We love our flowers for so many different occasions. Love this one where you've kind of got that centrepiece there ready for your sentiment. You could make a couple of these and kind of turn one of them, um, rotate it um, 90 degrees and you've almost got like a, a kind of um, layered version where you've kind of got that gorgeous detail to the, off to the side. I love as that well. die. Such a I just show you the die. It's a really lovely die, and it can go either way. Well. Yeah, cool. two lots of corners, and that die. It's just beautiful. beautiful. Also, getting those additional frames. So, if you're wanting the, the one with the flowers on, you could be using that one. Yep. But also, look at that for a sizable sentiment. That Isn't is that a lovely. good size. For me, that just you would only need that on your card. Just yeah. make a lovely card. That would make Absolutely. a lovely gift tag. You could put it on your gift boxes, beautiful. on your gift bags. It's just going to look so pretty. Love good that size. one. Now. Price-wise, we need to address that, but 
We're not going to do it just yet. We're going to give you 30 seconds to get involved. Well, clock. Lots of you getting involved with these. And I think these can be either the starting point of your project or the finishing point. You know, when you sometimes think, we just need something a little bit yeah, extra. Absolutely. So loads of fabulous finished samples. Now, mm -hmm. as you are getting, <laughs> you're getting yourselves ready with your orders, let's go through <laughs> everything that you're going to get with these. You're going to get all of the dyes from that fabulous signature range, Say It With Flowers, which it's one of those situations we use flowers over and over, including making the flowers themselves i haven't seen haven't seen this price Hayley. look at that oh my goodness that's less than half price 29.99 so and another 2.99 off with i keep forgetting 10%. about the 10 percent. keep forgetting about the, 10 the clock's come back up no <laughs> you know, it's not going again is it I, I genuinely in. thought it'd slip then because he was like, oh no, his clock's on again. <laughs> oh, <laughs> he's, he's a cheeky one, isn't he? He's mischievous. He's feeling mischievous oh, my today. Look at these. These are beautiful. Wow. Guys. I can't believe that's cheaper than that. So, I mean, does that die by itself, because that is a die, I mean, let's just talk about this one for a moment. Making your three dimensional mm -hmm. flowers. You've got all the dies in there. So they're not dies, that one. That's your 22 piece. Oh, but you're, is it? you're actually oh, getting I all see. your templates to make them. Oh, Look at that. I'm sorry. Price. I understood that oh. one. 19 99 for all of these. And you can still save that 10%. So that's an extra couple of quid off there if you are using that's that nearly, code. That's nearly £50 off with your 10%. That is a <laughs> absolutely, yeah. <laughs> Wow. And these are so usable. I mean, these dyes, absolutely beautiful. You get loads in here. So that one's got three pieces in it. Yep. That one's got one piece because it's a big frame. That's another two, so that's six. Yep. Then you've got that one, that's seven. Then you've got that fabulous one, that's eight. And you've got all that gorgeous template yeah, detail amazing. there for the flowers. Yeah. Brilliant value. And really good dyes nine. in that one. And, and actually, we've called it the site with flowers, but you're going to be able to use that all year round, absolutely. even those yeah. frames in your Christmas makes as well. Uh, they've got a lovely kind of Art Deco look to I love that. I love that so well. much. So yeah, um, and I'm just thinking. I'm just. Just thinking out loud, what if you have gone for those nested dyes mm -hmm. and you've got your circles there? You could actually be creating additional mats and layers to work oh, with absolutely. those as well, couldn't yeah, you? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. What an absolute bargain. That's got to be Beautiful. the steal of the show, I think. I never realised it was going to go that low. That's a nice one as well for a photo frame because you've almost yep. got the north and south elements there to keep your photos yeah, in absolutely. place. So, yeah. And you're right because it actually cuts out that middle section. Ah, okay. So not all dyes like that so cut out the middle section, so it, uh, it does. And that's beautiful. You could almost have your scratch sticker so in there as well. <laughs> wow, 19.99. The names are literally just flying up on the screen there. So there's some names I've seen before. So some of you are shopping for bargains in this hour as well. So I know you like a bargain. And if you've already paid your PMP, that's it. You haven't got to pay again. That is a really good point. <laughs> I've put these together in such a jumbled way. I do apologise. <laughs> um, but you're going to get them all. <laughs> and all your pen. And, and your pen and while stocks are. Yeah. <laughs> your pen if you've not got your pen yet and you're ordered. You're going to get that included as well. So a brilliant way for you to build up that stash. Now, another way for you to build up your stash are through magazines. I'm going to bring these two in because yeah. these are brilliant. And they are the latest editions that we've got. Yeah, the they are fabulous. So we've got our Crafters Inspiration 3 here and Crafters Inspiration 4. Um, uh, and they are amazing because they have so much in them uh, to get you creating. And it's not just about the freebies that you get in the magazine Hayley it's all about the projects that you've got in there as That's well and the no adverts in there as well so everything that you can find in there especially I'm going to take that magazine out okay. and just have a quick flick through because um, if we do yeah. overhead you'll be able to sort of see it a little bit better oh gosh it's like a proper book it is like a proper book and it feels lovely it's yeah. really good quality so you've got Sarah welcome you this is like our standard throughout them all um, and then you've got all these different projects now if I just flick to one project it tells you here your skill level so there's three okay. stars so you've got your uh, beginner your um, uh, well, intermediate, intermediate and then yeah. your uh, expert could get my words out then <laughs> uh, so you know exactly what it's going to take to do that and then you've got your step-by-step -step instructions there are some that are picture instructions throughout it's got all different things even some sewing in there you oh, can okay. see right. your, yeah, um, nice. bits in there and then uh, there's a lot where you can uh, in fact uh, ideas yeah, but I'm well. seeing these stamps are on the show, Hayley. Oh, they are. They're yes. like the blackboard ones, the blackboard aren't they? Stamps. So oh, you've okay. actually got projects. 
Um, Oops, sorry. Your blackboard. Look, all your blackboard stamps, and I think we've got three or four. We have, yeah. There, uh, which is amazing. You've even got a tea time teaser in here somewhere. Uh, you've got templates in there. Uh, it's just amazing. Absolutely amazing. And that's before all your freebies in there as well. Well, this well. is the thing, because it's lovely to see ideas within a magazine, but then you'll see the, the kind of idea, and it's like, well, where do I get all the bits and pieces? It's in yeah, there as well. Absolutely. So you're getting papers, which are already printed for you. Beautiful. You've got a top a sheet in there there Ooh, it is okay. which all pop out so all those oh. are pre uh, printed top of sheet plus all those different papers then look at this how Ooh, fabulous okay. is that border now this has got two edges on it this one will just cut in and then you put either this edge which has got your faux stitch in or this edge which has got your sort of uh, spaces in between you decide it's which like edge that you want on there one, isn't it's it? amazing yeah. isn't it and it's a really big die uh, nothing in here we reproduce in anything else so you can't get that you can't anywhere get that else. anywhere else uh, you'll get something similar maybe in uh, Sarah's enchanted dreams that she had out but that's completely different die and then you're getting all your stamps and bearing in mind this is just one of the magazines you know that get that again more one where you're getting that all again oh and we forgot to show this as well you've got a stencil in here this stencil's very clever if you've just got a card and put it on it's gonna look amazing if you've got a scrapbook page literally ink through it turn it round oh. turn it round again turn it round again and you get a full circle like that kaleidoscope of butterflies which is going to be amazing I love it. should we do swaps in yeah absolutely so you're going to get that magazine with all that inspiration mm -hmm. in there don't forget the price on your screen we know what Alex is up to. That is not the price you're going to be paying today. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely not. Uh, and giftable items as well, these. I think really even if idea, you've got yeah. them yourself, uh, go and get them for gifts for Christmas. Now, this one has got 79 different projects in here. Wow. Uh, just amazing. Now, this is a brilliant one to Ooh, have okay. because it takes you through your... Uh, it's got a hair colouring masterclass on That's here. Brilliant. takes you through some of your beauty stamps here. And, and it doesn't matter even if you don't have this stamp, the actual tutorial on how to do it is just so valuable and it will just go through again it will give you those so this one it tells us that we've got our expert so you it's your um, uh, sort of um, three star on that one but plus all of your and it's because they're paper piecing paper piecing can be a little bit fiddly but it's really worth it so, so. Although it's a skill level a higher skill level it doesn't necessarily mean you won't be able to do it it's not just at all. It's a bit more of an in-depth project absolutely not okay. but look at this treats for teachers in here okay. but treats just for someone that's got an office someone I that wants like that. i know idea. how amazing is that it looks incredible uh, and then you've got all these ones as well gifts for the teachers that they have which is your um ruler wreath. that's clever with all yeah, the rulers it's there. very cool isn't it yeah very cool uh, oh. but lots of different look pictures and, and bits and pieces but what you can do once you learn how to make this you can then take that into mother's day you can yes. then take that into easter you can take it into a birthday present even this here you can put a different sentiment on and you've got a, a different a really so any, all these projects are for you to make and, and be inspired by. And then you get in this one, look at this, a wow, whole star gosh, nesting a set. So you've got, it's actually your nesting dies in there wow. with stitched edges. Plus you're getting four sentiments in there. And then you're getting all your papers. You do get some more in here. Let me have a look on the, the first page. Stickers. There were stars in the, the scratch stickers, weren't they? Yeah, absolutely. Here we go. This tells, So you should have some stencils in here. And you get your animals with attitude. Um, oh, sentiment stamp the sets as well uh, and then you're getting all your papers as well so all those beautiful the, the pop outs again let me just swap them My over goodness. so you can see wow. all these that are going to pop out of the page for you and then you're getting all of those different papers look at these, these they're beautiful really so lovely so so lovely there's um, not one paper there that i wouldn't use no not at no. all and it is and that's exactly what it is these are usable they're inspirational uh, they are the gift that's going to keep on giving these magazines because there's so much in there. And the fact that you're going to get your dies in there or stamps or those different reusable elements. So yep. even once you've exhausted the papers in there, mm -hmm. you've still got those elements to absolutely. work with. Yeah, and you're absolutely. going to get both of those. Issue three and the current issue, um, or the most recent issue, should I say, yep. um, issue number four. Brilliant idea. So £27.98. Um, that is the price that you'd normally be paying for both of those together. 
And when you consider all of the projects in there and those different additional bits and pieces yep. in there, that's a lot of content. That's amazing. But we're halving that price. That so, is such a good price. Yep. So now you would usually pay $14.99 for one of these, but you're actually getting both of those sent. Yeah, it's so good. You can actually save yourself an extra £1.50 if you are using that code as well, because that price will come down by 10%. And if you've not ordered with us yet, we've still got those pens available, so you'll get that yep. um, bonus birthday gift alongside it as well. I love the it's pen. It's really pretty colour. I'm very that. impressed it's still in the building. We've had one <laughs> pen all of birthday so far uh, and it got put in the pen pot. Laura tried to seal it, but she didn't. Uh, but it's still in the building it's and it's still up, there. So you it? will still get one um, as we speak. So you uh, yeah, And they are amazing pens. And the only way you can get hold of that is by placing an order during the birthday event, which will be drawing to a close this week. Friends. It will, Wednesday, yes, Wednesday, absolutely. Yes. So yep. there you go, Fourteen mm -hmm. ninety nine. If you like the idea of those, I'm going to tidy up and pop those away what we're we going for next chalkboard ah oh, well you were talking about these debbie weren't you so you yeah. have those yeah, these are fabulous because uh, we call them chalkboard because they're in that style of print uh, that you would, as if you would do that script. So uh, so we've got here, laughter is the best medicine. Oh, I like Absolutely. that uh, Then you've got the greatest thing you um, could be is yourself. Oh, that's nice. And then our last one is enjoy the sweet little moments. So oh, really lovely uh, sentiments there. Uh, and what I love these for, they're great for, these would be fantastic if you went for, the ink pads we had on earlier with the gold, the new gold Ooh, shimmer okay, ink pads. Right, yeah. uh, but also these are great just to use uh, on scrapbook uh, scrapbook pages, nice also idea. in photo frames as well, which are going to be incredible. And you're going to be making the most amazing cards. And sometimes we just want to send an inspirational quote to somebody. That's, that's a really good point, actually. And because okay. they're quite substantially in size, they're almost like a card in their own right, aren't mm -hmm. they? Yeah, absolutely. They are absolutely beautiful. And they make that entire card front. So uh, I think they are a great addition uh, to your craft room, really. I love it. Um, just looking through the magazine as well, because you've got some I, I was thinking really I've nice lost ideas. Hayley. She's looking through Sorry, the magazine. I was listening to you. I was listening. <laughs> but it's lovely because when the, the magazine that we were chatting about earlier yes. on, you've actually got a whole section dedicated to these some yep. of them being your skill level one as you can see some yep. of them being a little bit more complex mm -hmm. but all of them are giving you ideas ideas you can actually yeah. work with with those there so they're all detailed in yeah it's amazing yeah. so whether nice. you want to do an ombre effect while using different colors in your stamp whether you want to heat emboss whether you want to use them and sometimes color in some of the bunting that goes through them um, you there's lots of ideas in there it's nice as well because obviously we've been talking about that kind of blackboard effect but yeah. nice to see them actually stamped in the, the opposite yeah. way around yeah well. absolutely oh my God. So the stamps, that's what we're chatting about. The stamps yes. themselves, if you're wanting those, normally £19.96. Beautiful. You're actually getting four. We've, we've lost one somewhere. So do more of what makes you happy. That's, Somebody else that was inspired there. by that and took it with them. <laughs> so there you go. <laughs> so you're looking at, what, um, just shy of £20, five or each. Not a bad price. Wow. Wow. Love that. Now we're looking at less nice than £2.50 each. Yes. Wow. Absolutely. Uh, plus another £99 keep pence off. About that. Yeah, another pound off. pound off there, yeah. wouldn't you? Yeah. That is yeah, brilliant. Love that one. Yeah, love it. Great yeah, one. Idea. Grab that because right. I don't think they'll be around for long. I think they're nice as well because if you wanted some ideas or something quick and easy, just mm -hmm. stamp those up and away you go. Now, um, where am I? Let's bring in the Venetian collection. I'm going to give yes. those to you while I kind of set our hand. Yeah, out. absolutely. This is a really beautiful collection and it hasn't been out that long, only a few months. Uh, and it was one of our um, collections that we bought out, all, uh, all to do with Venice really, isn't it? Beautiful. Which is absolutely gorgeous. So you've got your Moment in Time, which is your acrylic stamps. You've then got your uh, Rialto Bridge. I mean, that oh, is just that. stunning. I've not had the pleasure yet to um, go to Venice, which I would love. So, have you been to Venice, Hayley? I'm not, no. no neither. Florence. It's on my list. Venice. I've been to Florence as well. Yes, beautiful. lovely. Uh, you've got your um, harp there, which I love. I think you could use that in so many different ones. Wedding invitations would be lovely. Well. That one. I mean, that one, obviously, we're talking Venetian here, but 
but also it's kind of got that um, that connection with um, Ireland and, yes, and Celtic absolutely. as well. Yeah, absolutely. Drink. <laughs> now this one is a great one. This is a really big die and it's actually your ornamental frame um, and it's got an inside cutting edge as well as your outside mat and layering as well as that intricate die. So that's amazing. And then you've got an embossing folder that matches that as well. So that's it's your, uh, that's an actual cutting embossed folder. So it will cut the middle out for you as oh, well. Okay. Uh, we've obviously got our little cherub. You can't have a collection yeah. like this without having a little cherub. Oh, um, and uh, in case anyone doesn't know, the little cherub was uh, themed on um, Ada, which is uh, Leanne's little granddaughter. Oh. <laughs> so that's Ada cherub, yes. Uh, and then we've got our Renaissance uh, border and corners there. And then this one I absolutely Gosh, adore. The Renaissance frame, yeah, is such a beautiful design. That one you can um, emboss with your embossing folder to get all that detail and you can ink through it as well and it looks incredible it's amazing beautiful Debbie thank you for taking us through those I've got some amazing finished samples yep. that have been created utilizing these and that nice as well because they're kind of creating card bases yes as well as really little focal points I mean yep. we were learning about coloring hair in the magazine earlier on absolutely That's a perfect occasion isn't yeah it? absolutely and look how they match you've got that border dye down the edges you've got that amazing dye there and you can see you can ink through them which is incredible beautiful. classic style that one yes um, again a frame is brilliant as a starting point let yes. alone for finishing off a project absolutely it doesn't need a lot more when you've got a beautiful frame True. like that absolutely gorgeous a little bit of kind of a gilding wax or embossing and powders going on there now look at this little shaker card there because of course the aperture gives you the opportunity to add something in there and then of course we saw that fabulous bridge and there is your bridge that you could be using and it's actually two different dies that you've got there Kind of the foreground yep, detail and then the yep. mat to go behind beautiful, it. Absolutely beautiful. Love it. Brilliant collection. I mean, look at that. That's classic, mm. isn't it? And actually that same Rialto bridge, but in two completely different ways, looks stunning. Doesn't it look gorgeous for something like a wedding card? Yes. So £60.92. and pence. These are classic style dies and elements that are going to be used um, in all sorts of different ways. I mean, creating beautiful in, um, frames there for your shaker cards. Yeah. Going into your I mean, that's that cut and emboss folder, then that, that border die. Cool to use as a stopper it looks incredible absolutely classy classy i love it but would you like a good price on that one? Oh yes please. how would you like an absolutely outstanding price yes, on please. this one well we can help you with that one in fact we have got the power well alex has got the power to bring that price down and he is doing exactly <laughs> that and he's dropped the price down to 24 wow that's a wow that's a better, <laughs> than, that's a better than half price <laughs> that's a better than half price yes but if that's that amazing. saving isn't good enough, you can get yourself an extra 10% off by using the code. Yeah, so there you go. All of those classic styles, if you're wanting to get hold of those. Wow. And all of these, Crafters 18, it couldn't be simpler really, could it, that code? Um, I haven't actually got enough room in my hands to show you all of these because it takes you are down to get the 22 pounds. Wow. For all of these, I wow. mean, a couple of these dies, you'd be, especially the large dies, those are gorgeous frames that you've got with all that embossed detail as well. So with regards to this one, um, brilliant price, £24 yeah, a amazing. person. A couple of those you might expect to get for that price usually, but certainly not all of them. Absolutely beautiful as well. Twenty-four pounds and thirty-seven pence. Yeah, right, I love so those ones. I've just noticed the time on this. I know. I don't know where the hour's gone. Wow. It's feeding through. Now, where are we going next? Uh, cut and emboss this. All these ones here, here with yes. the flowers. Mm -hmm. More florals. We like yeah, more florals. I love a cut and emboss folder because. It really blows my mind how you can have an embossing folder with then a cut line in it as well. And it does those two, it's like a two for, isn't it? A two Beautiful. for one. I mean, look how gorgeous that is. Creating that aperture in the yeah, center. So they so all work lovely. on a similar sort of concept, these. Um, but you've got lots of floors. In fact, I think you're actually getting more than the three that I've got here. I think we've lost one somewhere along the way again, haven't okay. we? Okay. Was it four with these that we were getting? It is four. Ah, oh, nice. Classic that you've got there with the gorgeous roses. So oh, many occasions. Nice. Teamed up with the heart shape, as you can see there. Um, beautiful daffodils, as you can see. And the one that I can't show you, but I do have a finished card yeah, to show you. Yeah, look how nice your that is. Gerberas or Gerberas. I never know which way. I always to say Gerberas, but a lot of people say Gerberas, but um, yeah. Yeah, and they're all absolutely gorgeous beautiful yeah 51 so pounds nice. and 96 pence for all four of those so within these you're kind of getting multiple elements um, yep. i'm guessing yeah you are they are so amazing to use because to, in fact the technology it took about two years to get the technology right in these to have that amazing embossed detail and cut out at the same time because what you don't want to do is your dies to ruin your folder absolutely, so yeah. we've got that technology right 
dry and we've produced the most amazing folders. And if I turn that around, you can see how that is. So you're having that sort of cutting edge and that embossed detail, which Beautiful. is incredible. Love so it. all your, um, uh, what you would expect to find with an embossing folder, Hayley, so your letter press techniques, yes, adding your gilding course, flakes, yeah. colouring in, using your ink pads. You can do all of those, even though it's got a die cut in there as well. Brilliant idea. £51.96, brilliant price if you're wow. going for those and you're getting all four of them. But we're going to do your deal. We're going to bring me. that price down. We're going to, well, actually, it is almost a steal, isn't Look it? £24.99. Yeah, incredible price. Uh, you've got four folders there as well. Um, and again, Classic I'm thinking styles. gifts for people, tombolas, raffles, all those mm. sort of things when you've got deals like this. It's going to work really well. Quick and easy, but effective cards. That's the thing. With these, um, obviously a brilliant price, but if I bring this little card in the middle there, I mean, look at that. Yeah. That is a sizable card that you yeah, can be able absolutely. to create. Add your mats and layers, and you can go even larger with these. I'm oh, guessing. totally, yes. You don't have to just stick to the size of the folders. Uh, you can go bigger, yeah, mats and layers. Are the, so you could even put these sort of jaunty angle. Absolutely. Gorgeous colours as well you could be adding with these, and you're going to get all four of those designs for just £24.99. Love it. Amazing. Now we are turning our attention back to something that's proved to be mm -hmm. incredibly popular. And this is brilliant because you have got a concept card actually 20 concept cards yes. that you're going to be able to make and you'll have loads of elements left over. Yeah, I'm not surprised these have gone so quickly. It's because they are those quick, easy cards. But actually, I think a lot of people think when they've got a card like this, Hayley, that they're cheating. Mm. But you can be really creative with these. So whether you use your foam pads or whether you use your 3D glue gel, uh, you've got all these toppers uh, and you're getting two of each design. So two of each of your card bases and your toppers uh, and you're getting them in all these different in fact five different designs which is incredible uh, so again you're getting your extra pieces there to go with them and you can literally you will have loads of different toppers here that you can use on multiple different cards so even though we say 20 cards add your own card bank blanks and you could then be making more well could you take inspiration from the card bases Debbie and put the kind of cut lines yes. in and the fold lines yourself oh absolutely mm -hmm. absolutely you could use it as a template really couldn't you Hayley yeah. so uh, yeah and absolutely. it's nice because the Love card bases one. are actually double sided with regard to the actual print on there so not only have you got those um, kind of faux mats and layers in there because there's foiling in here the beautiful layers that look as if you've laid them down you could actually be taking the measurements of this and creating your own bases to use the additional elements that you've got left over lovely we're occasions still going yes because mm. the occasions are showing through them They've, you've got something I think for everyone there yeah. um, just beautiful designs I think if you if you want to craft with the kids, they're great for them to do them. They could be uh, popping these out and sticking them on for you. You could be making those cards. And it really is just adding in that mountain and valley fold on them. And that's all you have that's to it. do to create the most amazing dies. Love these ones. I love it. Um, and the beauty is, if you are buying them as a gift, because that is a stocking filler price, yes. you're actually going to get the full instructions on there as well. So you don't have to worry if it's for somebody that hasn't even seen the shows then that they can mm -hmm. know exactly what they need to do. Yep. And they are going to create the most incredible cards over and over again. That is the beauty with these. Absolutely adorable. Brilliant price, £12.50. As I say, phenomenal. 20 but grab them. At Look at that. Look at <laughs> you're loving them. Absolutely, Absolutely loving them. Yeah. <laughs> um, and lots of you going for multiples of these. Moira's gone for several sets of these. Yep. As has, well, the name's popped Audrey's off. I don't know who it was. Two. Yeah, yeah. Moira's got <laughs> two. Yeah. No, Elaine's got the two. Names <laughs> Alex, the names are there. They're just going Carolyn's too quick to read. Got two in her basket check them out because there won't be enough otherwise <laughs> this is the thing and also as well if you shop for them earlier on when we did touch on them um, and you suddenly thought oh I wish I'd gone for an extra couple of sets you can come back in don't worry that's not a problem but make sure you use that code crafters18 and you'll actually save yourself an extra £1.25p and it's worth going for that if you're having any issues incidentally when you are placing your orders sometimes as we get busier and codes get used and things like that it can get a little bit uh, kind of cramped on the website so just give us a call details are up on your screen now we are going to take a little walk um, and we're going to meet you the other side of this introducing the gemini 2 our brand new electronic die cutting and embossing machine has all the power and precision of the original gemini but with updated functions and innovative new features faster and quieter than ever before the gemini 2 does all the hard work for you Cut out the most intricate designs in seconds and all at the touch of a button. 
technology to apply higher pressure than many other machines offers perfectly crisp and clear results every time. The Gemini 2 has the power to take creative projects of all shapes and sizes in its stride. It will cut through a range of materials, from card and paper to cork, thin metal, leather and multiple layers of fabric. So you can save time on your papercraft, sewing and multimedia projects. A new and improved optical sensor runs the full length of its 9-inch platform, offering edge-to-edge -edge precision with cutting plates of any size. Pause, rewind and resume functions take the guesswork out of crafting. Smooth gliding feet make light work of moving and manoeuvring your Gemini 2, and a turntable offers 360 degrees of crafting freedom. Neat storage compartments hold craft tools so they're always at your fingertips right when you need them. A built-in media stand and three USB charging points invite you to craft along with your favourite tutorials and workshops on your tablet or phone. Easy to use and with everything you need to get started right out of the box, the Gemini 2 is for beginners and experienced makers alike. From scrapbooking and home decor to handmade cards, quilting and everything in between, bring your creativity to life with the Gemini 2. So there you go. You can see it's an amazing machine to start with. Now, we've got the details up on the screen because we've got the most incredible bundle. And guess what? You can save 10% on this one by using that code as well. But you will know if you've been watching the shows that that price is not going to state where it is. You're getting a lot for your money, though, with this one. Oh, Abby. such a lot for your money. I love this machine. I have to tell you, I when we were bringing out the Gemini 2, because we always made a promise that we wouldn't need to make a new machine okay. because we couldn't upgrade the pressure in the machine right, which is but key, yeah absolutely so we can't we still can't do that so if you've got a gemini that's fine but what we've done is we've then upgraded all those extra bits that move on in time okay so now we all watch our own um media stand so we need a media stand which we've popped into there uh, we've also got usb ports so now charging while you're watching everything so you could be watching hobby maker and then charging your phone or your uh, tablet on there and it's it's got a stand uh, it's got additional extra bits in there as well so you can put all your little pockets of um, your pokey tools and your scissors can all store nicely in there it is um it's three to, it's it's faster than it was before okay. and um uh it's 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 got new plates as well, well i Hayley. noticed how incredibly quiet it was when you were yes, using it yes it's earlier. a lot quieter and faster and we've now got new white plates now the new white plates are three times stronger than what they were before oh, okay. right. um, and the actual plastic shim is 10 times stronger wow. than what it was before so that is um, that is amazing and anyone because I know we've had lots of comments about can people still get their plates for their normal Gemini um, you can still use these plates they're exactly the same we've oh, just okay. made them better Fair so enough. it's not a case that we're asking you to go and buy another machine if you want to upgrade to those features and you want this amazing bundle with all those extra pieces um, oh they've also got glider feet now for me Hayley, oh, okay. you can choose. We do do an additional turntable, right. or they've got glider feet on them. I like the glider feet because I, I like that I can just push it and pull it with one finger. Uh, it's a little bit, do you know when you go to and buy a new sofa and they ask you if you want to have glider yes. feet on, and you think, oh, they just want more money. Yeah. Honestly, guys, put glider feet on your settings <laughs> uh, and ask them to demonstrate it because you would not be able to move your sofa and they put glider feet on and you can literally just push it. That's They're really amazing. Nice. Yeah. The Gemini is the same. So we've got glider fit, although we're not charging the extra glider fit. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> now, you're going to get all of these additional bits and pieces. Well, I say bits and pieces. There's a lot oh, in here Honestly, well. this is a craft room, isn't it? Uh, what Sarah was really, what she wanted to really do for birthday was not just to put bits and pieces in here. We wanted to give you collections of things. So you've got the gnome collection in there. You've got a little so Sarah cute. signature collection. You've got uh, border dies in there, panel dies, creator cards dies you've got so much in there we've also popped those inspiration magazines in there Look and all those all freebies sorts. that come with that yeah you've got absolutely everything that you could possibly want and additional plates as well Hayley okay. so not only the plates that you get in your box you're also getting additional plates to go with Ready it when you need them in your Gemini Two junior sizes. size oh. yes and your Gemini size which is absolutely is amazing brilliant. I love it so obviously you're going to get a lot within the box which you would expect I mean we're looking at Gemini 
Gemini too. But you've also got some additional bits and pieces in there, or lots of bits and pieces, to be fair. <laughs> and as I said, a brilliant price where you can save 10%. But what about if we were going to make sure you still got that saving of 10%, but that price was not the price on your screen? Well, let me introduce you to your new price. Because the chevrons are there, the price is dropping down, and this is a phenomenal deal. Yeah. You are going to be paying less than 490 I love we've got cutting. <laughs> Uh, you can see less than £500. You've also got your five-way split yes. with this one. But don't forget that little kind of faux pas that we made. I don't know if I meant to mention it or not. I but know. That additional 50 quid saving if you're using that code. Craft at 18. Somebody forgot to uncheck the box, which means you can still get that extra 10%. Amazing. So it's worth considering with that. And you've got five a uh, five-way split with this one. So Yeah brilliant one on the run up to Christmas. I mean, this will be on many people's Christmas lists. Oh, absolutely. And I, we know, I mean, that's still a lot of money, but actually it's more affordable now for people that True. really want to treat themselves to what I think is the best die cutting machine out there on the market. It has the most amount of pressure, unrivaled pressure, in fact, in the Gemini. So it is absolutely incredible. And we are not knocking any other die cutting machine. I've had loads in my time, Hayley, and they're all brilliant. Absolutely. But it's when you get the Gemini, you actually realise just how much uh, it works more efficiently and yes. I mean efficiently and with other die cut machines sometimes you've got to put your dies through sort of two three four times um, and a lot of that is to do with your dies as well mm. because dies years ago used to they're not coated very well yeah so yeah. but the Gemini I, I say to you get those dies out and try them through your Gemini uh, and it's just you amazing some dies absolutely yeah <laughs> absolutely all got them. <laughs> and this the code for 10% won't be around long I think it finishes on Wednesday yes. so make sure you get that additional 50 pounds off because uh, it all makes a difference to our pocket absolutely i mean that 50 pound saving could go towards something else and also it is a case of it's an extra 50 pounds so yeah we may bring out future deals at that similar price that 500 pound price point but you won't be getting that additional 10 percent, meaning you are saving that extra 50 pounds and of course in this show we've shown you just how far that 50 pound saving could go if you're choosing to spend it on other goodies we've got loads amazing deal but we've got lots of people placing your orders with these now Sarah, um, I believe you're having a bit of an issue checking out your basket. If you give our call centre um, a call on the number on your screen, 0800 00 144 They are a lovely bunch. I was up there last week placing an order. I know, yeah. Um, I and uh, yeah, uh, it was such lovely people. And they will be able to help you. So please do give them a call. They'll be more than happy to help. Really friendly bunch. Yeah. So make sure you give them a call. But lots of you checking your baskets out. I know. Um, I think the only regret that I ever hear from anybody that's gone for a Gemini is that they didn't go for it sooner yes it's so because true it, it's so it's, true it's kind of there then you're thinking i'm going to get one i'm going to get one yeah. but I'll, for whatever reason i'll leave it i'll leave it i'll get it next month i'll get it next month yeah. but this is a perfect opportunity and you've got that kind of not only the saving but mm -hmm. the way that you can make crafting so much easier I know, and so much in this bundle, which is incredible. I think it's the most we've ever put in one bundle like this. And it's nice because there's a little bit of all sorts There in is, there, so, absolutely. Yeah. I, I want to be that fly on the wall when your postman delivers it because, it's be boy, a what a big box this <laughs> is going to be. be <laughs> yeah, let's hope he's strong. <laughs> I love it. So when you, do, when you actually get yours, do us an unboxing video. Quite absolutely. often we'll do that, don't we, yeah, as companies? absolutely. Um, but we'd love to see you open that box up because it look like you've actually got a new member of the family coming <laughs> up there by the time the box gets there um, so details on your screen keep checking those baskets out yep. keep taking advantage of that five um, way split and please do take advantage of that additional 10 percent it's not going to be around forever no. crafters 18 that's all that you need to code um, to, to use but it will only work with your crafters companion products yeah so make absolutely. sure you're getting them while you've got the chance debbie thank yeah. you oh thank you Hayley. When you're back um oh uh i don't know oh it won't I, be uh, too long yeah it won't be too Long. I'm she's, sure in a couple of she's weeks. Got a next very, week, but she's maybe got a very, very busy rest of the week. <laughs> so I know you're heading um, up, up heading up north, north now. Yes, so uh, going journey. up there. Yeah, thank you very much. But thank you everyone because birthday has been just a truly emotional event because it you just it's because of you. You're amazing. It's made me feel really old. I'm not. Yeah. Gonna lie. <laughs> um, so check out your baskets. Make sure you grab yourself a brew. Come back and join myself after the break because we've got a fabulous show with Julie, and I'm really looking forward to this one. I know you guys are going to love it as well. Yeah. Yeah. Cinema. Want to know what's going on in the next show? 
then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobby Maker. Never miss a show by watching on the go with our brand new Hobby Maker app. Head over to your app store now and search Hobby Maker and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favorite presenters and guests. Click on the Today's button to shop all of the products that are featured in today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's best sellers and highlights. Have you missed a show? or want to watch one back, then click the schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking here for our social media pages. So never miss a show by watching On The Go with our brand new Hobby Maker app. Are you having trouble finding the perfect gift? Then why not treat them to the new gift card from Hobby Maker at hobbymaker.co.uk. Simply scroll down to the bottom where it says gift cards, click and you'll be taken to the right place. Decide between posting the card or delivery by email and then decide how much you want to add. You choose the value. So what do you get the crafter that's got everything? Why not treat yourself or them to the Hobby Maker gift card? When you purchase anything on Hobby Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee, meaning that you can shop with confidence. Happy shopping with Hobby Maker. Hello there and welcome back. Welcome back to what is going to be a very colourful hour. Yeah, we've it is. Colour galore. And we've got some fabulous things to share with you that I know you are going to love because it's a, an area that I love to, to kind of delve into, but I don't always have the confidence to get involved because I'm not an artist. No, nor am I. That's, that's the first thing. Uh, yeah, I, I know where you and I'm sure viewers are the same. Mm. Sometimes you see art materials. Yes. And you think, oh, I'm not qualified to use those. But hopefully this hour will encourage you to have... A, I'm, a, I'm a dabbler. Is that, what, is that a good word? No, that is a good word. I Do like you know, to dabble. When, I, when I'm talking about people who are new to, to um, sewing, I will often say invest in brilliant quality, or brilliant quality products like the fabric yep. and it makes life a lot easier for you when you're learning. Is yeah. that the same with 100%, paints? 100%, yeah. These paints, obviously they're artist grade paints, but you can incorporate them into your everyday crafting okay but because they're such premium quality you're going to get really good results which then hopefully will build your confidence to explore yeah that's a thing, different a different avenue really yeah. i mean i'm no artist but i love to well, have a pa paintbrush in my hand and be doing some painting well i beg to do it <laughs> so you look at these finished samples i mean julia's created the most amazing finished samples she's not had a huge amount of time either as well and what i love as well you've kind of incorporated things from your craft room as well so it's yes. not a case of like okay now i am going to be an artist i'm just yep. going to use my paints i'm just going to use my brushes yep. my paper and nothing else no. what sort of things have you incorporated so i've incorporated things such as stamps okay um stencils got them um just pencils and I've, I've got some really quick and easy techniques that will give you a really good effect and hopefully again boost your confidence so like i said i'm not really a massive sketcher but 
I can show you a few techniques that you'll so think. So having those foundations, yeah, it's, that it's, outline. But they sort of, they're really simple and, and anybody can do it. This if is, I can do it, anybody yeah. can do it. And have a look at this scene. I mean, this could be taking yeah. inspiration from a photograph that you've done. This at, is um, it. When you've so been away. This is um, one of the landscapes that we've got in the show in the pack, which is one of Delphine's. Oh, is one of Delphine's design? Yes. Okay. So this is basically sort of like a painting by number without the numbers. So right. you've got a free license as to what season it is, Good point. what colour yeah. choice, maybe you're wanting it to paint and frame to put in your bathroom or your bedroom, you want it to sort of bring in some of the tones that you've got in your point, yeah. home decor. Um, it's just, like I say, the sketch is there, you just complete it however yeah. you want And it. we have got those sketches available on the show, yeah. but can we see yes. this fabulous little canvas that we've got here? In fact, no, before we look at that, let's look at these flowers because these look yeah. beautiful. They're really easy to do. And the great thing about the um, gouache paints that we've got today, they've got a really thick consistency. Okay. So they are water-based, but you can use them without watering them down. You can use okay. them straight from your palette, but it then gives you that thick texture, like on the flowers, so you, it, you can be putting it onto your craft card, onto your black cards, dark, dark blues, and the pigment in them just pops on dark And cards. you'll see that pigment coming through on this fabulous little canvas that we've got yeah. here. This is, it's only a little mini canvas. So yeah, so in there. that's <laughs> just one. I just did, <laughs> you can let, so you, let your imagination go. I mean, it's not somewhere that I've been. It, it just, I thought, right, I'm going to do some fields and a tree and some flowers. So I just went for it. Did it brilliantly. <laughs> she she can't do it. <laughs> I beg to differ. But of course, we're talking about quality as well. And the quality of these paints means you can build up the layers as well. You can. Um, be if, for best results, if you're wanting to put sort of like a white onto a dark colour, let it dry completely first. Okay. And then that colour will really pop. Um, if obviously you're wanting it to sort of like blend in, then obviously while it's still wet, you can be blending your colours. You can also mix the colours in your palette. So not only have you got what you've got, that you've got a whole spectrum of colours that you can be mixing yourself. Take you through those colours in just a few moments as well. But you can see whether it's sitting on a white canvas, whether yeah. you're using those fabulous elements that you're looking. I mean, craft card as well, you're using yeah. it on craft card. But look at this yeah. on your solid black cardstock. So that How is How many layers have one. you had to build That's up? That's one layer. Layer. one layer of paint wow the only extra layer i've put on there is just a little white that highlight where again i put it on wet so it's sort of blended in but that's just one layer of paint on some plain black card stuff so did you do that freehand to start with that's a stencil so oh, i okay. can show you that so that's just something i had in my stash which i'm sure we've all got stencils yeah. and things. so think of it you know if you're not somebody that wants to sketch a picture Bring your stencils in and then yeah. just use your paints. And then all I've done is just use some dotting techniques just to decorate the baubles. So oh, simple. I love it. But could you go in with your gems and your glitter you on could, top of that if you, you could. To. Obviously, you can see on the little bows, I've just put a little gem on each of them. But yeah, bring your glitters in, whatever you're wanting. Now, let's talk about colours because have you seen this gorgeous <laughs> array of colours that we've got here? It's now, incredible. we've got a few different ways for you to actually get hold of your, your collection. But this is beautiful. You've actually got 56 colours in here. And the thing I love about this, you've almost got kind of groups as well. When we're looking at things like the greens here you've kind of got different tones warm cool they're all in yeah, there yeah they are and like i say if you get yourself a little mixing palette you can be mixing your own colors as well so if you've got 56 you've got hundreds really because Absolutely, yeah you know um with your green tones you're going to mix two together because if you're doing something with foliage you want to put light and shade and you know it's um they're incredible. They now, really can are. Can I show them how? Because you might look at that and think, oh, that's a lovely display. Somebody spent hours putting those all <laughs> and positioning them. That's actually your packaging that yeah. is going to come in. Julie, can I pass this over yep. to you so you can actually open it up yep. and show our viewers what they're going to be able to see when they receive this? So, details are up on your screen, incidentally. So, if you want to get involved already, then you can do yep. And don't forget, we are going to talk about gouache paints a little bit more, how you're going to use them, why they are so effective. But the price on your screen, importantly, is not the price you be paying so That's solid you, yeah and it it's a click lock yeah so it's secure when it's on you've got your piece of foam at the top which is going to protect your paints okay so then you get your individual pots you've got your color chart here perfect so what i what i do is i opened all of mine okay 
because you'll find when you've got your little lids on, you have to sort of pick them up to move them around. So it's easier just to open them all. So if I just bring in my smaller so You've there, got one of the smaller palettes. Just so I got. can show you. Yeah. That's how they are. And then I just put my lid on when I've finished. Perfect. All you need to do, um, if you feel like they're getting a little bit dry, you just, when you open them, get yourself a little mister like this okay. and just give them a spritz all the way over. I use a cocktail stick. You can give them a little stir just to waken yeah. them up again. But you might use them several times before you need to do that. Mine are still juicy and I've, I've had mine open. There's a lot of paint in it. There is. Those. They're going to last you a long time because you use very little because it goes oh. such a long way. Beautiful. Um, um, so as you said, 56 colours yeah. as you can see um, here in front of me. Now gouache paint, what is gouache paint for anybody that doesn't know? So gouache is a water-based paint. Okay. It's kind of, the only, best way I can think to describe it is it's halfway between an acrylic and a watercolour. So like a hybrid? Yes, it is. It's got a very high pigment in it, as you've seen in some of the um, samples that we've shown you. So it really does sort of have a vibrancy to it, which is the pigment in it. But you can water it down. So you can add a little... If you're wanting to sort of create a watercolour effect, you can with these. Okay. You just need to get yourself a palette and just mix some water in them and they will work like a watercolour. But the so finish like on them... like that, so you can blend yes, them. Yes, yeah, you can blend them down. So then, um, if you use them direct straight onto your piece of cardstock, they have this thick consistency. So they give you almost like a texture. Yeah, so you can feel where if they are. you put some, if you put a layer down, uh, on this one here with the Christmas tree at the front, mm -hmm. I just used a cocktail stick and I just... Um, added some strokes into it to give it a kind of see yeah it to there. give it yeah so it's thick enough that you can add a little bit of texture to it if it depending on what you're doing um brilliant but i've 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 always used watercolors before but i'm now in love with these because uh, they give me an element of both so yes. like i say if i want that watercolor effect i can do that but obviously the the, the vibrancy and the thickness to them i like for um doing canvases and Absolutely. things like that. My ears pricked up when you said that the water base. So yep. straight away I'm thinking, can I mix these in with things like my gel medium? Can oh, I mix them in with so. my texture yep. paste? Anything yep. that's water based. Yeah, you can be, like yeah. Concentrate yes. of colour, yeah, isn't that's it? Yeah, it. yeah. You just, all you'd need is a separate mixing palette to, you know, whatever you wanted yeah. to do with We've only them. seen these ones before and they sold out. Yes, so, uh, yeah, they're if, incredible. And so if you have been crafting with them, I'd love to see what you've been creating. <laughs> anyway, let's address that price because as I said at the top, that is not the price that you are going to be paying. And I've been chatting about them for way too long. <laughs> so the chevrons are there, the price is coming down. So if you've already got involved, you can see you are going to be paying that lowest price along with everybody else, £49.99. You've got two-way splits on this one as well, which makes it incredibly affordable. And look at that for portability. That is nice. brilliant love this idea um, if you fancy getting involved then everything you need to know is on your screen and of course the brand that we're talking about being Himmy is one of those kind of professional that's quite heavy actually I'm going to put that back down again they're um, a Japanese <laughs> brand okay um, so they're top quality yeah um, it's a brand that um, the management team um, came across in Frankfurt yeah I went to the big show quality. there um, so like I say, I've been to air once and I think a lot of it today is a restock because we sold out of most of it last Absolutely. time. And we will see some of these fabulous yep. finished samples coming to, together in a, a little while as well. So details are on your screen, 56 colours to tickle your fancy with, absolutely beautiful. And we have got other palettes which we'll touch on in a few moments. Same consistency, same gouache, but I want to see these in action. Yep. Okay, so inspire I'm... me, Julie. <laughs> Hopefully I will. Um, so I'm just going to show you some few easy strokes to do to create some poppies on a card like, that, the poppy like that the one earlier that we on yes. i've lost it because like i just want to show you how so that's where we're going yep so that's where we're going so i'm going to do something along those lines so i've just wet my paintbrush okay and then i'm just going to pick up some of my jelly paint it is like a jelly paint it is it's yeah. and it, you'll see it's not dripping it's yeah. it's a thick consistency so all we need to do this is a really quick, effective way of creating something. So you want to give yourself almost like a, a U shape, okay. but just add a few flicks into it. Right. And then we're going to do another one here. I love it. It's almost like you're making a little kind of tulip shape. Yeah, that's that it. One? Oh, so you're doing it either side. Yeah, right? either side. And then I'm just going to put a tiny little U shape underneath. Oh, OK, right. And then I'm going to do another one here. So, so this is going direct from the little pot. So I'm going direct this time. 
if like I say, if you wanted it to be more of a washed out effect, like a watercolour, mm -hmm. you could water these down. And I'm just using here just some watercolour cardstock, which we've got on, on the show. Now you're taking your time with this. Do you not have to rush to kind of get it all done before they no, dry? No, they stay wet. Um, I mean, they don't stay wet for a long time, but they stay wet long enough then for you to bring a bit more in and sort of blend it okay. if you want to. Um, so I'm just going to do the same. I'm doing the same thing. This one I'm doing a little bit smaller. And then I'm just going to bring in a few little dots of it. Okay. Because these are just going to be like little buds when I bring in my green. Um, incidentally, if you are looking at the paintbrushes and thinking, where can I get those from? Well, you can get them from us as well. Yep. And I'll give you those details in a little while. So all I'm going to do now is just pick up some of my black. Okay. And I'm using the same brush. And then I'm just going to almost do like a dot in action just to bring in the centre of that puppy. The seed bits. Yep. Okay. And just do that on the three that you've done that are open. And like I say, I just dabble. I'm no artist. I have no, I no qualifications <laughs> or anything like that. I'm just a crafter that I like to try different things. And this is just another medium that I like wow. to work You're with. You're giving me the, the confidence yep. to think I could achieve it. So then all time. we need to do now is just bring in some of our greenery, some stalks, okay. so you, you can mix and match. So I'm just going to pick up some of the meat, like a medium green colour. Mm -hmm. And then I'm just going to, if you feel like you've got too much, just scrape a bit off back into your pot. Yeah, don't and scrape then, it off onto like a tissue. No, no, no. Back in the pot. Put it back in your pot. And then I'm just going to bring in some. And it's nice as well because of the consistency. You can kind of load your you brush can. without it being too drippy. And all you... If you can see there, it's sort of broken as I've brought it down. Mm -hmm. That's because it's quite a thick medium. So if you want to sort of smooth something out, just take, wash your brush out and then just get yourself a little droplet of water onto the end of your brush. Okay. And because it's still wet, you'll oh, see it will blend that out and give you a better consistency. So rather than add more paint onto it, just blend out the bit of paint that you've already put on there. Oh, I see. Okay. Because it's water-based, you can do that. Yeah. Obviously, some paints, you can't do yeah. that. Um, so, and then I'm just going to carry on. It's almost got a look of an acrylic paint to it. It has. And consistency-wise, it's very similar to an acrylic paint. So, I'm just going to put almost I like a... You could use this on fabric and things like that. You can well. use it on fabric. Um, I don't know whether you'd need an extra medium to mix with it just to make sure it doesn't wash out yeah. of your fabric. Yeah. No, that's a fair point. Um, so, I'm just... If you're creating put... something that, I don't know, tote bag or something, you wouldn't be, yeah. be washing it, really, would no. you? No. And um, it just, it rinses out of your brush very simply. So, then, all I'm going to do then is just add a few little leaves on. And I'm just using my brush and just pressing as I go. Okay. So, it's, like I say, nothing here is too complicated. I think it's all... If I can do it, anybody can do it. I That's love it. It's so exciting. It's lovely to see so many of you getting involved um, with these as well. Because I'm wondering whether you, you consider yourself to be a accomplished artist or whether you've been inspired to yeah. give it a go. Because, uh, I mean, as, as you can see, Julie's creating this. She's, she reckons that she's not an artist. But she's created all of these fabulous pieces over the weekend. Um, and that is the beauty of it. It's one of those situations that you are going to be able to create some amazing pieces just by giving it a go, using the tiniest amount of that constant. Yeah traded colour that's the thing so all I've done now instead of picking up some colour I've just added a little bit of water to my brush okay. just because I want the bottom bit to sort of like be a bit softer see now it's looking like a watercolour yeah so that just shows you like I say then that now you can leave it to dry and then you can be popping it on and this is just a sentiment that I've stamped on here and just matted and layered it I love it. And that is brilliant because you've got your card there, your greeting card, yep. and then your gift um, yep. alongside. Yeah, that's and it. you could even be creating a canvas with that's the right. is in as the gift. That's right. I mean, all it, the technique's going to be the same. It's just your brush strokes are going to be bigger depending on what size you're popping your poppies onto. 
popping your poppies. That's the phrase <laughs> of the day, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Julie. That's all I really right. enjoyed that. Yeah. Now, the brushes that Julie's been working, we've got two different sets to share with you. So the pink ones, these sold out last time, so you may well have missed out on these. So if you're wanting to get hold of these, these are brilliant. They come in a fabulous little box, which is a storage box, but to be honest, it's nice. Well, I should say it's kind of your, not your storage box. It's kind of like your um, your delivery, your, your packaging. But to be honest, you can use it as a storage box as well, because it's a little kind of slide out drawer, as you can see there these ones are flat brushes but the price on your screen is not your final price so 12 these are really nice they are 12 and well you've just seen i've just used one in the painting that we've just done they're lovely soft bristled mm -hmm. um but even you look at that and think oh that's quite thick but if you just put paint on the very they do go into a very it's small tiny, area yeah. yeah you just need a tiny bit of um paint on the end of it Got a lovely feel to they them have. as well. Um, beautiful to look at as well because they've got that kind of classy style to them. Each one of them have got numbers on there. So if that is important to you that it's a particular size, then you have got all of that on there. But you've got a mixture of kind of rounded heads with these, um, a lot of them being flat there. So perfect for you to get into the nitty gritty. And then, of course, you've got your fine detail one there that Julie has been working with as well. $12.99, brilliant value for money. But we're going to drop the price down. So the price that you're paying is not that um, $12.99 with this one as well. It's actually $9.99. And I was just looking because it looks like you've got kind of packaging there, but I don't think you have. It's just kind of part of the, the design. Yeah. Love it. Beautiful. Um, brilliant value for money, $9.99. Um, you might be tempted to go for a couple of sets of these, to be honest. Um, I mean, obviously, you've got the, the softness of the bristles there, but it might be that you're wanting to go for a set for your different yeah. colour groups. People often do, don't That's they? That's it. And you've got sort of brushes for different techniques. So your flat one, maybe if you're wanting to make a background oh, like a or wash bla type yeah, thing, sort yeah. of an ombre effect, you know, you'd use that. You've got your finer point ones then for your detail and your more intricate things. Maybe you know somebody that might like a set of these for Christmas. Mm. There, it'd be a perfect stocking filler oh, at that point. That price, price, wouldn't yeah. they? If you're somebody that paints or you've got a little art budding artist in the family, I've got a lovely colour to yeah. this one. Well. Everything that Himmy do, it's all so pretty you know Absolutely. you're sold on the packaging as much as the product but that, the product is top quality but that is a pride isn't it to, yeah. to show the presentation it of is. it that is the key yeah. thing um, and now we've got another set for you now these we've not seen these before so these have got the most incredible blue handle with them um, and again you've got fine detail with this nice little trio this particular one so you can see three different styles of brushes again you've got that fine detail tip as you can see there you've got your flat brush and you've got your flat rounded brush with this one as well again you've got your sizing on there so you've got a four you've also got a six and an eight so a nice kind of set nice gradient to different sizes with those 12.99 again you price on your screen but I know what kind of mood um, our Alex is I know that's price that you're not paying um, so we are going to go to what I quote as a crazy price with these we were looking at was it 9.99 a few moments ago 5.99 for these so wow. yeah brilliant value for money for that little trio there these ones come in a little pack um, so again if you want to keep them in the box alongside the pink ones if you've gone for those as well then by all means please do so but 5.99 a very affordable yeah. price and of course useful to use with loads of different paints not just the gouache that many of you are shopping for in this hour um, but we were talking about the different kind of ways you can use yep. these we saw freehand with the paint brushes earlier on yes I can see you've got your black card and your stencil I there. have so I was just going to show you how easy it is to bring in things that you might already have in your stash at home okay so if you're not somebody that wants to just sort of go for it mm -hmm. or you know draw straight away bring in your stencils and you can use those to create some really nice effects using the paints so I'm just going to draw a rough I'm just gonna I'm, I'm gonna I'm do one branch so I've just got okay. my pencil and because it's on black cardstock, you'll be able to see where your pencil line is. Lovely. So you don't so, even need to be able to draw, just use a stencil. No, that's it. it. Brilliant. It's just a way of incorporating, like I say, things that you've already got in your stash that are then going to give you a sort of starting point to use the... If, you know, if you're somebody that's never picked up a paintbrush before or used paints before, this is going to help you... It's a confidence builder. It's like having armbands on when you start it is, swimming, isn't it? It is. <laughs> it is. Because it gives you... Yeah. So you'll see... Oh, look at that. I've just drawn around my stencil. Okay. So I just thought, 
showing you on the black cardstock will give you an idea of how good the pigment is in See, these this is the thing, because black cardstock usually you're building up and building up, aren't you? Do. You do, yeah. and I know if you try to watercolour on it sometimes, it just ends up going muddy mm -hmm. into, the, into the dark cardstock. It's very hard to get vibrancy yes. onto a dark piece of card, isn't it? So I'm just going to pick up some of my green. Lovely. And this is just one coat of paint. Wow. So you can see straight away. My goodness. Sometimes you have to put like, um, uh, like a gesso down or something you like do. that to just prime the surface. But yep. straight in. Oh, and wow. this kind of actually, you saying about gesso, if you apply it quite thickly like I am, it gives you a texture. So that will give you a like a raised finish, kind of like a gesso. Yes, you know how yeah. you can create all your sort of like textures with that. Um, it's the same sort of thing. So I'm putting quite, I like it to have a bit of texture. So I'm putting so it's quite a, kind of a the brush strokes thick in it. Like, yeah, yeah. So I'm just following where I've just put that pencil line. Okay. But now if I wanted to, which I would, add a bit more, a bit, add, add a bit of highlight to it, or maybe you want to add a bit of dark into it, mm -hmm. you can pick up your colour, a darker shade or a lighter shade. And you can sort of merge that in while it's still wet. Oh, okay. So we can bring it, let me do a bit of a darker colour actually, just so it shows. So I can be bringing in a bit of a darker colour just to give you a bit of well, detail. Kind of the depth of the, the character it is. of it, yeah. Because really, foliage, leaves, they're never just one shade. No, so you can see that's I've a good point, yeah. And then if I wanted to bring, I'm just rinsing my brush each time if i then wanted to bring in a bit of highlight i could then just pop and i'll show you a technique that i use so if you just pop down your white where you think you want it okay rinse your brush off but just then like i say with the tip of it just collect yourself a little droplet of water and then you can then blend that out slightly to give you that highlight without it being white just softens the it edges, just softens it? Yeah. it a little bit so if oh, i just want fabulous. yeah so you can bring in i'm just going to bring in a little bit more white i love it now if you were going for the set of 56 you've probably got about 10 different tones of green yeah. in there as well which is brilliant because if you want to get that realistic look then you can do as you can see there i mean you've got a whole my, uh, myriad of colors there uh, it could be your scenes that you're building up those hillsides it could be your um, your holly that you're creating um, but the beauty is you've got them all in there all 56 of those colors and a lot of them you've kind of got a little kind of palette of each one of those there creating some beautiful pieces and I'll tell you about how you can create your own lighthouse scene in a little while. But, Julie, you've come in with that red. Yeah, look wow. how vibrant it is. It's incredible, isn't it? And this, remember, this is just me putting one layer down. This isn't, you know, you'd expect to get this kind of depth of colour with two or three coats normally yes, or something. Yeah. That's if you get it to be that vibrant. And sometimes it can look quite patchy, can't you it? You can. Because even if you do multiple layers, sometimes you've got a double layer and sometimes it's yeah. a single layer. If you, you have to go over several times to make sure yeah. you build it all up. And sometimes, you know, free painting around shape can be a bit daunting. Um, but all you need to do is just put your paint down and just keep the pressure flowing. So okay. you get to that point, and then when you get to that point, turn your card. Ah, oh, okay. So I, I turn my work as I'm painting because I find then I can just continue with that pressure around that shape. And you, you're only doing a, quite a small movement then yeah, as well, aren't you? Yeah, that's it. Just keep the pressure on and you'll see that that then has created the bauble shape and then I can just fill that last little bit in then. And then... If you want to then add a little bit of highlight to your bauble like I did on the sample, just pick yourself up some of your white. Okay. And then, depending on where you want your light to come in, I tend to put it down that side. So yeah. this, see, this is something that would probably possibly be a no-no because you'd be making it kind of yeah. almost like pink, but it's sitting on the top. Yeah. And if you wanted it to be brilliant white, I, like I said earlier, I would leave it to dry. Okay and then put your white on. But I kind of like 
to blend it in. I don't always... It's a bit of a haziness then, It does. It? Yeah. So you'll see, you can bring your highlight in and then rather than add more colour, just add more water to blend it okay. and then you'll find it will just move enough because it's still wet to create that highlight on that there. That is brilliant. And then if it dries and you think, actually, I want a little bit more definition, if I bring that one in, you can. Look so you that. can see. And then same with your ribbon if we bring in another colour so if I bring in I've got a colour in here which is almost like so I think you, it's like a gold. Where you the edging here Dan is yep. that done with the paint as well? All I did for my white edging was brought in my white gel pen. Oh okay right yeah, because makes sense. you might want it to have that with have no definition around the outside. Yes. It, this is personal choice I just preferred it with the white around it. Doesn't it show that it's the same? I know it yeah. sounds a bit daft, but it's the same white. Yeah. Because it's, it's kind of bright white that yeah. you would expect from those those pens. That's it. Um, incidentally, we've got um, a few different ways for you to get hold of your paints. We've got the details up on the screen for your 56 colours. We will be showing you the, the smaller palettes, um, one of which that Julie is working with, where you've got 24 colours in there. So obviously this one, you've got the gradients of colours in there. So you go all of the different kind of tones, your lighter tones, your darker tones, your mid-tones your cool and your warm colours are all featuring within here. You've always got these look like metallics that we've got at the top yeah. here as well. I Lilas. mean you've got a colour you've got a um, colour chart in there that will give you an idea of, of your colours but like I say you've oh you have got oh they're pearl pearl white yeah. pearl silver pearl teal pearl um, pink pearl, um, pearl purple pearl blue and you've got your gold and your bronze in there as well you've also got fluorescent tones in these so bright vibrant fle um, fluorescent colors with your yellow your green your orange your pink your purple and your blue as well but you've also got your kind of powder tones your pale pastel tones including things like your titanium white as well that lovely bright white that you've got in there so all the colors that you could possibly need some of them being um, phrases that you'll be familiar with burnt umber featuring in there as well tones of your greens as well beautiful purples as you've seen there as well but i love those uh, metallics now the metallics are available in the smaller sets so if you're thinking oh hang on a minute i'll look at the smaller sets but i want the pearl this is the way to get hold of those pearls and the pearls are across the top here and you've got those gorgeous gorgeous pearl, um, tones in there so pearl white you've got silver in there gold and bronze you've also got that gorgeous pearly teal the pearl pink and the pearl purple as well as the pearl blue as well so absolutely gorgeous colors but then you kind of got the bright tones as well and you will get a little colour chart that comes with yours as well. But she's in a happy place, our Julie. Look oh, yeah. <laughs> she's having a lovely so, time. So, yeah, I was just going to show you. So, although that's not wet, if you don't want it to have a real definition between the two colours, start to incorporate things whilst it's still a little bit moist. Okay. So, you can leave that to dry now, but obviously, because I'm showing you for demo, <laughs> um, <laughs> I'm going to go for it. So, all I would do then, if I wanted to sort of bring some decor, because obviously you've used your stencil, you might want to add a bit, you could add your glitters, you could add your gems. Okay. But I tend to use the end of my oh, okay. paintbrush. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm going to hope that this is going to work. Of course it will. We'll be channeling lots um, of positivity for yeah. you. So I've just literally dipped that in to my um, okay. gouache paints. Yeah. And I'm just going to dart oh, wow. a little dart oh, all the way along. That. And then I'm just going to wash the end of it. <laughs> and then I'm going to bring in then some white and just just gently dot around it and then i'm just gonna pop this kind of dot art is ever so popular it is it? i mean these are perfect if you, yeah i see a lot of oh, on things. um i was just gonna say on most social media i see a lot of like sort of people creating like a man mandala pattern oh, yes, with yeah, dotting onto yeah. like you say onto stones or onto wood yeah. these because they've got such a thick consistency they would be perfect to, for that with your dotting tools and things. And if you think you've picked up too much, you can always dab a little bit off. But just to give... So these, if you kind of put them on and you, you, you kind of almost got like a raised texture, will it keep that raised Yes, texture? it will, oh. which I quite like because it makes yeah. them sort of like a bit tactile. You know, you want to feel it. Mm. Um, we were, when we were prepping, weren't we, for the show, um, even the sort of... Um, um, landscape that I've done it's all got a texture yeah. to it and you can kind of feel the detail without you know so that just shows you uh, fabulous yeah just it? a few dots and you've decorated the bauble 
And she's not an artist. I'm not. Yeah. Um, that's just a quick and easy. That's, and like I say, if you bring it in, you can incorporate it. And the other thing is, with using a stencil, you haven't got to worry about masking areas yes. off. Like, obviously, you can see this bauble is sat behind the others, but yeah. that's because I, was, I used my stencil in a clever way that as I painted it then, I could do the one behind without right, having yeah. to wait for it to dry and then mask things Hold off. You can just be clever with the things that you've got in your stash. I love it. Now, Julie, can I trouble you? Just go through um, some of these finished samples yeah. and explain the different techniques that you've used because the, ultimately okay. they're still using the gouache paints. We're they are. We're talking about other bits and pieces as well. So this one, I've actually sketched this. So all I did, this is a piece of um, watercolour cardstock that I've just cut a strip off and then I've just used my pencil to sketch some houses and a little winter scene. Love it. And then um, I've used my dotting technique on the trees. Oh, clever. Where I've put the black outline, if you let it dry, you can then bring in your um, fine line pens. Oh, okay, um, yes. And then the, the snow at the top. You could do the tapping technique with your brush to make it splatter, but Got because you. I'd already done it, I didn't want to do that. So the snowflakes, I've just brought in with my white gel pen again. Oh, okay. So things that you've probably already got at home, you can be incorporating in with the painting. I love it. Um, and like I say, you can feel, because I sort of dab down the snow, oh, yes. you can, it's got a texture got a to texture, it. Yeah. Um, so yeah, you know, there's so many things. I love it. So this is pretty. This one, I can, we can do an ombre background. I can show you how to do that. But these are just stamps. Okay. So this, I literally just did the background popped myself a little circle of white paint and just sort of merged it out with some water so it looks a bit like a hazy moon. And then these are just some stamps I had at home and I've just used some archival ink. Of it, brilliant. So, you. you know, if you don't want to be drawing at all, yeah. start creating backgrounds, get, you know, if you're not confident, you do that first. Use your stamps and things to bring Brilliant bring idea. it in. Yeah, I love it. Julie, we're going to look at more in, food, in yep. a few moments, but I promised you other palettes. So, <laughs> 56 colours if you wanted to go for the bundle that's on the screen. Julie's been working from the 24 colour palettes, and I've got two of those um, here. And again, I'm going to get... Is it this one that we're looking at here? This one here, yeah, the that's gorgeous. The that's the one I've got. This is brilliant. I mean, the weight that you've got, because you've still got those little palettes that we spoke of. Um, but in fact, Julie, I'm going to let you have this one because okay. you can explain to us yep. on that camera that we've got there. So with this one, you get a mixing palette inside it. So again, it's got your click top lid. So you know that once you've shut it down, those paints are secure. So okay. if you're traveling around, taking it out and about with you, you know that you're not going to have any spillages or anything okay. like that. So you'll see your mixing palette is sat in the top of it. Good solid palette that as yep. well. So that's great because obviously that's something that you sometimes have to buy separate to yeah, your set of paints. Point. And then you have got all of your paints here. So if I just bring mine over. Oh, you've got storage for them your brushes side by well. side. You'll see your colour selection there. And like you say, yeah. So I keep my paint brushes and I've got a few cocktail sticks in there because like I say, if, if you find they're going a little bit dry, which is the nature of the beast, just give them a spritz. Give them a stir with a cocktail stick or a matchstick and they'll be off, off you go again, yeah. Love it. 29.99. So this time you've got 24 colours. We've got a couple of different choices with regards to getting hold of these. Whether you want the powder blue finish, which I is one that you just looked they're at. They're so or the minty green. pretty. I mean, if you're somebody that's sort of, I, I like anything in a pretty colour in your craft room. So yeah, maybe you're somebody that's already got sort of things that this is going to match. Yeah. Yeah. Go for the tone that's going to match your craft room. So with regards to these, with this sort of kind of aqua or that minty green, we've got limited stock with regards to the quantities of these. So $29.99. They're both exactly the same with regards to the contents. It's just the outer case. That's what you're choosing with regards to these. So again, it's the gouache that we've seen in all the demonstrations so far. Just 24 of those colours within here as well, which is brilliant. I love that one. Now, um, what should we look at next? We're going to look at the actual prints. Oh, now, Julie obviously created those fabulous scenes that we saw a few moments ago. Um, and these were... Um, it was done using yeah. these. Now, these Delphines, Delphine Brooks, you'll know the name, I'm sure, um, creating these fabulous outlines for you to build your colours on. It's got a beautiful watercolour base, but it's a lovely smooth finish, so nice and easy for you to apply your colour, whether you're using it via the gouache or whether you are using them by other means. But you're going to get your A3 pieces, as you can see, with your gorgeous designs. And that's the one that Julie created on a few moments yes. ago. Well, not a few, she didn't create it on it a few moments ago. We looked at the finish, 
result a few <laughs> moments ago. Um, so, yeah, if you fancy getting hold of these, you've got five designs, two repeats of each of them, and you've got a fabulous base with regards to these. So, ten different ones um, for you to go for. So, if you like the look of those, then the details are up on your screen. But $19.99 is not the price you're going to be paying. Now, drop that price down. So, you're only paying £14.99 if you're wanting to get hold of those. Um, so, if you fancy that, giving you the base that you can create a fabulous project on, then you can do. And it might be that you're creating your seaside scene with your lighthouse, just as Julie did, using one of those bases previously. So there you go. Um, Trim down, so it could actually go into a picture frame to give us a gift to somebody, but a brilliant result, as you can see, and I'm sure you will agree. Also as well, we've got A4 versions of that um, kind of cardstock, that um, 300 GSM. Doesn't have a design on there, so if you're wanting to create your own design, you can do. And if you're wanting your A4, then the details are up on your screen there. You're only looking at £7.50 pence for those so uh, you're going to get 30 sheets set and it's 300 gsm so a really good weight to go for with regards to those as well and if you're wanting to get hold of those the details are on your screen now we've just got another couple of little kind of sets of paints just to, to mention to you as well now these are your watercolors so if you have um, wanting to go down that route particularly then these are really funky palette and the brilliant thing is you've got a little paintbrush on the underneath of these as well i know love so these cute. um brilliant palette as you can see with regards to these i'm just going to open that up with um regards to that so just give it a little kind of twist and look at that oh my goodness that's it's just pure beauty. joy in it <laughs> oh that makes me happy it does too. i mean this is a perfect present for somebody for christmas maybe yeah you know somebody's going to be recuperating or yes, you know they've got some time on their Gorgeous. hands that they weren't expecting that would be Beautiful. a lovely present with a pack of the watercolour cardstock to Absolutely. get them started. Um, you know, for something to fill a bit of time. That's it. Um, Christmas time, sometimes people will start a new hobby. Yeah, yeah that's it. New, new hobby. Ho exactly. Um, and you've got two different colours with regards to these. So you've got that gorgeous blue and then you've got the pink, um, which is more of a peachy tone, really. So it's personal choice on which you're wanting to go for. But the colour palette is exactly the same. Is it the same colour? The same colours in each of them, is it? It is. Yeah, yeah, the only yeah. difference is the col your colour choice of your actual casing on the outside. Mm. Um, and they're both sold out, so the details are on the screen for your blue. So if you want in your blue, then the details are on there. Um, before we change over to the pink, though, we're going to do something about that price. So there you go, nineteen ninety nine. If you're wanting to go for those with all those thirty eight colours in there, beautiful, lovely pack, and they look so pretty as well. Concentrated colours, little goes a long way with regards to those. So there you go, all those gorgeous colours, and exactly the same colours in the pink version. If you choose to go down that route, but it's just a different item number. So very quickly bring those details in you're going to get your paintbrush with either one of those it's a pink one to go with your pink palette and the blue one to go with your blue and uh, details on your screen if you're wanting the pink 19.99 and um, getting that price down exactly the same as we saw before julie's off again she's <laughs> off i was just whilst we were just i was just doing a little bit of a background okay so what, and this is using the gouache again so i've just used the gouache but i can show you we can switch and do some watercolor so i can show you that as well if you're okay. thinking of doing the I watercolor but this is just all I've done is use the same colour top and bottom. So I've put a bit of purple down and a bit of pink and then I've just put some white in the middle. Oh, okay, right. And then I'm literally just, I've just used my, I've picked, put the colour down and then cleaned my brush and I've literally just used water to smooth that out. Lovely. Which will then give you that, and I can show you, they just blend together so smoothly. It's, you know, that they look, they'll give you a really lovely effect. So even though they're a gouache paint, they're actually giving us that, that water, kind of water yeah. colour Yeah, you can use your water to wash that colour away. So if you feel like, uh, you, if you put it down and you think, oh, actually, that's more intense than mm -hmm. I wanted it to be, don't panic. Just clean your brush, pick yourself up some water, just do little, a little bit at a time. Okay. Don't, like, saturate yeah. it. And then just use your brush to blend that colour out and you'll find it will become more muted. Fair enough. Um, so then I was just going to show you just very quickly something else, I, another little technique yes, if you wanted to write something. Yeah. So I've, I'm then going to pick up uh, maybe some of the darker blue. Um, incidentally, I don't know, have I mentioned split pay? I can't remember if I've mentioned split pay actually on the bundle that's on your screen. Um, two split pays on this one as well, £24.99. So very easy way for you to get involved with them. So I'm just going to bring, I'm, all I'm doing is almost like a wiggly line. Okay. 
and I'm just going to do that all the way along. Oh, I'm intrigued. And then I'm going to do the same. I'm just bringing in a sort of, like I say, you haven't got to have a steady hand for this. Just give it a little bit of... It's a lovely blue. Yeah. And you could do this black, you could do whatever colour you want. So mm -hmm. you'll see then. Okay, yeah. That sort of becomes some little hills. Yeah, it's like on the horizon. On the horizon. Yeah. So then if I then pick up some white, I am then going to just pop down some white in the middle. Okay. To look like a moon in the sky. Oh, look at this. And then I'm going to bring in a thinner brush again. And then I'm just going to pick myself up a little bit of water because I don't want it to be too thick. And I've just picked up the tiniest bit on my brush. And then I'm just going to just put some strokes in as if this is water. So that's the, the same blue that you used for the horizontal line? Yeah. Oh, and just, okay. you can add a little bit of water just to sort of mute it down a bit. And then oh, all lovely. I'm going to do then is just pick some white up and I'm going to do here just some lines as if the moon is reflecting in the water. Just to give you that little bit of reflection. I don't know how well the camera will pick that up. I'll it's do picking that. it up perfectly. I'm just still astounded. So I'm looking at this and thinking, yeah, and she's saying she's not an artist. Yeah, and then <laughs> you could then add some birds into the sky if you wanted to into a sunset. You could bring, if you're not confident with... Um, sort of painting, if you've got some foliage stamps, mm -hmm. you could be stamping some little That's reeds nice and things idea. at the front yeah. here. Or you can just leave it as simply as, as that. And then if I just bring in that Diddy one. Oh, look at that. I j it's the same sort of effect. I've just done a different colourway. So oh, she could really experiment. You, you can. Have like a, a tropical dusky yeah. colour with oranges and, but and yellows. There, and, yeah. So that just shows you sort of, we've gone from really sort of thick and vibrant there to washing it out yes. and making it really sort of soft and pastely coloured. So, you know, that just gives you a couple of effects from the one set of paints. But if we bring in the watercolours, I'll show you a couple of things we can I do with it. those. So have you got a set of those or do you need I one? have. I've got the little set, but I'll bring my set in. Um, Liam did say we could open one, but... Did he? Yeah, he did. Now, but... have you seen these? Yes. These are beautiful. Now, this is a brilliant idea as a gift. Now, before we actually have a look at the one that Julie's got, have a look at the ones that we've got in the set, because you've actually got three different colourways with these, and these come beautifully packaged. So if you are thinking of a, a gift for somebody over the Christmas time, then this is brilliant, and they look so classy. It's a really clever way of you taking your colours on the move with you as well. So we've got three different versions. We've got the yellow, we've got the green, and the blue we've got with this one as well. Um, starting off with the yellow, and the yellow details up on your screen so with regards to these ones you've got um, a fabulous gift box set so they look amazing absolutely incredible with that gorgeous almost chrome lid that you've got on this little um, set now you've actually got 18 colors within here as well so a really good range of different colors in here as well you've also got some watercolor card to get you started as well as a brush pen as well and this is a brilliant little kind of portable um, system because it's got all your watercolors in there but literally it will go into your pocket when it fits all within that case and you can actually use the packaging as a little water pot as well which i think is a brilliant idea so so £34.99, pence. each one of those sets is exactly the same price, but, oh, it's the same price, but not that price. Okay, fair enough. So the price is going to drop down. I never know. Sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't. I don't like to presume. But on this occasion, I should have presumed because look at that price, £24.99. Classy gift for somebody, and it just looks absolutely amazing. Um, £24.99, that's the yellow version. We've got the green, we've got the blue as well. Um, in fact, we'll bring the details up on the screen kind of in turn, but I'm going to let Julie carry on with her yeah. demo because the time is ticking away. It is. So what you're so, up to now? I'll show you another quick and easy technique that I've picked up from, you know, I'm always looking at stuff online. I see different ideas. So this is, if you're somebody that doesn't draw, this is a quick and easy way to show how you can create some flowers really easily. Okay. So all I've done, they're not perfect circles. I don't know why that picked up, but I've just drawn three different size sort of overly circles. Okay. And then inside, I'm just going to do a circle there. Okay. A circle here and a circle here. Okay. And then from there, I'm going to use that outline 
to just do a loopy motion. Oh, okay. So the petals are going to the outer yeah, circle. Yeah. So use that and go. If you stick, if if you stick to one point, so your petals go smaller to larger and then back yeah. to smaller again. And then this time, I'm going to start my petals there, but I'm coming around so they're going larger in turn. Wonderful. Each time. Now I'm going to do this quite quickly. That's fine. As you're doing that, I'm just going to reference the palette, which you can see just off to the side of Julie's kind of work area. So with this um, a fabulous set, this is included whether you're going for the yellow, the green or the blue, because that relates to the actual case, the actual carry case that you're going to get with these. All the colours. Is it 18 colours, did you say, in this particular set? Uh, yeah, 18. Six. And you've got really good size, full pans within these. Yep. So there's a lot of colour within them. It. So all I'm going to do now, I've got my rough, if you can see those sort of daisy shapes. Yes. But I'm just going to gently, I don't want to rub the whole um, pencil line out, but I just want to rub it out enough that it's not going to show so much when I put my watercolour down. Okay. So you can see, I can still see roughly where my middle and my petals got are on these, there. Yeah. Yep. So again, with this palette, you can mix any of these. You've got, if, if I show you, if you open it, you've got oh, two, it opens top and bottom. So you've got a mixing palette either side. So. And it comes with a little koi water brush. It does. And it also comes with a little pack of, um, a, a little pack of watercolor card. Oh, Lost mug. Okay, with this sort of size? Yeah. Oh, cute. Um, just so you can start. I mean, I, I was saying earlier, um, I brought this originally when it was on, on the first show to take on holiday because oh, I'd never really watercolored before and this is the set that you bought that yeah you bought? Oh, okay. when we had the first when we had the first um Himmy show yes I brought them then because I was going on holiday a couple of weeks after and I wanted something compact yeah it wasn't going to take up a lot of room just so I could sit on the beach and have a go yeah, have a go exactly. I just wanted to paint the landscape that I could see um so that's what I did, and I used the bottom of the case, went down to the sea and got some sea water and used that to <laughs> I love that. I love wash my pants out. So have you got your case, honey? I have. Here's yeah. my case here. Can I show you this? Because this is beautiful. With it. When it actually comes to you, you've got this fabulous little storage um, case. It does look a bit like a hip flask, actually, doesn't it? But it kind of two parts. So when you actually open it up, you're going to have your little folder in there with your watercolour um, papers in there. And this is the part that Julie went and fulfilled up with a little bit of seawater. So straight away, you've got a pot. But you've got your lid on there as well. And that just gives it such a beautifully classy look, as you can see. You've got a little carry handle there as well. And that will house not only the water, um, obviously the pot that you've got, but also you've got your palette that's going to sit in there because it all fits in beautifully. And you've also got your water brush pen so brilliant as a gift for, for somebody um three different colorways that you've got you've got your blue you've got your yellow um and you've also got the um the green have we got the pink we haven't have we got the pink as well as well because this was the pink that we had previously so yeah just, so just kind of ignore the color that it's pink because i don't think we've got the pink available but we have got the blue um and we have got the gorgeous green as well there you go Jolo. that's all right thank you very much so you'll see i'm just mixing myself a quite a light bluey colour um, nice. just to pop one. yeah mm. just so I can pop some down onto the petals of my daisies so I'm just going to bring in a smaller brush and then you can just water this down but this palette is perfect for you know like I say crafting on the go if you're somebody that wants to take it what out what do you think about the quality of the paints themselves they're incredible what do you like about them I just they're really easy to use okay. you know there's no complicated you know you don't have to worry if you've never picked up a paintbrush or a paint palette before um but the quality of them gives you a really good finish so i think if you're just sort of dabbling like i do i think the paints are what help you have the effect not they make you feel like an artist well, yeah it's a good feeling to have it is um and also as well i think that they don't appear to be wishy-washy because i've they're not watercolor paints in the past and this is where i go back to if you want to give something a go buy quality because otherwise yeah. you'll find yourself buying two or three times because you've not got the quality and exactly. we've all seen high street little palettes that you can pick up yeah think, two or oh, three pounds yeah i don't know what i'm doing i'm just going to buy one of those but they are just so wishy-washy they the are colors. 
you couldn't get these kind of results and because you can't get this kind of results you think it's something you were doing yeah that's right you can often be put off yeah experimenting a bit more with it because of the quality of the product that you're the using product, not you. yeah so you'll just see i'm just literally mixed a tiny bit of of paint there and brought that in just to do those petals so then all you need to do then is just pick up some of your darker color and i'm just going to mix it in again just to make that shade of blue slightly darker again and then i'm just then going to bring in my paintbrush and i'm just going to put almost like a little v on each petal okay, just yeah. to bring in some extra detail and I love these watercolours because, like you just said, they've got such a, um, you feel like that, you look at it and it looks like water, you put it down and you, you're just like, oh, yes, yeah, there's colour there. I <laughs> thought it was going to be sort of like a, a muddy, a muddy colour and it's yeah. not. Um, and nice then thing. all you need to do it then if you want to is just bring your paintbrush around the outside just to give your petals a little bit of definition. I would do that on all of them, but I'm cautious of time. And then if we just then bring our thicker brush back in. Do you know what else I love about these brushes? They've got a really nice long handle and on them. Have, so you've um, got plenty of room for doing your strokes and, and brushes, things. I've got a couple of different sets of the brushes. If you like the look of the pink ones, you've got a set of five, and I think they came down to 9 99 We've also got a set of the blue colours, um, which is like an aqua colour, and they're 5 99 There's a set of three there as well. Um, so you'll find them all on the website, but um, you'll see them pop up on your screen. There you go. Look there you at go. that. And then... That, is, that is one that I've finished completely. So you can bring in some darker colours. You can do, like I say, I would do more definition around your petals. If you want to, you could use your dotting technique and bring a darker um, yellow in to give a bit of definition. That's amazing. I love it. Centre. And a fabulous but technique. It's just a, quick and easy. It's just two circles and then just bring your loop in to make your petals. That is, so, thank you for that because that's, I think that is going to be something a lot of people want to You know, go. who wouldn't want to give somebody a hand, you've hand painted a card that you're then going to give to somebody. You're only missing one thing and that's a signature. Exactly. <laughs> Which you should always do because you're the artist. Yes. Yeah. Except Julie says she's not. No, I'm not. not. Definitely not. <laughs> now, don't forget, you've got the palette that Julie's been working with, but you've also got that fabulous palette. We've got 38 colours. Got a couple of different options with these. Um, and this is kind of um, a nice kind of continuation of the gouache because the packaging that you see from him, he tends to be in a variety of different colourways. So if you like the blue tone and you want to go down the watercolour route, then don't forget you can get the gouache at the same time or later on if you want him to. 38 colours in this beautiful palette and it's got a fabulous look to it. You've got that lovely window there and that kind of um, fabulous kind of range of colours, different colours there. have got a little mixing well in the middle there and when you flip it over you've also got fabulous little storage there for your paintbrush as well. A couple of different colours so you've got the uh, fabulous blue um, details on your screen. There is another item number for your pink which you'll find on the website and you will find all of the details for everything else that we've been chatting about as well. In fact we'll pop the pink up on the screen just in case you're wanting to go for those and can I suggest if you are going for the pink especially which is that one do treat yourself to those paint brushes yeah, they match because these put those together and yeah. instantly uh -huh. you look like you know what you do look at that as a trio together yeah. doesn't that look good it does yeah it, everything Beautiful. just matches so lovely um, and the brushes are worth every penny because they really are lovely quite I can't I've used mine so much and they're as soft as when you get them out of the packet. It it's like having a comfy pair of slippers. It is. Isn't it? Having it a is. Good and brush. again, if you've got good quality tools, you're gonna get good quality results Absolutely. every time. Couldn't put it better. Julie, yeah. thank you. That's all right, thank you. She's absolutely amazing. <laughs> Inspirational as always. Hopefully I've encouraged people to pick up a paintbrush. If I can have. do it, you can do it. <laughs> I love it. Um, so many of you taking advantage of the deals that we're bringing for you. So obviously the gouache we've got, the watercolour we've got, and we've of course got those fabulous scenes if you fancy having a go with those as well. One thing I will say though, if it's in your basket, it's not yours until you've checked that basket out. So not, um, why not take advantage of the next few moments as we get ready for the next show for you to check out your baskets. And Julie, Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you for having me. I'll see you in a little while. When you purchase anything on Hobby Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee, meaning that you can shop with confidence. Happy shopping with Hobby Maker.
Are you having trouble finding the perfect gift? Then why not treat them to the new gift card from a hobbymaker at hobbymaker.co.uk. Simply scroll down to the bottom where it says gift cards, click and you'll be taken to the right place. Decide between posting the card or delivery by email and then decide how much you want to add. You choose the value. So what do you get the crafter that's got everything? Why not treat yourself or them to the Hobbymaker gift card? Hobbymaker are proud to work alongside some of the biggest brands in the industry. Keep watching for these brands and many more here on Hobbymaker. They call me Mr. Fantastic. Here at Hobbymaker, we want your shopping experience to be as simple as possible. That's why you can buy as many items as you like all day and only pay one postage and packaging fee. It doesn't matter what weight, size or quantity of your order or how many times you check out that day, you still will only be charged one p and Shopping made simple with Hobbymaker. Hello there and welcome back. Welcome back to what well, I feel like it should be going glow force or something like that. Yeah, I think it should. Should we both do it together? Oh, yeah. Ready, welcome to glow force. Oh, sorry, I missed that. <laughs> Never Terrible. mind. It doesn't matter. This is Guy. And Guy, you, um, what well, glow force is, is your company? Yes, it is, yeah. Um, and everything that we see here has kind of come from your, your mindset and your idea yes. and things that you wanted to bring us. Yes. It's been an ongoing project over the last seven years. Yeah, it's, my, it's all about my eye light range. It is my baby. <laughs> it takes a lot of my time, I can tell you that. Oh, bless you. But yes, um, it's, I've designed it uh, like lots of different lighting systems okay. around this eye light, which is this light ball here. Right. Uh, and it's a battery rechargeable work light. Okay. And it's a daylight light. Um, but I've designed the whole system. And originally, the whole concept came from making sure you can always get light exactly where you need it, um, which is quite an important thing for a lot of people. Yes, uh, yeah, Some people very have very bright lights. Yes. Uh, but they create shadow or they can't quite get them in the right place uh, to be hands-free. So sometimes the people are holding a torch or somebody's holding a torch for them yes, or, yeah. or it's just not quite convenient. So I've designed these systems to be modular. Perfect. So one I system love a modular do, system because it can kind of grow and grow. It can grow and grow and it can do lots of different things. Perfect. Um, but uh, yeah, so the, the, the star of the show, I'll take you through the different parts that yes. enable users to actually get light where they need it. But the actual star of the show is what's called the eye light. Okay, that's and the I eye light range because it kind of looks you can like probably an eye tell when you look at why it. that's called yeah. the eye light. Um, I get lots of uh, uh, yeah, it's called lots of things like War of the Worlds or <laughs> Dalek and all sorts so of things. So what we've got going on the back here. So before we talk about the light to start with, on the back here we've kind of got magnets and we've got screw fixing. So is that all part of the modular system? Yeah. So the actual light head is magnetic. Oh There's right. nothing metal right here to put it on. Not but to it, worry. It's very it's magnetic. Okay. So you can actually just plop the actual light directly onto things, but it's mainly designed to screw onto the end of these goosenecks. Okay. Different variations. But the actual light is USB charged. Oh, okay. okay. So we don't need batteries. No, so there's a, so you don't have to change the batteries or anything. It's got the battery incorporated into the unit and you just plug it in on the USB to charge it. So there's no cables when you're actually using it. Um, which is nice because it's you're completely not restricted. Then, yeah, you're not are restricted. You? Yeah. you can take it from here to there. There's yeah. no cables lying everywhere. And it's when you turn it on, it, full power is incredibly bright. Wow! So it's a very it's a thousand lumens if that means anything to anyone. But it's a people uh, often talk about that, and I think yeah, okay, but it's wow. That's what I want to see because I don't know how many lumens would kind of give that kind of it's, result. It's, it's very it's bright. That's a thousand like. lumens. Wow. Okay. Um, but you can actually dim it down. So when you turn it on, if you press it twice, okay. it goes to its half power setting and that runs oh, for over seven hours on that setting. Right. Um, or three and a half hours at the full power setting. Okay. Okay. Um, and it tells you on the back here how oh. much power it's got. Um, so you know when you're going to run out. Oh. 
what? Also, when you're charging it. Oh, can you keep that still for us? And we'll have a proper little look. Sorry. We're ever so nosy here. Look at go. that. That's quite bright in its own right, so isn't it? The magnets are there. The charging port is just there. Perfect. And the little dial to tell you how much power is on the back there. Does it come with a cable to charge it? it does, or do yes, I, oh, I don't have yes, to go so and find one. Thank goodness for so that. So you just plug it into a USB outlet. Um, and it should take three hours to charge. Well, that's not long, um, So most USB outlets are around two amp, and if you plug it into one of those, it's just three hours. If you did plug it into like a cheaper USB outlet or a laptop or something like that, it can take up to six hours. If you've got one of those USB ports in your car, because I'm thinking if you break down or something like that, and you, could you actually charge it up within the car? Yes, you can, yes, yeah. 99% of USB outlets it will work with. Perfect, love it, yeah. okay. So that's the actual light head. Uh, and again, it's daylight, so it gives a really nice crisp amount of light, so it actually brings up colours mm -hmm. uh, just as you want them to as well. So, but what makes the actual range really unique are the attachments I've made for them. Okay. Now, this was one of my originals uh, when I first started the iLight range, and it was called the iLight Plus, and it's a, um, it basically comes with a 27 centimetre gooseneck. Okay. And this gooseneck positions the light in any angle you want it to which is very handy. Now, is it going to do what I've come across before, where you set it at one angle and then it slowly starts dipping no. down and moving? So, uh, I actually originally designed the, this kit. I mean, the, the, now, I, I design lights for lots of different uses now. Okay. But the original design was for electricians, plumbers and mechanics. Right. Uh, and that I needed to make sure the goosenecks worked exactly as people wanted it to. Uh, it, it needs not droop down or spring yeah, back or anything like that. So, <laughs> and it's a real good feature of the range is the fact that they do literally position and hold any way you want them, that all the goosenecks that I do. Now this actually attaches, um, so this is actually, this first bundle I'm gonna go through is called the starter bundle, and the Flex that's X. that's the one that we've got up on the screen at, um, actually. So yeah, if you're wanting to get involved with this one, then obviously you can do. We will reveal the price in a moment. It has many different parts. So it starts, you can use it just as a standalone light on its little base here, okay. as you would with lots of different lights, the, the benefit of being able to position it exactly where you want it. Mm -hmm. But it actually fits to its base on this very strong little rubberized magnet. Okay. So you can also use it by attaching it directly to something metal to position okay. it where you want it. Um, but you can also take that magnet off. Oh, okay. And it comes with this little clamp. Oh, right. So then you can actually clamp it to the side of tables, shelves, bars, poles, or sewing machine handles, as I've just got set up there. You see that? Okay, um, that's very handy. But lots of it, anything uh, under five and a half centimetres, and it's it's very good at clamping onto misshaped items. Now I know that some of our viewers, uh, being crafters out there, um, you'll be looking at this, and obviously we've been talking about kind of industry plumbers and electricians and things like that. But straight away, you show me that clamp there. I do little YouTube view, um, tutorials and things yes. like that, and it's always tricky to get the right light in. Yeah. Something like that. I've got bars that kind of go across the, the, the roof. I could actually clip that on and actually have that putting the light down on the work area. Exactly. There's usually always somewhere you'll be able to clamp that to. Uh, yeah. And then again, you can position it exactly where you want it and rely on it to hold it. That's why I asked about well. that kind of droopiness. Yeah. That's, yeah, I've been yeah. there, done that. <laughs> um, so, but also, if that's not long enough for you, the actual kit comes with this extension gooseneck. Oh, so it's all okay. modular, so it all nicely just screws in together. So we're still so, talking about the same bundle. Yeah, the same bundle, it all comes together. So it comes with this 225 mil extension gooseneck. Right. Which then also holds it. Uh, so then... There's a lot of weight at that end. Yeah, so, so it's, it's still not it does, true. Yeah, so oh, there's right. a lot of work gone in to make sure these actually work together and actually hold it just in any position where you want it Isn't to. Isn't that brilliant? Um, but that obviously can run, well, attached to the clamp. Go back that one, yeah. So you've got that full reach there from the clamp, as you saw on the sewing machine just there, actually. But that will also then clamp onto shelves again. Oh, anything or that you can kind of get that grip yeah, around. Anything, really. But they usually can always find something that you can clamp that to, and then you can position it even more convenient on a longer gooseneck just where you need it. Perfect. But again, obviously, you can take that back, that clamp back off. And there's no screwdrivers or Allen keys or anything like that. Um, and then you put this magnet on. You can then obviously use it directly on the magnet if okay. there's anything metal. Yeah. So, and you can also put it back on its base. And a very popular feature is you can also put it over your shoulders and you've got all of that light just over your shoulders there. Oh, uh, so if you work it, oh, that is brilliant. 
Uh, so a lot of people do this when they're doing certain crafts and they're just doing something. They don't well, have to have the big light on. Yeah, the big light. Oh, yeah, the big light. <laughs> it's always the big light, isn't it? If you're working under the engine of a car or under the bonnet of a car, should yeah, I say, many or different like things. That. I mean, some people just drop over their shoulders when they're out walking the dog or uh, yeah. many different things. Or they're just out carrying something from the car and they need a lot of light. Or they might be going up into the loft carrying something and then they get up in the loft, they can hang it around things. It's There's that many is, different yes. uses um, um, from this light, people use it when they're camping. Or... This is going to be one of those tools that you have in your house where everybody knows where it is, so everybody can go and get it and yeah. use it for whatever occasion they need. Um, and this is a brilliant bundle. We're talking about a starter set. So what do we get within the right. starter set before okay. we reveal that so price? There's, there's one other thing as uh -huh. well. Okay, so you get the metal base. Okay. You get the uh, small rubberized magnet. Right. You get the two goosenecks. Okay. And you get this, what I call the dyno clamp. Okay. okay. And again, it's all modular, so you can one minute you make it into one thing and one next minute you make it into another. But you also get this handy little phone holder. Oh, right. This okay. is like a little uh, add-on bonus. Now this, because it all screws on the same thread. Now this just screws onto the back here. Okay. And you can turn it into, so as every, everything I was describing about how you can position the light where you need it, you can turn it into a very handy phone holder, either from the stand or from the magnet. So now when I'm doing or, the filming that I was talking about, I, I was have my phone going to there, mention that. Oh, that yeah. wow. So and then it means that when you're filming or you're taking a picture or a video uh, or you're just wanting to watch something hands free. Some people might be watching oh, yeah. a, a YouTube video and they need to be hands free. Yeah. Uh, so there's many, many different uses. And it's there's an added bonus of that uh, kit that means you can just adapt it and change it into yeah, that brilliant. as well. It's a brilliant idea, and it's knowing that it's the, the confidence that it's going to do what you need it to do, and not kind of do that kind of drooping. And, and if you've ever tried to film anything on your phone, it's getting your phone in the right position that is the key thing for you to get those results. So you're going to get all of that within that bundle, comprehensive bundle. Obviously, the key thing being the light. That is the main thing. It's going to give you that daylight. It's going to give you that rechargeable element that you can literally take anywhere you like. Literally, light in the palm of your hand if you want it to be. Um, but the details are on your screen now. I think we've had a message come through already from Karen. Uh, and this is Karen, who's um, in Nottinghamshire. So, um, hi, I'm sure my husband will be delighted to buy this for me as I'm clumsy in the dark and I've broke many a, mo um, many a bone. I can't guarantee that you won't break a bone again. But this light is perfect, isn't it? It's such a clever it's, idea. Thank you. It's, it's very popular, um, but it's, what's interesting is a lot of people buy this light when they think, uh, I'm going to use it for this. I might be thinking yes. of a certain craft or a certain use or in the garage or whatever. Um, but when you've got one, it's amazing how many times that would be those times where you think, I really need a light. For, oh, that would be handy for this, or I yeah. can use it for this example. Any, any many, time. many different um, You'll, you'll uses. forget about a torch that you might have where the batteries kind of, you, you, it's always, have I got the right batteries? And it's like, uh, you have to take the batteries out and put them back in again because the light won't light yeah. up and, and things like that, or it dims halfway through. With this, straight away, it can be charging up and you're just using it when you need it. Right, let's address that price. Let's give you the price on this one. So this is your starter bundle. So everything that guys told you um, included within this bundle, including that phone holder as well, £78.99. And, and this is brilliant because lots of these, you would go off and buy the individual components with these, wouldn't you? Yes. But it's all yeah. in that bundle. Yeah. Yes. Um, Three-way split on this one as well. So this is brilliant for a crafter. Um, we're going to be talking about additional bits and pieces you can use alongside it as well. It's a modular system. It's going to grow with you. This could potentially be the starting point of something that's going to be incredible, not only helping you light up the area that you're working with, but also magnifying the area because we're going to be looking at magnifying pieces that work alongside well. it as well. <laughs> um, so the details on your screen, £78.99. Three split pays on this one, just £26.30. 33p for you to get involved with this one and then you are starting on that journey that glow force journey um, <laughs> that you're going to be able to um, add to as time goes on as well it's gonna, they're all going to be doing it that's going to be a start or something <laughs> there you go um, so if you fancy getting hold of your starter kit you can do but it's not the only bundle that we've got for you so we're going to move on to the next one because the next one this is called the glow force pro set is that right have i got that right the pro x, x. pro x oh, that was, x is back again what's known as the mega bundle but it's the, the mega Pro X. bundle okay right so what's the mega bundle all about so it's the same light head okay so that same same thousand lumen battery rechargeable work light okay but it comes with a much bigger base right a bigger magnet okay can we just look at the previous ones just to compare the size of those right, two? okay so the stands okay here's the old stands so right. the old stand the other stands right okay 
the other magnet. So it's almost to get into size, sort of really, isn't it? Yeah. details, this, this magnet's got a 20 kilogram pull on that. Okay. That's got a 40 gram pull. Right. The two goosenecks that come with the starter bundle, I just put them. You've got a 270 mil gooseneck. Okay. And you've got a 225 mil gooseneck. Okay. okay. Um, but with the Mega Bundle, the Pro X, you've got the larger magnet, the bigger base. Yeah. But you have a much longer, stronger 450 mil. Right. And it's a lot stronger as well. Okay. Gooseneck, and I'll tell you the reasons behind that in a minute. Um, and you oh, get. You just the jumped light. up then. <laughs> um, so you can use this. Uh, again, just as a normal standalone light on right. the table, on the floor, wherever. But you've got a much further reach from that. Okay. Um, but what I do with this one, I also do this large table clamp. Oh, wow. Okay, okay. right. It's a very sturdy clamp. We've already got one set up here. Yeah. Um, again, the gooseneck literally just unscrews from that magnet. Again, and just screws into the bottom or the back of the clamp. Oh, okay, so right. So you can actually clamp something onto an edge of something that way and then have it coming out that side. Or you can... That side, or lots of different angles you can yeah. get from yeah. the gooseneck. And this means you can always, sorry, you also get in that bundle this extension gooseneck. Oh, I see. Right. So on the top here, so that's the piece which that you've got is there is up to there. The, another two, 225 mil. And this means you've got a really far reach and a reliable hold of light exactly where you need it. And it's got a really far reach there um, and a very sturdy table clamp. Now, the, the difference between those two clamps, the other clamp from the, uh, the, 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 the uh, Flexi starter bundle, that is great for just connecting to odd shaped, misshaped items, yes. but also good for uh, tables, anything up to five and a half mm -hmm. centimetres. But this big table clamp will go up to anything to six and a half centimetres. And yes, yeah, so it's really sturdy and it means, you, again, anywhere on a workbench or table. And this um, is a good size expanse that we've got there that that's reaching over to. This is an opportunity for me to use my trusty um, tape measure. I'm always looking for the opportunity to use my little tape measure that keeping me a little bag because when you actually, and this is quite important, the area that you've got from the edge, quite often you're working right in a restricted area because you can't illuminate the whole area that you've got. But with this, you've got kind of like a, a 19 inch reach there to the tip of the tape measure there. If you're wanting that in centimetres, you're looking at, well, it's nearly, well, it's half a metre, actually. That area is half a metre, and we haven't gone beyond that because, of course, the illumination that you've got is giving you a much larger area. So half a metre stretch from the edge of your um, area to the centre where that light's coming out, I think that's amazing, that, that reach that you've yeah, got there. No cables, no cables to worry about, and it will just literally just position exactly where you need it. And that is exactly the same light as well from the other bundle. Um, but it just means you've got, yes, really, I really it. good. I love it. Brilliant. And, of course, if you wanted to actually have it going from um, a taller, um, if you've got kind of, sort of a gantry type thing in your, your garage or your workspace, then obviously you Again, can clamp onto that and come directly down. So anywhere you can clamp that. Is, if the thing is with this clamp, it does need to be a straight edge. Okay. Sorry, a, a, um, a flat edge. Yeah. It won't really clamp onto any misshaped objects. So it's great for tables. Um, but, it, yeah, anything up to five, uh, six and a half centimetres deep on that clamp. Perfect. Uh, and obviously, you can also use it at that same length from the magnet Got you. or from its base as well. I like the magnet as well, yeah. So you can just put the extension on here. Do the right way. Yeah, it's and very they easy. All they all just together so easily. screw in together. Um, and you've Isn't got that. that there. But the, obviously, it's just different preferences. Again, it's one product that's modular that does many different things. So sometimes somebody would just want to be able to carry this from here to there yes, and easily yeah. just have it. OK, I've got my light there. It's just like that. And I can take it over here or I can put it over my shoulders. And then when you don't want to be taking up that space on the tabletop, you take it off, put it on the clamp and you can reach it out. I love there. It. So there you go. So this is the next bundle that we've got for you. So again, with the mega bundle, you are going to get the phone carrier You also get well. the phone holder with that okay. as well. So you can turn that into a handy phone holder. Perfect. There you go. So um, similar sort of idea, just on a larger scale with regards to kind of the, the reach that you've got, the base that you've got with this one and the magnet as well. So um, at price time, if you're looking at this one and you're wanting to get hold of it, again, the price is going to be on your screen any few moments. You're looking at £108.99p. 
You've also got the ability to spread the cost of this one as well, making it a very easy way for you to get hold of it with your two-way split. So your first payment today of £54 will go out of your account, and then in a month's time, you'll pay the second payment, which actually will take you through to um, prior to Christmas, doesn't it? So if you're thinking as a Christmas gift for somebody, and this is a modular system that you could grow on time and time again, and we will talk about some of the additional attachments that you can get to work alongside this as well. I think it's just a brilliant idea as well. So um, there you go. Those are your two bases, your two starting points, really. So it's kind of choosing one or the other, I yes. guess. Yeah, it's just out of preference. With. Yeah. yeah. Um, <clears throat> yes, it's just yeah, out of preference, really. Whichever you want to go to if you start with. But, oh, my goodness. And the lights have come back on. Um, but this, as you say, modular system, there's pieces that you're going to be able to use alongside it. And these are where we've got the additional bits and pieces. So where are we going next? We're going magnifying next. Right, right okay. okay. So uh, this is a new thing. So I, again, I originally designed these old systems, all of the clamps and magnets and everything, all about making sure you can get this light exactly where you need it. Okay. Then I started doing the phone holder and a tablet holder, which we'll go through in a, in a, in a short while. Um, but then I had a lot of people, because a lot of people like the way my goosenecks work and the way they are reliable, and also the clamps, the magnets, is always just reliable for holding the light where people need it. Yes. Um, a lot of people were asking me to launch a magnifying range to go with it. Okay. Uh, so I was working on it for quite a while, and it was about... I think it was about eight weeks ago I launched it. Oh, and it's wow. been incredibly well Still received. Warm. <laughs> and uh, and uh, so I'll, t I'll take you through that quickly. So when you have... The let's go back to the Flexi X. So this is the first the starter X, the kit, starter yeah. bundle. Okay. Um, I had a magnifying kit to it. Right. Uh, what that comes with. Let's just get the light back here. We need that. Wonderful. Um, and don't forget, if you are going for um, any of the bundles today, you can continually add the extra bits and pieces in. So if you've already checked your basket out, don't worry. You can go for the magnifier um, now if you want to. As well. So what this does. So originally, obviously, you had the light. And they're off the, the magnets or the clamp. Where's the clamp going? There's the clamp go there. Uh, but now you can, with the actual the uh, the magnifying uh, okay, the first so this starter is the, kit, the, the, the magnifier. One, yeah. It comes with this little adapter. Okay. And an extra gooseneck. So right. this means it's kind of like two little screws. Okay. Yeah. So right. it just because originally there's just one uh, quarter inch UNC thread there. Okay. Now it just turns it into two. Now you can put two goosenecks on there now. And of course, with this set, you would have two goosenecks because uh, you've so got the long one well and the small already, one. You already had two. Now, this, the, the actual kit comes with that little adapter. Oh, it comes with one more gooseneck and it comes with this two and a half times magnifier. Right, OK. What this enables you to do is you can still use the lights. I mean, you could just use the magnifier just on its own, off the magnet uh, or the clamp yeah. at different lengths or on its base. But what makes this a really interesting kit is you can still... Put the light on one gooseneck, position it where you need it from there, and then you can independently, I just screw the magnifier just on there, again, all modular. So right, that means you can get a lot of light just up close where you actually really oh, need it. Right. Um, but you can then independently choose the exact amount of magnification for your eyes. Now, See, this is brilliant because usually the light is kind of coming through the magnifying glass. So if you need to reposition the magnifying glass, then you, you can kind of lose the lighting that comes with it. I'm trying but to get on the camera there. I'm not uh, used to that. So, yeah, that's on the screen. There's an example of um, the no light and no magnification. And then one image has just got light and the other image has just got, oh, has got the light and the magnification. Now, it makes a huge difference to be able to get a lot of light right up close. As okay. uh, lot, That's why my uh, kit's usually very popular about getting that light just where you need it. But when you can independently actually choose the amount of magnification as well, yes, it, it yeah. adds in a real bonus. So a lot of magnifying lights out there, in fact, all of them that I know of, um, the the light is built into the magnifier so when you want more light you actually you, you hold it closer but you lose the magnification yeah. uh, and then when you pull it back you get yes. uh, you, you get more magnification but you lose the light but this you can actually keep each is independent uh, of the other really yeah. focused amount of light there and then it works as one kit but then you can then independently choose. And I love it because you can see you've got that finer um, little kind of higher magnification over the far side and there you go you can see that effect that's going to ha um, have and that's brilliant because your hands are still free you can exactly. work on whatever you need to work on at whatever height you need it to be yeah. and again because it's modular and it comes with many different bits and takes many different forms you can also change this into different things so you can also clamp one gooseneck to something like a shelf okay yeah 
And then you can get that little adapter would then come off the magnet and you can fit it onto there and then you can split it off to actually get it so into the So at the further. moment, it's obviously attached to the base because of the magnet, but you could take that magnet off and attach it to something else or take the magnet off altogether um, and then attach it to so you well, then, what you've got here. Yeah. All right, so you can then unscrew that from there and that will literally just screw onto there and then you can split, uh, again, hands-free, either from the clamp or from the magnet or from its base. And I love this because this is one of these systems. Again, I, I keep going back to kind of the craft filming in the cabin. And I've got all these different components. And I'm like, oh, does that fit on there? Because if I screw that on there and I kind of put that bit on there, then it might be long enough or it might be sturdy enough. But nothing kind of goes together. It's kind of a real kind of mishmash of different elements. But with this, wherever you get involved, you have got that starting point. But then you add on the additional bits. If you want to go for them today, you can do. Um, obviously, you can order all the different pieces that you're wanting to but equally so if you don't want to stretch to everything all in one go you know that you can buy that one part to start with and then you can come back to us here at hobby maker and buy those additional bits and pieces as you need just yeah. keep a note of the item number as you want them but yeah. you find them on the website anyway but that is brilliant um yes the, it's, it's again all modular so you can somebody can start with one kit and then you can just keep and upgrade it and i haven't stopped on this uh, I bet here. i've stopped lots of ideas and lots of other new additions i will be bringing out i point. love it now that blown away with the demonstration i haven't even told you how much it is which is a bit of a, an issue isn't it so we better look at that so details are on your screen the item number is there so if you want to get involved you can do but of course that price when it comes down everybody's paying that lowest price and that is the key thing with this one um so whether you've got involved right at the offset and you've only just checked out your basket or you checked out your basket previously because the way that the system works here at Hobby Maker at midnight, all those orders go through, and everybody that's ordered that fabulous um, additional kit, the magnifying kit, um, for just £34.99 if you're going for that. So you might have already invested in the system previously. The, so, yeah, if somebody's already before, got one of those kits, yeah. yeah, if somebody's got, already got one of those kits, they can buy that magnify kit and it will add to that, uh, that Flexi X bundle. Yeah, perfect. And there's one other use. Okay. I mean, in That's fact, there's good. many, many different forms that can actually take. Uh, it would actually take a while to go through them because you just keep on adding it and putting a, you know, the clamp on one side and then the phone holder and so on. But if you, because you've got three small goosenecks there, okay. you can if, actually. If you've gone for the original. So, yeah, oh, so okay, right. if you've got the Flexi X with that magnify, Kit. Now it's always again, I was saying earlier, it's very, very popular just being able to put the light over your yes, shoulders. Yeah. But you can actually fit all three of those goosenecks that come in that bundle when you have those two bundles together. Uh, you fit them together and the magnifying lens can go on one side and the light can go on the other. And if you're doing intricate work in, in, right in front of your, if you're just sitting in an yes, armchair, yeah. it means you've got a lot of light over your shoulders and you can actually again choose the that magnification just there. That's very popular for many different uh, uses. But that is for when, any, when somebody's doing something right in front of them. Yeah. Not You wouldn't do this when you're leaning over a table, you just yeah. use it on its stand. And it's nice because it's adjustable to whatever you need it to be. Um, I've seen magnifying um, kind of uh, glasses, for the want of a better phrase, that you kind of have to balance on your, your chest area, the batteries um, illuminate it, and you never quite get the right um, kind of formulation, really, to get the light where you need it. You got a leaflet earlier on that you were showing us in the, yes. the prep, because this is the thing, you've got so many different combinations and different ways that this is going to grow, that we get this leaflet included yeah, in the Yeah, you get the brochure and it actually tells you what kit you, well, it, you, you'll have, you'll be able to find your kit Can in I here. Just borrow that just to show and it, everybody? And it tells you what's in your kit. Okay. So in the actual front page of the brochure, that you'll get uh, let me just find so just there actually it's got all the parts that I do okay uh, and then when you actually have for example the flexi kit let will be fine if you have the flexi uh, X for example here, okay that's got all the parts there and different ways you can use it uh, it's giving you the different combinations yeah and this is the flexi pro and all the different combinations what parts you have and then when you add the magnifying kit to the flexi X this it tells you all the different combinations you can do there as well so this is the thing, sometimes you might not have even thought about the different combinations, but there you've got the um, kind of tuition there to show you. Right. It's a work in progress, this brochure. I, th I think um, by the time you finish, there'll be several volumes. Yeah, yeah there, is a, there is. This is already actually <laughs> second volume, even in eight weeks. Um, uh, but actually in each image where it actually says uh, a different example of the, uh, the uh, how the light and the magnifier is being used, it actually tells you which parts are being used in, the, I love in, it. The, in that image. Isn't that brilliant? You're going to get that along with your order. So this is a, an investment, um, not only obviously in, in getting the light to where you need it to go, but it's one of those systems that is going to grow and grow and grow with you. And as you've heard, 
occurred just in its infancy um, with regards to the, the kind of variation of the additional bits and pieces that are coming into play. So when Guy has got all these ideas, I can see you've got these Too ideas many, yeah. going to... Too many <laughs> ideas first from what they do. They really do. I love it. Yeah. So there you go. So that is that magnifying kit um, if you're wanting to go for that. I know it has been popular. So whether you've been shopping for the starter kit today as well or whether you've already got that and you're adding to your system, then I know many of you have been doing that. But we have got other elements as well because that is the first magnifying that we've got. But we've got a larger one. Should we look at the next one? Yeah, Should so this can this be one? added as a, an extra. Okay. Bonus. Uh, it's just so that the original, this magnifier that comes in the kit is a two and a half times, but it also has a small round uh, blob just in the middle there that has, sorry, in the, to the side there that actually has. So it's kind uh, of increased. Four times. It. Oh, it's just okay. uh, you really need an intense amount of magnification from that. But this block here is great for you when you want to uh, just magnify one big area. Okay. Um, and it's, yeah, it's fantastic for just uh, uh, for reading things. If you just want to place it there and use the gooseneck just to hold it. Um, it's nice if you've got some instructions that you're following, because rather than having to kind of move the instructions along as you go, yeah. you can kind of see it all in, in one go. Gosh, my hands, look, <laughs> my hands look so big, but I love that. <laughs> that is a little bit, I've got little tiny fingers and a big palm. <laughs> <laughs> um, and then I'm just going to bring in the brochure just to show you the magnification that you've got there with that. So you can see, obviously, as you lift it away. But if you're wanting to actually read a whole of a pamphlet, then you can kind of bring that all together there. And I just love our, our fabulous curtain behind us. Looks even better. I was wondering this. what, yeah, it was the, uh, the backdrop. <laughs> I was, I was thinking, so how is does that this... my magnifier? It looks a bit, <laughs> a bit strange. So how does this work within the system? So again, it's all modular. So that would literally, I, I'll tell you, what, I'll show you mm. that when I've gone through the other magnifying kit for the Flexi Pro. Oh, X, OK, yeah. Because uh, it actually works really well with that. And we can do some examples. Uh, Sounds that. good, so, right. Um, where if I show you, if we go back to so this is going for the the pro, which is kind of the 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 heavier duty. Uh, the heavier duty the heavier duty, the second okay. bundle we were going Perfect. through earlier. So the mega bundle, uh, pro, flexi pro X. If I just get that out of the Wonderful. way, now, just start confusing you get yourself myself. ready with that, because sorry, I'm just throwing in all these questions. Yeah. So if you get yourself set, um, don't forget with this system, if you've got any questions that you're wanting to ask that we're not asking here in the studio, you can get involved. Send us a message through. If you've shot for this previously and you've actually been using it, let me know how you've been using it. Has it been in your craft area? Has it been in your home? Have you been taking it up into the loft? Have you used it in the garage? Have you used it in your shed where there's no power? So if you're wanting to go out, there and let's face it it's getting darker and darker the clocks are going to change soon it'll get darker even sooner um, and you want to take that portable light with you then this is a brilliant system for you to work with now with this it's a rechargeable unit um, so you're going to plug it in you've got the U a usb cable that comes with it um, and that we know how portable that is it could be that you've got one of those usb plugs that you could just plug it into a socket at home could be charging it um, maybe from even from your computer anywhere where you have got Got the ability to plug it in in the um, car wherever you need to even a power bank if you've got one of those power banks you could use it as well and that is the beauty of this system and it allows you to do all of that I forgot to ask as well once it's illuminated if you've got it on the full illumination what sort of length of time can you use so it, it for? runs for three and a half hours on full power oh you did say that didn't you say and then and hours. seven hours on the half power setting yeah. per charge even the half power setting it's still like if you wanted to use it just to put an intense amount of light where you're actually working yes, it would yeah. It's, it's, it's a lot of light, but you also you can actually set it back and floodlight an area as well. Love it. Uh, a few extra little details on that as well. So the, the for longevity of this, so the the um, the battery it comes with a one year warranty. Okay. So anything happens at all, I just repair or replace. Um, but it actually has a um, the battery's got a rating of 500 charges before it should affect the runtime. Oh. Okay. Uh, so and that doesn't mean that after 500 charges it'll stop working. It just means like mobile phones yes, and so on. Yeah. Batteries eventually um, go, but you um, and it, the, the LED chip in there. Uh, has got a rating of 50,000 hours, which is a very long time. And at, what, bit of a, at which point should you start recharging it? I mean, this is the other thing. Do you let it run out completely and then plug it in? You or don't does it need, matter? it doesn't matter at all. Oh, okay, fair uh, Obviously, if you don't want to completely let it run out, then yes. just when it, obviously it's got the four stage indicator on the back there. Uh, and when it just gets down to one bar, that means it's running out. Time to um, plug it in. Yeah, plug it in and just uh, Fair enough. It charge back up again. Okay, okay. What did you want to show us? Right, next? so the next kit on the magnifier comes with the same magnifier I was talking about earlier. Okay. So two and a half times with the four times in the middle. 
They do come with these little protective cases as well, by the way. Uh, that's not just to protect the magnifier. That's I recommend using them and just putting them over when you're not using them, just in case, uh, obviously, from any direct sunlight. Uh, that's causing true. Very yes. important thing with magnifiers. Get about that, yeah. Um, but it comes with that. So this other little kit comes with two goosenecks. Okay, can I just move okay. this out of the way? Just yeah, so this is touch. designed for the larger bundle, okay. the Mega Bundle uh, Pro X. Now, so what you get in this kit, you get another small magnet. Okay. Um, you get two. That's actually a bonus that I'm doing. The actual kit that you probably see, I've actually started doing this just from today. Oh. I'm throwing this one in. Right. Uh, you get two, two goosenecks yeah. rather than just the one gooseneck from the previous magnified bundle. You still get the same little divider. Lovely. Um, and you get the magnifier. Now, what this means is you can independently off the stand, well, there's lots of different uses, but the first use, which is being very popular, is you can just drop this down on the magnet on there. So it's like a, ver a lar much larger version of what we were doing with the, uh, off, off the stand with the other magnifying okay. kit. And this just means you've got a much further reach. So this can be out much further out of the way. Right. And you can get the light really far into where you need it. And again, you've got that situation where you can use the magnifier separately whilst getting a lot of light right where you need it. Perfect. But again, you've just got much further reach from yes, there. Yes, yeah. You could also just use them directly off their magnets. Yeah. Um, and you can also have them, if I actually just set this up quickly. Well, so many different here. combinations. So many different so combinations. Spend hours and hours just playing around Obviously, with Obviously, because this comes with the larger gooseneck there, you can just put the divider on here. And then you can have one of the goosenecks or you can have oh the two thin goosenecks up there. You're almost lighting up next door now. <laughs> um, and oh, wow. So this could be, again, clamped. So there's nothing in the way on the table. It's just yes. clamped to the side yeah. of the table. And you can arch this in just where you want it from there. Is there a point and where you should stop adding the goosenecks? Yes. I mean, you'll notice that what I'm just displaying here is pretty much at its limit. OK. If you started putting more goosenecks on uh, here whilst putting the light on, you'll find that it would just it would then start drooping down. Okay, but nice the setups that I'm doing will actually hold the light and the magnifier anywhere you want it. So again, this, yeah. you can get the light just where you want it. Um, and then you can choose the right amount of magnification from there as well. That is very And again, these goosenecks do what you want them to do. Uh, it's always good to just uh, make sure you tighten the threads up before using them. Okay. And then it will just hold, again, completely hands-free and completely not getting in the way. It's solid, it's sturdy, that's the key thing. It's not drooping, it's not the clamp, it's kind of loosening as you, you're working. You, you know that that light and that magnification is exactly where you need it to go. What sort of feedback have you got from people that have not only invested in this system, but when they see it as well? Um, the exact feedback that I was hoping I'd get, because I was working on this for a while and um, speaking to lots of people about it, um, but I didn't know, obviously I do a lot of exhibitions and shows, and I actually launched this at the Festival of Quilts, oh, uh, yes, the NEC, yeah. and I was, I was really bored over by the feedback I got. Um, and since then, I've, I've, so I've, I've since then done a few exhibitions. I was yeah. knitting and stitching shirt at the Ali Pali. Yes, um, yeah. When was that? Last week, the week um, before? It was last week. Uh, yes. No, just over Not last week, the week, week before. My other half was there yeah. as well. <laughs> so, yeah. um, and uh, so I even saw people there that had bought it back at the Festival of Quilts, and they were, yeah, I've been getting some really good feedback. And that's what I really love about doing exhibitions and shows is, A, talking to people about how... They use their lights and the yes. problems they have, and that gives me a lot of ideas, but also I get a lot of great feedback. Absolutely. And I love the fact that it's a true light as well, because obviously if you're working with fabrics and, and threads and yarns and things like that, you need to know that the colour is realistic. If you're trying to match threads to um, fabrics, sometimes you can get some really kind of ooh, dodgy looking um, results when daylight is available to you. But with this, because you've got that bright um, white, that true light that you've got with regards to this, that true um, colour, you know that you are going to get that perfect um, match with regards to the colours um, when you're working with them. So that's a large magnifier. Okay, right. So this has just been uh, a very popular addition to this kit um, because, well, I mean, you can use it in any of the different examples, but 
this, when you, can you pass me just the large magnifier? Just oh, the, the, yeah, that, there that you go. There. Okay. So this will, if I just screw this on to here, so this is obviously just an add-on okay. as you buy as an accessory. Um, details of which are going to pop up on your screen, so if you do want to shop for this one, you can. So it goes straight into the gear snack. So it just screws direct, directly in there, as the other ones did, or just like did. Now this means you've got, if I get something, if I just okay, use that. Okay, can you use that? It's great for just blocking out one big area so you don't have to keep on moving the magnifier yes, around. Yeah. You can get a lot of light right up close. And then you can just choose, let's get the camera. You can choose the exact right of magnification you need for your eyes there. And then it just holds. Uh, so some people might be, whether they're reading a book or a cookery book or just they're wanting to, they're doing well, some we've craft. Just had and a Becky, Becky. Becky's just come up with a fabulous idea. Becky's um, working on our cameras today for us. Um, when people do uh, doing eyelashes, because sometimes you've got kind of like a, um, a magnifying glass, which you have to kind of move around. But with this, you've kind of got that large coverage. So it's kind of the whole of the eye area that uh, you could be using. Yeah, as well, yeah, so yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> that is, is like saying, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah, so, I mean, <laughs> last night. I, <laughs> um, but it doesn't matter whether, I mean, whether you're using it in a crafting environment, if you're using it in um, an electrical environment, which let's face it, some of those little boards that we looked at are tiny, tiny pieces that you're looking yeah. at with regards to that. Model making, I'm thinking of our, our very own Dave Bradford, who's is kind of his model making, little tiny pieces with regards to yeah. that as well in the construction. Cross stitch patterns, maybe, that you're following, or even even if it's just a case of that you, you you kind of got I have to I wear contact lenses but sometimes when I'm reading something that's got very small print then I have to kind of put my readers on as well but sometimes when I'm looking up I don't want my readers on um, because I'm watching the TV and it's like your glasses are on they're off and you're just so frustrating with something like this I wouldn't need to worry about my readers because when I'm looking at the area that I need to read I've got the magnification and then when I'm looking at and having a conversation with people or watching the TV then I don't have to worry so it makes life less frustrating I think that's the phrase of this one Brilliant but, but again that magnifier can be or either the magnifiers can just be screwed up you can use it on it just on its own if you want to you can have to make a really long gooseneck and put that on the ends um, there's just so many different uses. I can't wait to, find, to hear more from people who are using it. I think that's the key thing as well. Um, I even had, uh, you can also, uh, with this kit, you can also put this one, uh, this magnify kit over your shoulders by using oh, right. it together with this kit. Uh, and if you have the large magnifier, you could also put that one over your shoulders. It's uh, it's not a fashion item, <laughs> um, <laughs> but uh, it's been very popular with certain, I mean, some people say, I don't want to put that over my uh, shoulders, but um, some people, funny enough, I get a lot of um, podiatrists. Oh, uh, come up, uh, have, have made a beeline for it, so I need that uh, because okay. there's just different solutions where they go to people's houses and yeah. they need to deal with people's feet and they don't have much light and then suddenly they've got this magnifier and light right in front of them wherever they and go. And again, could you show us how it kind of comes around your neck? Because this is the brilliant so, idea of this one. So this again, it's just when you're doing something right in front of you. And again, it's not a fashion item, but it's, it's very handy at home. Just what you it's need very, it very to practical. Do, yeah. But you just turn the light on, angle the light where you need it. Now to, to make this kit, when in the actual kit, it does actually come with this little screw here. I'm, okay. lot, so I'm not blinding people. Um, when you're putting this together, so you, you, you in each of those bundles, if you have it with the magnified kit, you have three of the small goosenecks. Okay. Uh, you have two of these 270 mil goosenecks and one 225 gooseneck. Mm -hmm. And you put them all together with the 225 in the middle. And the, the magnifier goes onto one side and then the light obviously screws onto the other side. But to screw the light onto the other side, you need to change the thread. Oh, is this because you've kind of got your innies and your outies? Yes, your innies <laughs> and your outies. That's one way of putting it. And, um, and uh, you just need to change that one from a, a, an innie to an outie. Um, and uh, that screws in there and that just enables it to go on the other side. Perfect. Uh, and then you can just obviously just screw unscrew that one. And yeah. you, if you have the large magnifier as well, you can screw that one and that you've got that big magnifier. Well in front of you so solid uh, and it's brilliant as i say it's an investment to start with which we appreciate which is why we've got your split pay on this but once you have got that um each time we see guy back with the different attachments you can like well i've got that so i can get that as an additional element as time goes on and you will find yourself collecting all of these different pieces incidentally a guy's been showing us around that starter kit which has got the phone holder if you've shopped for this before and you've not actually got the um the, the kind of the, the phone holders all of those additional 
little bits and pieces are available on the website. But we've got about kind of 20 minutes or so. Should, should we take it back to the beginning and have a look for so anybody that started, just joined us? Is that all yeah, right? Yeah, no, of course. Should I go through the starter bundle then? The Please do. X. And that's the details that we've got on the screen. This has been one of the most popular ways that you guys have been getting involved with this as well. So um, the details are popping up on your screen. So we've got two different kind of starter bundles. Lots of you going for the one that we've got the details up on the screen. And you've got your three split pays on this one as well, which makes it nice and easy for you to, to kind of get involved with just £26 for that first payment. But the modular system that we're going to see in action kind of echoes throughout the whole of the Glowforce range. Um, and this is the key thing. It's a modular system. You'll start off with a starter kit potentially, and then you'll add to it as time goes on. But the starter kit, sometimes you might think, oh, I'm going to just get the light and that's it. No, you're not just going to get the light. You're going to get everything you need to get started and a lot. Um, and that's what you've got here. So, right, so the, in the starter bundle and the starter kit, you've got the light. Again, it's the 1,000 lumen battery rechargeable daylight work light. Runs for three and a half hours on full power. So that's full power there. And then when you want half power, you just press it twice from the, from the go and then run for over seven hours on that setting there. That is brilliant. Seven again, hours from that half setting, which is still very bright. It is very, very bright. And, it's, and it tells you on the back there again, how much power it's got. So it's got a four-stage little LED indicator. Okay. So obviously four, four blue lights is, means it's fully charged. Perfect. And then when it's only on one light, it means it's running out. Um, and when you charge it, it will start flashing on each light until it's, uh, until it's fully charged, which means it's all, all uh, four blue lights. And it comes with a cable for you to recharge. It comes with a charging cable which you plug into a USB outlet perfect okay. and, the, and it's a USB-C lovely uh, so that's the actual light and then in the start but you get the 220 uh, sorry 270 mil gooseneck and the 225 mil gooseneck which can be used on their own or together okay so and they're and eight. that relates to the length of them yes yeah, okay. so that just means you can either have it at the shorter version if I just put the shorter version together first okay so again it all just screws in together so some people just might want to use the light just to carry it around and just drop it down there and have it at that, yeah. that length. Yeah. And then they'll put it on the magnet somewhere. Uh, it's a very strong rubberized magnet. And then some people just drop it over their shoulders at that length. Uh, and then you can take the magnet off. Uh, you can screw on the extension okay. for an extra reach. So that just screws And this is all there. included in that starter kit. You're getting a lot. And you get the little dyno clamp as well. Again, that just screws on there and enables you to clamp it to shelves, tables, anything up to five and a half centimetres deep. And it does clamp onto misshaped items as well. Perfect. So that's many different uses from that kit. You yeah. can either clamp it at that length or the shorter length to things. Uh, you can use it on the magnet at that length or the shorter length, and you can use it on its base. Perfect. Or over your shoulders. Lovely. And you're also going to get the phone holder as well. And so you get the phone holder. So again, to. at that length or the shorter length, you can clamp the phone, your phone holder to, or your phone to things uh, hands free uh, uh, off the stand, off the magnet or the clamp. Brilliant. It's all about choice, isn't it? So that is your starter kit. So if you're wanting to get hold of that one, um, at £78.99 if you want to pay for it all in one go, or you can spread the cost, as we've mentioned, if you wanted to. You've got your three split pays on that one, £26.33p. So that's your starting point. Um, we have got another bundle that um, you can go for, which is the large one that we're going to be looking at. And again, still a modular system, still the same screw fixing with regards to everything. So if you've invested in one, you're going to be able to work with all the different different components of the different elements, just putting them together whichever way you so choose. So how is this one different? Right, so this one has got the bigger base, the bigger metal base, a bigger magnet, a much bigger initial gooseneck and a much stronger gooseneck. So why would we need these on a bigger right. kind of format? So when you are using, if I have a light to go on this, when you are using it on the tabletop, mm -hmm. uh, so it's got a much sturdier base, and you've got a much further reach from the base as right, well. Right, yes. Um, uh, that just means yeah, you've got that further reach there, but also if you're using it on the magnet, you've got a further reach. Uh, but then it comes with a clamp as well. So then you can actually clamp that onto the table and the gooseneck will just screw onto the clamp there. Now the clamp Literally on just this like occasion that. is different. This clamp is for something that's kind this of... This is for flat surfaces, for tables or workbenches. Okay. Whereas the other clamp is very good for like misshaped items. Or, but it can also clamp onto shelves and surfaces. Incidentally, if you're looking at this set and thinking, yeah, but I actually want that to the diner clamp as well, you can get hold of that. We have got those available to purchase separately yeah. if you want them to. So the little diner clamp will fit into the small gooseneck. So right. this kit comes with the extension gooseneck. 
Uh, it's just put. So again, this extension just screws onto there. So this is one of the clamp here, onto the clamps onto the table. Here's, here's one I made earlier. Um, uh, and then you've got this far reach there, which has got the 450 mil gooseneck and the 225 mil gooseneck. So going back to the previous kit, uh, the, the, with those two goosenecks put together, the small goosenecks, that's as far as you can reach out. Right. But with this kit here, you can then put this extension on to get that reach. But you can also buy, as an accessory to this, this kit, you can also buy one extra extension oh, and I make see. it even longer. Um, so the actual again, screw fit, the fittings, are they all the same across the whole range so or do they vary? They are, are all the same. The only difference is the where the big um, table clamp yes. clamps into this big gooseneck, which I said, the, the end of the, this big gooseneck, that either goes into the table clamp or the big magnet, that is on an M8 thread. Right. Everything else is quarter inch UNC. So you'd need to start off with what comes with this set and then yes. kind of beyond and you, that and you add, add the other bits in. Okay. But then this means you've got a really far reach if you needed it to get even further dis distance off this is the workbench. And that has also been quite popular. Isn't it brilliant? Um, and you've got that brilliant bright white light that you can see there with that. Again, it literally positions. I mean, I've said this many times, sounded like a break but it does. No, <laughs> to reiterate, it, it positions exactly where you need it, completely hands-free. So, how did the whole kind of concept and idea evolve? I mean, was it was it a case of that it was your own selfish need to start no, with? No, no. So, um, it's, so it's quite quickly. So, I originally again designed them for electricians, plumbers, and mechanics. Yes. And that was uh, I've been doing work lights for quite a while. Um, uh, but I noticed it was mainly rather than getting just bright lights because uh, they create shadow and so on. It's more about getting light where you need it. So I came up with the eye lights and I made it modular and I had a few different attachments. But there was a real problem seeing people like electricians working on the consumer units and they're trying to hold a torch with one hand yes, yeah. whilst they're trying to work with one hand or mechanics yeah. doing the same thing or Holding plumbers. A torch in their mouth. Yeah, and, and like it's that. just not convenient. <laughs> so it really somebody needed something that really positioned the light so it's not in their eyes. Yeah. Uh, it's not creating shadow, it's just getting the light where they need it. And then, so I started this, that's why they started with these magnetic goosenecks. Um, and then I realised it's not just them that need to get light in the awkward yeah. spot. So I started developing these clamps uh, and longer goosenecks and extension goosenecks for more like craft, sewing, yeah. woodworking, um, model making. Uh, hence why I've started doing the magnifying range now, yes, very specific yeah. for, the, for those um, different areas. Uh, yeah, so and I keep on, I, again, I do lots of events and shows and I get lots of ideas and people, problems people have and then it gives me ideas to come up with something new. There you go. So if you've got any ideas, um, yeah. look out for Guy at the exhibitions <laughs> and uh, yeah, run, run them over to him because that's where the ideas come from, isn't it? People who are using the systems. Yeah, yeah. I do yeah, enjoy brilliant. doing it. Fabulous. You're doing a brilliant job with it. So, yeah, keep Thank it you. coming. Thank you. Um, and of course, a relatively new company to us here at Hobby Maker, but I know um, very much welcome. Lots of you have been shopping for it today. Don't forget, we've only probably got about 10 minutes or so left. So, if there's any questions that you're wanting to ask, then do make sure that you are getting those questions in before we say goodbye to Guy, because I'm not too sure when he's new, um, due back with us. And I would hate for you to miss out on these. But it's a brilliant idea. Um, seeing it being used, I'm thinking there's so so many different scenarios at home. I mean, you're talking about the, the, having the light in the right place. I remember um, David working on, I think he was working on the car, um, and I had to hold the torch. And that <laughs> is the case. I start off and I'm holding it right where he wants, and then in about 30 seconds, I've got a bit bored of holding yeah. it, and it kind of dips down. And he'll say, um, move it, and I'll go, where? And it's straight in his eyes, and he's like, <laughs> now you're blinding me. And these are scenarios that many of us will kind of come across. So having a tool that's going to make it so, so easy for you to get the light exactly where you need it. And it's a safety thing as much as anything, isn't it? You can concentrate on the job in hand. Yeah, exactly, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's the thing. It's reliable, reliable Good light. word, good yeah. word. Yeah. Um, so you've got your magnets that are going to attach brilliantly, as you've seen. You've also got that gooseneck with that as well. And, of course, you can go on and add in the magnification if you do want to go for that in a variety of different sizes of these. I can't wait to see how this grows and grows as time goes on. Yeah, well, I'm, I'm looking forward. I'm already excited about uh, launching some of my other items. And all of my future products, well, at the moment, I can say any of my future products because they're the ones I'm currently working on. And I plan to make everything still fit with the same modular aspect. So anything you have at the moment, for example, I, I know my next products I'm launching will fit 
so your, this range will fit onto the, uh, the new items. Love it. Absolutely brilliant. Brilliant idea. Um, and this is going to be perfect. Um, and this is a perfect introdu um, introduction because obviously when we finish here at Hobby Maker, um, we have got Gem Collector, which takes up our position within the schedule. And if you want to get really close and check out your gems, this is a perfect system for you to actually be working with. And we've got Emily who's uh, joining us in the studio. What you got coming up? Oh, I've got so many fantastic opportunities tonight. It is, again, still the celebration of the 19-year birthday of Gemporia. Uh, I'm obviously your accredited gemstone professional here at Gemporia and I'm so excited to bring you the best gemstones that we have within our vaults. Uh, tonight, well, coming up in about seven minutes, I actually have a massive 8pm showcase, which is a mystery gemstone bag. It's a bag, literally one of the best value for money bags we've ever done, where we bundle together a fantastic selection of stones to kick off your collection with the best value for money as well, because it's guaranteed to be under £20. Uh, then we have at nine o'clock a massive mixture and a deal of the day coming up as well. We have some of the fine finest gems in the world at industry beating prices and of course I'm in there live so that you can ask me any questions uh, you can send in any requests and I'm here to support you through your gemstone journey so I'll see you there very shortly I love it and I've got to say I love this shirt I need one of those shirts amazing now you don't have to do anything when you finish watching us here at Hobby Maker just stay where you are maybe grab yourself a cuppa and then you'll be able to see all those fabulous gems come to life during those three hours now I am going to be back with you in about a week's time but here at Hobby Maker we will be saying goodbye to you when we get to the top of the hour at eight o'clock um, of course we have our nighttime shows running through until we are back with you tomorrow at one o'clock tomorrow afternoon the whole host of other fabulous goodness um, but the last thing I would say for anybody that's thinking about getting hold of this system guy and they're not too sure I mean we're gonna bring the starter bundle back up this is a really good place to get started with I mean starter bundle it's pretty obvious yeah really, yeah, it? yeah it is yeah again because if you ever wanted to upgrade to having the larger version you could always later point uh, come to Hobby Maker and buy the larger clamp uh, maybe we can add that on for the next show uh, the fine. clamp on its own the larger gooseneck again it's all modular and all these parts uh, are available so yeah you can just uh, upgrade to whatever kit and some people literally do make up their own kit uh, yes. so these are recommended kits but again when you buy one of these kits uh, especially when you buy one of the kits with the magnifying kit you can make it into so many different combinations you've got so many different goosenecks and different type of clamps and magnets and so on it's the um, lighting version of lego really, it is it was Meccano, somebody said the other day <laughs> yeah. um uh, but yeah, you can make up all sorts of different things. Like some people like, decide to have the big clamp and then the little clamp actually yes. fits on the other side and they use it to hold other things in place. Yeah. That dino clamp uh, also... There's a good, can you pass me oh, that yeah, there? There you go. Thank you very much. Lovely. Well, also, it's got a male and female. We're in here and out. We're going to use that from now on. Whichever you like. <laughs> um, we'll screw on there and you can actually use it to hold other things in place. So it's like having a, an extra hand. That is brilliant. Um, and there's one other thing we haven't mentioned yet, actually. What's that? The tablet holder. Oh, we're not actually so a tablet that, holder. If you oh, use oh, a gosh. tablet. Um, Completely forgot about this one. And so, again, like the phone holder, okay. this is an addition. Um, this will screw on. It will fit pretty much any size tablet. So, again, um, if you're watching tutorials and things. Um, oh, yeah, wow. tutorials or just being ladies watching Netflix. Yeah. Or, <laughs> you <laughs> just, could attach just the wanna, table or something. It's, well, it? again, there's so many fittings yeah. that you can either, if you've got the larger version, the, 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 the um, mega bundle, you've got the big table clamp and you can put it on here. Uh, and then, obviously, hands free, have it positioned where you want it from there. Or you can use it on its stand. Some people do that when they're in the bath and they just yes. have it just <laughs> next to the bath. <laughs> many, many. Really and again, idea. you can use it on the magnet. Some people have uh, put it uh, or just uh, put it off the magnet, off the gooseneck, off their uh, oven hood when they're watching something. I love it. It's brilliant. Many, many different uses. Have again. you got social media? Can we see all these different combinations and ideas? My social media is a work in progress as well. Ah, I, it, it's just about it to start. Is. It's just about. I've been very, very busy, but I'm just That's getting fair, some help with that soon. And I'm, I've been problem. told, I keep on getting told I need to start doing a lot more with social media. Oops. But please, do follow me yeah definitely uh, look out for glow force and it's, within the next few weeks there's going to be lots of content being perfect i love it there. thank you thank you very much it's been enlightening it's been, yeah, thank you very much <laughs> um, do stay tuned got lots coming up from gem collector we'll see you back here at one o'clock tomorrow on hobby maker